Hey, bruh. Hey, bruh. What it do? What it do, y'all? It's that time again. It's that. It's time. Fighting at the red corner. Outskirt TV. What it do, Boko, Rilla, Fox, 12 hour God of War hype. Let's fucking go. Man, this man putting pressure on me, bruh. I'm just here trying to have a good time, but this man is like, Hey, bruh, you better pull up with a 12 hour stream. <laughs> alright, hold up. Let me pull up the death counter real quick. Cause like, uh, alright. Um, cool. Yeah, we got like a death counter right now. Uh, so, you know, we, we, we have only died 33 times. But it is what it is, man. Uh, what's up guys? Welcome to the stream. My name is Oats. You're watching Watch Oats Curry TV. And today I would say is part two of our first playthrough of this mad difficult game. We are playing this on the most difficult setting of all time, right? Uh, give me God of War, uh, difficulty. It's only reserved for real men, bruh. No posies allowed. No posies allowed, baby. Oh shit. Just literally a continue button. Alright. Fox says, uh, how's life treating you today, my dude? I got a big ass cup of coffee, man. I think I had like four hours of sleep last night. Uh, but I'm good, you know? You know, I gotta say, like, I, I, I do look forward to playing games like these, right? But like, sometimes I get tired, like, during the end of the week. But I appreciate you showing up, man. And shout out to my boy Boko. Shout out to Rilla. Shout out to everyone pulling up coming through holding your boy down you're sipping on coffee yourself uh i got ucc coffee japanese coffee it's like instant i didn't get the good shit i didn't get the gourmet shit what coffee you got bro wait what was i supposed to do again i think i gotta look for like some fucking flowers or shit right man it's really bright in here i was kind of expecting to go into like a really dark world kind of shit jesus you got gourmet dark rose? Damn. You want to taste of that shit, right? When you buy things, you want to taste them, right? Uh, I think like... You know, I don't have a machine to make coffee. So I usually have like... I usually scoop the instance like coffee from the from the thing. I like her. I mean, she lives under a turtle. You are too open with her. We do not know if she can be trusted. She hasn't tried to kill us. Yet. Yet. Instant coffee can be a vibe. Yeah, man. I mean, like, I, I try not to get too deep into coffee because I got seriously, like, really addicted to it. Like, I couldn't function without coffee for a while. And I had to drink, like, six cups a day just in order to feel myself. But, um, yeah, man. It took me, like, I think six months to wean off coffee. But now I'm back, back, uh, back on the, back on the drip. It does the job. Yeah, it does the job. I mean, on top of coffee, I have... I'm, I'm taking, like, medication, right? So I'm, like, really, really, really fucking focused. Like, if I wasn't focused right now, like, I would be talking an hour before I start the stream because I wouldn't even know, like, why I was here in the first place. Okay, let me practice a little bit, all right? Oh, I can't... I can't do my attacks here. Whoa, look at this. Man, this bitch is a fucking hoe, man. She's like, she saved that like fucking pig and she was like all about like animal conservation, con conservation ship. And then she's like overfishing the fucking river. Damn, she a fucking hoe, man. Look at this shit. I mean, she's living alone, man. She's not like, like feeding a whole family. Like all this fish, she, she, she like fucking, man, she a hoe. I don't trust her. Whoa. Should we go see the front of the turtle? Um. Uh, yeah, I don't think you can go to the front from the side. I think you gotta go through the the door. Can you help me? I can't quite get it. Get what? Where's he? Oh, okay. Come on, man. Quit being a little bitch. <sighs> Would this help? I dropped it? When you were chasing the animal. What's wrong with me? 
Damn. I like that. If I lost it, then you did lose it. He's he's being hard on himself. I like that. I like that. My boy growing up. My boy a tree is going up. You better boy. I can do the Kratos voice if I really tried. But it's really difficult to do it for 12 hour streams. Boy. Boy. I think like, yo, my voice been getting uh, like uh, deeper, man. Ever since I, you know, when I was a kid, my voice was like really soft. I'm, I'm still pretty soft spoken, right? But ever since I've been smoking, you know, for 10 years and then I quit for another 10 years, I have this voice, boy. I think it's also all the alcohol I drank, man. So we're going to go back in. Sup, ho? I saw all your fishes over there. You're going to eat all of them? They're going to be a fat bitch? Damn. How exactly what I need. Damn, Shadi's like kind of ratchet, bro. She got like them like hood tattoos all over her arm. You know, like like so giving weed to this pig. Yes. Then we are leaving. Wait. Hey man, I don't get paid for Not this work. Thanks. Yo, I'm gonna out get my dicks up. Come on, girl. Oh, the fuck is that? You want solitude? This mark will hide you from those who might make your journey difficult. Oh yeah, he doesn't want her to tell Atreus. Luna. Yo, she gave him the berserk tattoo on his neck, bruh. Damn. Do you trust her? Hell no. I don't trust no hoe, bruh. Fuck out of here with that. Himalay. She's appropriating black culture. She got dreads and shit. There's a shortcut below wow. the house that leads safely out of these woods. Follow this path down, then head towards daylight. Damn, she's a culture vulture, bro. She's not about that life. She got she got dreads, but she don't have any Jordans. As Fuck out of here. As as you like. Now get out of here. Come, boy. Boy, you're not supposed to be nice to women. That's how we. That's not how we do it in ancient Greece. This underground passage should put you back on your path up. to the mountain. Just use the boat. Wait, and take this. You can use it to orient yourself and navigate the world. It will always steer you towards your goals. Ew. Hey, what's good, bro, dude? She treats the turtle like a house, not a living thing. Yeah, she a hoe, man. I mean, like, the turtle just wants to live, bro. Like, turtles gotta eat, turtles gotta fuck, but she was like, hold up. You know, you're gonna stay right here and I'm gonna make a house out of you. That's selfish. That's selfish. Selfish ass, ratchet ass hoe. I don't trust no one. The only one I trust is me. Such a pretty game. Yo, but what it do, bro, dude? You been uh, putting in work this week? No? Every day I'm hustling, hustling, hustle, hustling, hustling, hustle, hustle. I wish I could play some real music, man, but unfortunately. Oh, wait, I have enough points to get like this one, but I don't even know if I want this one. This is kind of stupid. Okay, R1, 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 R2. I'm just, I'm just trying to like remember like some of my moves. Been putting in work at work and Destiny 2. Come on, bruh. Why are you still playing an old ass game that like tries to steal your money? You know what I mean? Come on, bro. Flush that game. Flush that game and play a real game. Hey, what it do, new dark saint? Welcome back. She at least feeds the turtle that with what all the fish is for. She needs to work harder. Oh, yo, but that's like animal cruelty because like. The turtle doesn't eat fishes. The the vegetarian. Yo! Mm -hmm. My curse! Thank you so much for the raid, bruh. Uh okay, wait, maybe they got caught in an ad. Oh wait, yo, what it do, bruh? Man, I feel so bad because I, I don't I don't I haven't returned the favor. I I couldn't raid you because our schedules are so different. But uh welcome back to the stream, man. You guys, everyone on my stream, please go to my curse channel and drop a follow. Otherwise, this relationship is a wrap. 
What's good, bro? Hey, yeah, you follow me, man. But I, I, I want to return the favor, like to raid you back. But, uh, I unfortunately like I always forget to raid, and I don't know like what time you streams. But I'll check you out, man. Thank you, bro. And everyone following Mark Curse on that raid, appreciate y'all. Y'all doing God's work, following your boy, spreading that love. You know, and like I said, right, everyone on my channel better drop my cursor follow, you know, show him that love. What's up, Sunia SG? Another Singaporean viewer? Yo, welcome. Welcome to Singapore. <laughs> welcome to Singapore. I, I got I gotta pull up my loading screen, man. This is all for all the Singaporeans out there representing Singapore on Twitch. You know what I mean? Wrapping the Lion City. You know, I just realized that when I added that animation for my cat, it kind of mirrors the the fucking Merlion. Because I got a cat like uh, last year. She's really adorable. Uh, you know, she's growing up really well. She's putting on weight. She's two years old. She's beautiful, right? It's kind of mirroring the Merlion. It's like kind of like symbolism, right? They symbolism full circle. Uh, you know, I think like this, this weekend I'm gonna work on my emotes because I've been seeing like people post emotes in chat that are animated, but I gotta animate my emotes, man. I gotta make them extra, like special for you guys. You know, um, thank you, my curse. I appreciate you, man. And, uh, you know, thank you. Thank you guys for joining my curse on that raid. Uh, if you guys don't know, my name is Oats. You're watching Oats Curry TV. And this is my first playthrough of God of War, and I'm playing it for the first time on the PS5. So I've been streaming for about five years. Oh, my bad. Four years. Four years. Yeah, four years. And I'm a variety gaming streamer, so I play a variety of games ranging from God of War to Barbie's Adventure, Elmo's Funhouse to Dark Souls, Animal Crossing. You know, all types of games, man. Yeah. Hey, take care, Malkers. Thank you so much, man. I hope you had a have a great meet meeting. And uh, yo, I catch you later, boy. Catch you later, boy. So uh, yo, Sunia, are you also a streamer or you're a viewer? And uh, which part of Singapore are you from? And most importantly, do you support the PAP? Oh shit! Wait, wait, wait! How do you how do you attack again? Oh fuck! <laughs> Oh, how do you how do you play this game again? Wow, I don't know what to do. Wow, he broke my fucking shield. Mom used to tell me about them. Didn't think they were actually real. Dude, I I forgot how to fight. They give people nightmares. Oh, you from Marcus's stream? Cool. I don't remember which. You're welcome. Welcome, Sunia. Hope you're enjoying the stream. And uh what were you guys playing earlier, uh Sunia? Am I pronouncing it right or is it Sunia? Sunia or Sunia? Damn. Yo, this is kinda whack, bro. Like I really fucked it up. Like, um I'm just back here and I need to warm up. Sunia, cool, 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 cool. Damn, Sunia. Sunia. My name is just one, um, you know, just one syllable. Oats. Or if you want to go extra fancy, you can say Oats Curry. Damn. I need, I need some health, bro. Whoa, you got like some hex silver in the pots. Yo, fuck your herbs, bro. Okay, wait. Can you like hit this? Uh, that didn't work. Wow. Yo, I think I'm finna die pretty soon, man. My health is like really low. Whoa. Okay, I just gotta practice my parry a little bit. Nice. Give me your loot, bitch. Yeah, give me that health. Damn. Yo, I wish they had, I wish this game had like a warm-up room or something before you come in here. You can like uh practice a little bit, you know, kind of like shake off the rust. Oh. Isn't that heavy? 
Dude, yeah. why? That is a stupid question. Have I mean, Atreus has literally seen Kratos lift up a fucking tree, and now he's asking me like, "Yo, is that shit heavy? What you think? What you think?" Damn. Fucking disrespectful ass kid. He wrecks a discipline. Oh, can I hop across? Ooh, they got a treasure over there, but I can't get it. Wow, okay, wait. I think we gotta push this into the water. Wow, Atreus is like literally sitting down, lazy ass. Okay, let's do this. Can I kick this? I remember I remember from like back in the day you can kick shit and like you can charge them and kick them. I'm I'm kind of glad that God of War still keeps up with the tradition of like pushing heavy shit, you know. It's always like encouraging people to lift. Damn. Damn. Do not touch the water. Do not what? touch the water. Do you know what is under the surface? No. It's pitch black. Exactly. Do not touch the water. Yeah, man. This kid is dumb. So we got one of the face masks. So uh, how are we going to get to the other side? Oh, wait. Can we hit this? Yo, that doesn't do shit. So how am I going to get that? Okay, wait. Maybe like... We gotta come back here next time. Follow me, Atreus. Follow me, Atreus. Man, he's a goddamn liar, bro. This kid. Yo, let me look around, man. Maybe I can bust this shit wide open. Okay. Can I hit this? No. You know, what I what I want to see from a game is I want to see, like, completely destructible objects. You know what I mean? I want to see, like, shit being able to be broken open. Maybe we can chop this shit up. Nah, no, can't. Um, Alright, let's get across. Ooh, they got treasure over here. It's a big one. Wow. You know, whenever Kratos struggles to open a chest, you know it's gonna be good. What the fuck is that? Talisman on of concentrated vitality. Yo, why did they why did they put like heart symbol over that vitality talisman, bruh? Is that like ancient Norse Viagra? Damn. Okay, so I got like something called a, a memento from Kratos' diseased wife, and this is called. Whoa, you can gain a burst of health. Really? God damn. This is so dope. It's like free healing, but I, I guess you got to recharge and shit. Wow. Yo, from what I heard, like in this game, like sometimes the drops are like kind of random. And if you're going to survive the hardest difficulty, aka the, the hardest difficulty I'm playing right now, you might need a little bit of extra help. You know what I mean? You just can't like decide to wake up one morning and play this game. You got to have skills like me. But you gotta have a little bit of extra luck. Yeah, I gotta, I gotta try this shit, bro. Wow, my health is healing. Well, it healed a little bit. Okay, wait. I think it needs to recharge. How long does it take to recharge that shit? Yo, I probably can upgrade this talisman if I go back to uh, bro. Damn. Okay, I gotta practice a little bit, man, because my, 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 my shit was a little whack. Roll. Roll. Light. Okay, light heavy. Light. See, this is a little whack, right? If you immediately do the heavy after one light, he does it, like, way too slow. See, one light and... Look at that heavy, it's too slow. So next time, uh, I gotta do two lights and one heavy. Or maybe three lights. That's quicker, that's quicker. So the more lights you do, the more heavy you can ex expect. Ooh la la. Okay, wow, this place is beautiful. Oh uh, shit. Give me some help, bitch. You know, imagine like the witch like coming here and she's like, God damn it, Kratos. Fucking up all my shit. Damn. Yeah, we gotta try to get over there. 
get over here. <laughs> you know, like since I got a PS5, man, like I've really been thinking of like going back to playing like fighting games. But <laughs> if I want to play fighting games, I got to like, you know, I got to do it right. There. I got to like, uh, you know, get myself a hitbox or like, you know, it's kind of like an arcade stick, but it has like buttons on it. Now we'll get to the mountain point. I just can't believe I'm here doing all this. Damn. There was a time I thought I'd never leave our woods. Or even my own bed sometimes. You were not to blame for your sickness. Oh, I know. I guess I'm just saying. Damn. This is great. This is like camping with the kid, bro. Uh, yo, how are we gonna get across, bro? I mean, can I even park my boat, like, nearby? What's the, What's good? Yo, I don't think we're allowed to park over here until we able to destroy that, like, this thing. Yo, they got a chest here and everything, bruh. Okay, hold up. I wonder if this game actually saves, like, like efficiently, like, Dark Souls. You know what I mean? It's like, Dark Souls is like, you don't even have to worry about saving because the game does it for you. Yo, I can't park over here, bro. Damn. Yeah. What the fuck? What's that? Oh, let me try heal again. The talisman has recharged. Nice, Sue. It gives you a nice health burst, but it, it, it's not the best, like, talisman, to be honest. Like, if I'm being re really real, like, uh, the best talisman is the, the one, like, you know, Kratos did, dead wife gave him. Hey, what it do, big boss? What it do? Welcome back to the greatest stream of all time. How you doing, man? Uh, big boss, I need your input on something. Um, so I can actually have a new sub badge. For people that have been like longer with, like they have been subscribed to the stream way longer. So I can actually upgrade your sub badge to another tier, right? So, uh, I, I, I need everyone's input, just not big boss, right? Like, what do you guys think of the sub badges? Like, do you guys like the sub badges or would you feel like it's better if you like have a different looking sub badge? Like, would you guys prefer to have like, you know, trophy looking things or metal looking things? Or, you know, you, like, because currently, like, my, the idea for my sub badge, I know it's kind of, like, self-serving a little bit, but it's, like, my avatar, and each time, like, people been subbed longer to the channel, the avatar upgrades in terms of, the, like, you know, his gear. So, if you've been subbed for, like, a year, like, you know, Big Boss, you get, like, the gold armor, right? And then, like, my avatar has a beard. But it could be anyone's avatar, right? It could be yours. It's not just me. So... Uh, I could, I can upgrade the avatar one more for people that have been subbed for two years, right? But I don't know how to make it look because I don't know how to like make something better than gold. Maybe I can go like platinum or diamond or something like that. But yeah, how would you guys like the sub badge? Like, do you, do you guys prefer like the sub badge as it is right now? Or should I completely change the sub badge to like uh, medallions or trophies and stuff like that? So, you know, everyone's input is like welcome in chat. Um, I'm going to be spending time during the weekend to work on the emotes to try to animate them. I couldn't do them last week because I've been working really hard on the uh, thumbnails for the YouTube channel. You know, so in case you guys like miss miss out on like, uh, you know, you guys miss out on like uh, the, you know, like the, 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 the stream, right? You guys can watch like the, you can see like the video on YouTube. So I created like amazing thumbnails like this, right? And I, I did thumbnails for all the games that I'll be playing. That's why I couldn't work on emotes. But this weekend, I'm going to try to work on the stream emotes. I'm going to be working on the stream art. I'm going to be trying to animate, trying to make things like more beautiful. We need a solid snake iteration or Raiden. Raiden's a little bitch. Hell no. Uh, bosses, I like what you got going on now. I, I'll have to think about you can add for longer subs. Yeah, because like... I mean, like, boss is definitely qualified to get, like, this, the two-year, like, upgraded shit. Because, like, I, I don't know what to do with it. Like, I was kind of inspired by Witcher. So, I, I was thinking, like, maybe the next level after the goal, 
sub badge is to have like a dude with white hair and he's glowing eyes and he's like ah you know he has like like light coming out of his mouth and shit like that uh but you know if you guys think like i could revamp revamp my entire sub badge or if you guys have like particular looking like oh you know i've actually thought of replacing one of my emotes right i thought of replacing one of my emotes with iq 190 what you think <laughs> And it's like animated, right? It animates like big brain and then IQ 190. Big brain IQ 190. Do you know what I mean? Cause your boy be the smartest, smartest streamer on the planet, yeah? And, um, yeah, or, or you guys have any other emote ideas? Like, I could totally be down to replace. Uh, so, like, you know, let me know, like, what you guys think, man. Like, cause, like, at the end of the day, this is all for you guys. So if you guys feel like there's an emote that you would like to have that, you know, if you are a subscriber and because like you'll be using my emotes all over the place, right? And if there's an emote that is really helpful for you guys to use on other people's stream, it, it conveys your emotion. It makes you like look kind of cool or kind of funny or whatever. Let me know what kind of emote you like. It doesn't always have to be with like my avatar because like, if you guys look at my emotes they're all based off my twitch avatar right it's like you know i didn't have any other ideas of that shit you know one of my ideas right now is the the iq 190 um but if you guys like want something else you know let me know that like, it can be something totally different foxy's resident evil hitman mgs souls themes are always cool and fitting for the games you stream damn should i like put like a souls like a uh, sub badge that's like two years um, but I mean, like, you gotta talk about it in context with, like, the emotes and, like, I mean, like, just in terms of reward, right? Like, what you guys want as a reward. Oh, and also, like, what I'm really gonna do is I'm gonna write a wish list. Um, let, hold up. Like, I, I'm prepared for this, right? I got that pen and paper, right? Um, so a, another thing that I noticed about my chat is, like, you guys are accumulating channel points. But you guys are, you don't have anything to spend it on, right? Uh, what are some things you would like to spend channel points on? Like, you know, I was thinking like once, like, you know, you guys have enough points, I can, you, you guys can like ask me for a prediction. Like, I, you can be like, yo, Oats, um, am I going to get a girlfriend? And I'll, I'll be like, yo. exactly that's what i can do right so if you have enough channel points i can give you a live prediction right yo it's like uh for example right like if you guys are watching sports you know you have enough channel points and you can ask me a question yo are the patriots gonna win uh, or uh, you know is tom brady gonna get an eight ring and i'll be like the answer is no yo tom, yo fuck it this thing's disrespectful as shit, man. Tom Brady ain't gonna win an eight chip. The GOAT? Come on, man. Yeah, eight ball would be sick, right? I got like a sick, sick eight ball. Um, scare alerts during horror games. Yo, that's cool. Okay, I'm gonna write that down. Okay, scare alerts during horror games. Scare alerts. Yo, I'm putting my body on risk for you guys. In horror games. Okay, uh... Okay, eight ball and channel rewards, right? Well, channel chat point rewards. Chat points. Yeah, so let me know, man, like what, what you guys want to really see. Um, I mean, because I'm sure you guys probably watch other streams and you feel like, um, you know, they do certain things that make their stream fun. Uh, and like, I, I want to do that for you guys. And I, you know, I, I really feel that. You know, I, and I gotta say, like, I do apologize. It took me so long to try to, like, ask you guys these questions because during the last one to two years, I've been seriously learning the craft of becoming a content creator, right? So I couldn't focus on small little details like this because I was learning how to edit videos. Um, you know, I was even learning how to, like, put that death counter over there. I was learning how to, like, make my mic sound better or make my webcam look 
crispier and shit like that right so i i couldn't have enough time to like focus on the tiny details but like right now i kind of like have that out of the way like i have like you know my my video editing on lock i have my youtube on lock i have um you know all the basic stuff done right and now right now i just want to focus on giving you guys like a better experience yeah so keep thinking about it fox and anyone else have any ideas shoot there's there's no such thing as a bad idea right so even if you think i should like replace my emotes with something totally different it's not it, it has nothing to do with my brand it's not avatar related it could be like you guys like to see some metal gear emotes or you guys want to see like i just want to know what you guys want because at the end of the day it's about you guys like i'm already doing what i want which is like play my games right and being myself and banning whoever the fuck i want right but you know i want you guys to like what what channel rewards you want what you want to be on my what you want to see on my streams and you don't have to be a subscriber right so even if you're not subscribed to my emotes and you want to make suggestions go ahead right i'm 100 percent down for whatever you guys have uh you know you, uh and you know here's the thing we're gonna try a few things out right like if you guys suggest something you know and we're not i'm not too sure about it i'm gonna try it anyway right because you you never know. You never know. Don't knock it till you try it, right? Bro, this is you like the diamond oats curry idea. Bronze, silver, gold, diamond, platinum. Yo, you right? You right? Okay, diamond, platinum. Uh, But, I mean, like, what kind of, like, sub-badge would you prefer? Would you prefer, like, that like that character avatar? Like, you, you guys can see Big Boss sub-badge right now has, like, that gold helmet thing, right? Would you guys like that? Or would you guys prefer, like an emblem you know like one of them league of legends like you know if you guys ever play like games where you like uh you know you're climbing the leaderboards i mean you, you see those emblems that are like beautiful they got wings and shit and it's gold and it's like dripping in like ice like what do you guys think do you guys want that or would you do you feel it's more personable if i add like my avatar shit like that so let me know man like just feel free i'm, I'm gonna write down all your stuff right here all right and I'm going to work on bettering myself because I, I'm really doing this for the love of the game. You know, I mean, like, I don't give a fuck about being famous and all that. I just really appreciate you guys always like, you know, holding it down for me, showing up on my streams, having a fun time. And I just want to make your 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 experience even funner. But don't worry about me, like, you know, not being myself anymore, because that's a whole different ballgame. I've always been myself. Uh, cool. Uh, you know what? Let's say like, replace the talisman. How do I replace that shit? I think it's under armor. See, this talisman like allows me to heal, but it takes really long to recharge. But the talisman that my dead wife gave me is like, it has eight defense, 12 luck. So it's pretty baller. I, I think this is better. Uh, how do I equip this? Luck of Ages. Wait, how do I equip this? Oh, wait, do you have to equip it to your armor? Uh... Wait, 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 how do you equip this shit? Okay, I can compare it. Oh, do you have to equip it? Shit, I can't equip it. Is this broken? I'm pressing the X button. Oh, you cannot equip another talisman while the cooldown is active. Damn. They they, they are on to me, man. They think I'm cheating. Personally, I like the changing avatar. Gotcha, gotcha. Thank you, bro. Appreciate that feedback, man. That's really uh, nice of you to say. But I mean, you know, you guys can be as honest as you want. Because at, at the end of the day, it's like... It's not just my channel, it's like everyone's channel. Like you guys enjoy being here, so you know, as long as I can make your enjoyment a little bit better, uh let me know, man. Follow the compass to your next marker. Okay, cool. Yeah, yeah, my way was Whoa! How do you know? Do you not smell it? If that smells Did you smell What the rock is cooking? 
It doesn't matter what you think. Yo, anyone here like uh you know watch the wrestling from the WWF era? My favorite wrestler of all time, like I mentioned, is Eddie Guerrero. Damn! Anonymous, thank you so much for the gift sub to Fox. I appreciate that, man. Hey yo, Fox, I hope you enjoyed it. Sub badge sub emotes. Say a big arigato to Anonymous. AKA your boy, AKA. Oh fuck. God of thunder. That's right. I never thought you'd listen when Mother spoke of the gods. I seldom did. Did she speak of one who could feel no pain? Oh. That sounds like Balder. Balder. An Shit! So Thank you, Odin Anonymous! And Odin is king. Odin. That's right. Why do you ask? Yo, shout out to my boy Anonymous, man. Uh, yo, bro, dude, I hope you enjoy your sub badge and sub emotes. Guys, welcome to the Oats Army. Okay, that. Do you guys see that shit? It looks like a. It kind of looks like that snake from Sekiro, bro. Damn, this even the snake on Se in Sekiro is like working in this game, bro. The con the, the economy is like fucking horrible. <laughs> the economy is horrible. Yeah, we know who it is, Fox. It's your boy. It's your man, and we love and appreciate you, bro. Thank you so much for your generosity. I'm gonna take all your proceeds and improve the stream. Damn, this is Thor. Thor in this game has like a beard. He doesn't look that young. He doesn't look like the Thor in the Marvel movies. His hammer is kind of whack. Like, I kind of prefer the hammer in like, uh, what you would call it, like Marvel. Well, what the fuck? Uh, okay, yo, let time to change the talisman, man, because this talisman is whack. I guess I gotta upgrade it. I gotta, like, I guess it's only, like, it's level one. It lowers your defense and decreases your luck. It's gonna whack. Whoa. Uh, shit, it's really foggy and shit, bro. Uh oh. Okay, so we gotta go there, right? I'm just following the compass up top. I think I see something. Just sitting there in the middle of a lake. Investigate the glowing statue. Cool. Ooh. I think it's another statue. Man, they got like some big ass statues in here. Oh, it looks like a dude with a sword. Or maybe that's his dick. Damn, that looks like some Dark Souls shit right there. I see rooms there. That looks like Artorius. Can't quite make it out. Hey, read that boy. Looks like the Joker wrote that shit, right? You know, ha ha ha, Batman, I'ma get you. It reads, sacrifice your arms. Is the, to the brightness too the high? Water. Awaken again the cradle of the world. What? Throw our weapons into the water? Guess that won't be a problem for you. Okay, do you think the brightness is too high? I could Are lower you it. Gonna do it. <laughs> okay, after this cutscene, I'll, I'll test it out, Fox. The axe did not return. Oh fuck. Maybe just a little could be my settings. Got gotcha, you, bro. Got gotcha. you. I told you, man. That snake from Sekiro is working in this okay. game, man. Wow. What is the this? Fuck. Hey, bro. I ain't ready to fight this thing. Why do they call it the World Serpent? Ew! Chickity check yourself before you wreck yourself! Wow! Stay calm, boy! I am! This is great! The fuck he's saying? 
don't want to speak for everyone. You, you might have a point, Fox. Yeah, Mom said he's friendly. What is it saying? I don't know. Wow, what we were. There's a shipwreck way over there. See that? And there's a statue of Thor. Except I can see a lot more of him now. The water dropped and the serpent rose. Oh, oh. that must be why the beach wasn't there before. See? Naruhodo. And there's the mountain. Look it. That building leads from the foot of the mountain to that golden temple. It was all just under the surface. Except for the statue. Good thing, huh? There's even a dock. There. Next to the flag. Yo, fuck a flag, bro. I wanna go do some some other shit. It's so cool. We're going to the dock first, right? Hey, what it do, our meds? We'll be the first people to walk on it. And who knows how long? You know of that serpent? He's one of the giants. He's so big, he's wrapped around the whole world and bites his own tail. Wow. Okay. Hey, what's up, our meds? Oh wait. Uh, okay. Let me see. Uh, you might have a point, Fox, because I bump up the the brightness to really high. And the reason. Why is, um, I would say, like, my screen is a little dark sometimes. So, wait, let me see. Video. Screen calibration. So, yeah, the brightness is at 85. So, when it started, I think it's at, like, 50. But I can take it down. Uh, let's try to take it down to... 70. Let's just see how it looks. So, it was at 85. Take it down to 70. Oh, is it better? Kind of looks better. An exaggeration. Looks really good. I don't know. Look pretty big to me. Pretty big. Like my dick. Ah, right, cool. So, um, it looks better. Yo, appreciate it, man. Appreciate the feedback. It's good now. Yo, shout out to my boy Ahmed's, bro. Yo, where you from, Ahmed's? Oh, good. I was hoping we might explore a little. When we wish to continue our journey, we know The whites look a little washed up before. I got you, got you. Damn, it looks like really crispy right now. Algeria, cool. Damn, watching all the way from Algeria. Shout out to all the people in Algeria, man. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. I hope you had a good 2021. But, you know, we're going to bring it hot for 2022. By the way, uh, Ahmed, if you, uh, if you like the stream, I hope you, uh, you know, can click that follow button. But more importantly, you know, just take a look at the rules, man. You know, no backseating, no hints, no tips. Because I'm a badass player. How do I get up there? Shit. I mean, I got some money, but... Oh, wait, I didn't read the, the, the serpent bio. Yeah, I was too busy, uh, adjusting the setting. You're right, I totally forgot. Hey, good looking out, man. Okay, wait. Map markers indicate interest in a map can be filtered into category. Sh thanks for the rules, boss. L2, R2 to the map markers by category. Merci beaucoup. Damn. Get that. Get this tutorial out of here, man. Okay, wait. Um, Artifacts. Treasure maps. Journey. Codex. Oh, there it is. Um... So, what's the thing? Codex, Bestiary, oh, World Serpent, here it is. Look at this drawing. World Serpent. We just woke up to the World Serpent on Midgard. Father thought he was going to try and eat us, but mother always said, your Mungander was a friendly giant. He tried speaking to us, but I couldn't understand him. I wonder if that's the language all the giants speak. He doesn't seem very interested in us right now. I wish I could talk to him. I have so many questions. Where did he come from? What does he all do all day? What does he eat? Maybe we can find another way to talk to him. Cool. I guess we I guess we gotta get oh, we got the Witch of the Woods. Wow, he really draw her really good, man. She even got the dreads. We met a witch in the woods who knows the old magic. Turns out the magic boar is her friend. 
She was mad that I shot him at first, but we were able to save his life. She lives under a giant turtle creature who's also her friend, and she seems really nice. Oh, there's even a drawing of Brock. You know, whenever I think of the, the name Brock, I think of like, you know, two things. I think of like Pokemon, like, you know, Brock, the first gym, uh, the first gym leader, and like Brock Lesnar. We met this dwarf on our way to the mountain and he's a blacksmith. A famous blacksmith apparently. He made the Leviathan Axe. He upgraded for Father too. He was a little rude and grouchy, but I kind of like him anyway. I hope we see him again. Cool. Okay, so I think I pretty much read all of these. Oh wait, this is the one I haven't read. Brenna Doddy. This is the second troll we've seen so far. I had no idea they were so close to our house. They have never bothered us before, but I guess we should never bother them either. Mother said I e ever saw a troll, I should run the other way. Guess she said, never said that to father. Um, if these things do mention, okay, I think we read the other ones. Yeah. Cool. Man, I can't go up this thing right now. Hey, you welcome, man. Don't worry about it. You know, and I personally want to read it. You know, I, I'm all about the lore. Whoa. That is like so God of War, man. Wow, look at the snake. Uh-oh. You see that glowy shit up there? Damn, you two are meds. Shipwreck. Well, yeah. I wonder why it crashed. Maybe the gods smite it down. Ooh. How do you shoot this thing? Wait, 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 wait. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. How do you shoot this thing? I mean, this is like one of Odin's spy birds, right? But I can't park my boat here. Can I get up? I can't get up for my boat. I guess that's for later. There's something up there. Oh. Wow, we got Aegir's gold by hitting our boat on a corpse in the water. The fuck? Aegir's go gold. You know, there's a very deep fascination with gold in all civilizations around the world, man. And it's tied to like uh, ancient alien theories. Because like, we only discovered that gold was incredibly conductive to el electronics and uh, it's very gold. It's very, it's very good. Like a lot of our like, Equipments in space are coated in gold. So if you think about it, like why are the Mayans and the Incans and the Norse and the Greeks and the Chinese are so, even the Indians, why, why are we so obsessed with gold? It's because we have like a connection with ancient technology. Does this thing explode? That thing looks like it explodes. Okay. That could be valuable. Ooh, abandoned ship. Exploring the Lake of Nine, we found this beautiful figurehead. It may be all that's left of a ship that once went on great adventures. I wonder if there are more among these wrecks and beaches. Maybe Brock would give us some hack silver for them. Cool. Oh, we can get him from here. First try, motherfucker! Get that shit out. Oh, no. Yo, this finna be a portal, right? Oh wait, hold up, what is this? I don't know these rooms. If we find a cipher, I bet I could figure it out. Shit. Well, what if I blow this up? Is there even anything inside here? I thought this shit was explosives, but it, it ain't shit. Oh man, I bet this thing will like teleport us into a secret like room or shit. But there's gonna be like, like shit that was gonna try to kill us. Okay, let me try open this. Oh no. Ready yourself. Oh my god, this thing's like level six. What the hell? Wow. I can't, I can't parry these guys. That was one hit! What the fuck? That's death number 34. How did he even hit me? I, I thought I got him. 
Oh, this thing was shiny a, a second ago. Yo, I can't parry this guy. He he has that red red thing. Oh fuck! What the fuck? He hit me the instant he came out. Yo, this is okay. Yo, maybe we're not ready to fight him, man. I've never seen like a a drogger that is like level thirty five. Uh, yeah, maybe later. I don't want to like die over and over again for no reason. I'm I don't I guess okay. Wait one more time. Yo, I can't- I can't fucking- Okay, yo, check this out, right? So one guy hit me, I dodged away, and the other guy poked me as soon as I recovered. Holy shit, okay, I, I can't do this. Yeah, yeah, okay, let's- let's not do that for now. Yo, it was insane! I- I dodged one guy, and the other guy was ready to hit me as when I came out of recovery. Like, how am I supposed to do this? Okay, later. Okay, wait, uh, maybe let's try again. One more time, one more time, one more time. Yeah, these boys ain't playing, man. Oh! Wow, they're in sync. Okay, okay, you saw that? You saw that? You saw that? Like, as soon as the guy was about to smash, I rolled away, and as soon as I recovered from my roll, the other guy was already ready to hit me. You guys see that? That was insane. One hit, one kill. Nah, we can't do this. Not right now. And I'm not even damaging them. It's gonna take me a million years to even, like, kill them. I'll come back. I'll come back. i see you boys later, man. They, they straight up cheating. They don't appreciate greatness. So they are player hating. That was rough, man. That was fucking rough. Is this where the game gets fucking hard? Patience and real time aggression are the key. Yo, but like, that was crazy though. Man, is it gonna be all like this though? I hope not. I mean, that felt like a really optional guy. Oh, there's another crate. Ooh, 300 hack silver. That's a lot. New boat dock found. Hold the show on map. Okay, I got it. The dead guy. Ooh, what we got? Ager's gold. Damn. Uh-oh. Secret? Someone gifted a sub. Thanks whoever did it. Anonymous did it. Thank you, Anonymous. Okay, so we can... I guess we can park over here, I but... Yeah, I see it too. Okay, let's park over here, I guess. Damn. Hidden area discovered. Isle of Death? Oh my god. Shit, I don't know if I'm ready for this, man. I already got my ass handed to me, like, back there. This is like a dead end. Guess we gotta climb up here. Wow. Hey look! A torch! A torch is built with wood. That is a brazier. A brazier. A brazier. Hmm. Brazier. It looks like there's something written on it. Want me to read it? Sure. Go for it, kid. Kavakia. 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 Oh fuck, not Be again. Ready. Oh shit, someone's throwing projectiles? Damn. Oh, these guys are level 3. Oh wow, shit. Holy shit. Damn, nice. Can I like, can I return? Nice. Nice. Oh, 
Wow. Okay, we can practice our parries. Oh shit! Wow, that was that was rough. Okay, 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 chill. There was one hit, man. God damn. Okay, I'm dead. Wow, that was rough. This is getting harder, bro. I never fought like so many projectile throwing bitches. Can we try again? Maybe that's why they call it the Isle of Death. I was playing really sloppy. I think I should have like, like roll more. Hey, look, know? a torch. A torch is built with wood. Okay, read, read it. Brazier. Hey, read it, kid. Brazier. Hmm. I can't fight with regular like like, like weapons, right? Ridden? Because these guys are like reavers and shit, some shit. Oh shit. Dude! Wow. Oh shit. Wow. Can we even fight with the axe? Oh wow, 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 wow. This is so painful. Wow, that guy's level 4 already. He health, health. Wow, that's crazy. Wow! Or maybe we should move in story. Yo, yeah, you right. These guys are so strong. Okay, so I have like half health and the guy built a shield and he exploded the shield and destroyed all my health. That is insane. Okay, I'm gonna try like one more time. Welcome to God of War. Yo, this is like hardest difficulty, so I kind of expected that. But this is, that was really challenging to begin with. And I think you can attack them with the axe. It seems like they die from it. So I don't know why I wasn't attacking them without it. I thought they were like the, hey, the other guys. A torch. a torch is built with wood. That is a brazier. A yeah, it's brazier. great training. Yeah, I don't mind dying a little hmm. bit here and there. Looks like there's something written on it. Want me to read it? Oh, okay, I forgot to use like the other moves I got. Nice! Nice! Oh, nice! Oh, what fuck? Holy fuck. Okay. Okay, okay, chill, chill, chill. Okay, whenever they build their, those shield things, it's kind of bullshit. Okay, we got it, we got him, we got him. Okay, okay, not too bad. Damn. Wow, we did it. We fucking did it. What is that? A spirit. It's Holy shit, that was rough. Okay, this is called a Hell Shadow Scout. It ha it acts like a shadow, but uses ice magic instead of seer magic. Definitely a hell walker. Thank you. So with these guys, I realized like um, I mean obviously you gotta kill them quick. But like when they build that shield with ice, it's very dangerous to attack them with it. Because you think that, oh, I just have to break that sh that ice thing. They can explode that ice thing and it's not even clear. Like that's the craziest shit ever. I've never seen an enemy create a sh uh, like an ice wall and explode it. That's fucking crazy. Thank you. Thank you, Fox. But the thing that I can kind of confuse them for, I, I kind of confuse them with the other guys that, you know, you can't attack with your axe. Well, don't be shy now. Ooh, Death Stranding. You're dead? <laughs> You're very perceptive and reckless. 
Take caution when lighting these braziers. Sailor and Hellwalkers will swarm to the flames like moths. Damn. I assume we have you to thank for freeing us from a watery grave. Us? Other spirits. The Lake of Nine is full of them. Oh, okay. Most so there's a lot of fights to, to be had. From this realm. I guess I get like some we, EXP. Lucky few are stuck here in Midgard until our affairs are in order. Perhaps you can help them as well. Cool. We have no desire to help you. Spirit. Damn, Kratos cold ah, as fuck, but man. You already have. I only wished to see the sky again. Farewell. Damn. Wow. So you're trapped here. Ooh, we got something called Versatile Warrior's Handle. It's a common axe pommel, increases strength, defense, and luck. Wow. Crazy. Yo, it is better than what we got. So the one that we are equipped is the Wooden Grip. And it only gives us one strength. But this one we get two for strength, defense, and luck. Cool. Okay, let me equip that Talisman of like, Concentrated Vitality. I want to heal. He disappeared. Come. Nice. Let us not be distracted. Ooh, oh, we got some health here. What is this? Damn. Yo, it's definitely doable, man. Can I blow this up? No. Um. Whoa. You can like slide all the way there, but why would I want to do that? Okay, let me think. Oh, wait, how do I get this treasure chest? Damn. I guess, like, maybe I'm really, really not ready for this place yet. See? There's another location here. Oh, I guess you can't really do anything. It's just there for aesthetics. But maybe you can really slide here. I don't know. Nah, I don't think you can. Oh, there's a bomb over here! Look at that! Wow, sick. Treasure? Oh, wait a minute. Look at this. You can climb up the ship. Totally doable. Yeah, it was a totally doable fight, man. Oh, what is this? Pack silver? Solid Swalterheim Steel, World Serpent Scale, and Symbol of Menace. Okay, so we got something called Symbol of Menace. Is that like a... Is that like a thing? Uh, go to sockets. Oh, look at that. Symbol of Menace. We get a vitality of two. Pretty cool. Oh, okay. So we got 1700. So let's like upgrade ourselves a little better. Oh, so apparently you can upgrade Atreus. Okay, but I already bought his shit. Yeah, the rewards look pretty worth it, man. Um. Okay, maybe I should do some shield combat shit. While barehanded and evading, hold L forward and press R1 to perform a quick attack. Uh, you can stun enemies. Uh, what is this? While sprinting barehanded, perform R1 to perform a running haymaker that sends enemies tumbling into the ground. Ooh, this looks pretty cool. While sprinting barehanded, press R2 to perform a powerful shoulder ram. But this one costs like 2000 um, EXP. I need like 300 more. Switch stances by pausing momentarily after any barehanded attack. Once in a new stun, press R1 to perform a powerful uppercut. Press R1 again to perform a following up slam attack. Okay, wait. Damn, that's pretty cool. You can switch stances in the game, like kind of like Tsushima. Once in a new stance, press R2 to perform a leaping shield attack. After the shield attack, press R1 to perform a follow-up slam attack. Damn. Requires vitality 200. Okay, guardian shield. This is for rage combat. 
Uh, okay, what other skills we got for the axe? Perform attacks in quick succession without sustaining damage to power up the Leviathan Axe. Oh yeah, this was pretty cool. Yeah, so if you don't take any damage, like, your Leviathan Axe is gonna, like, inflict frost damage, which is cool. Uh, while evading, hold L forward and press R1 to perform a quick axe attack. Okay. Uh, what is this? Range combat after landing a precision throw. Oh. Okay, so if you press triangle during the flash to recall the Leviathan Axe. Wait. Okay, wait, what's this? Aim and hold R2 to charge up the Leviathan Axe, causing an explosion on impact. Seems pretty cool. But I think I might want to get this. Cause it's more like a it's more like a passive shit, right? Like if you like just uh you just don't take any damage, it's gonna be cool. Okay, uh, yo, we out of here. But I think we're gonna be back here because like we need to get oh, get that chest. What about this one? No. Oh, look at that! There's another thing here. Wow, look at that! So whenever you see gold stuff, you gotta like look for um, you gotta look for uh, you know. You gotta look for bombs. Okay. So, I... Wow, every time I think I'm done with this island, there's like something else that there... Okay, wait, let me climb up. Maybe there's something that I missed out. Like, maybe there's like a... You know, Odin's like a... Bird bitches. Okay, cool. Damn, the music is a little ominous right now. How do I climb down? I can't climb down. What the hell? Can I not jump down? Uh oh. Did I broke the game? I I can't climb down. I can't climb down. What the hell? Uh, do I have to save and reload the game? Is this a bug? Look at this. I can't climb down. They, they, they're not even going to give me the button prompt. Okay, wait, let me save. Uh, options. Save. Uh, okay, can I load? Okay, let's see. Yeah, it seems odd. I think it's like, uh, yeah, it's, it's just a weird bug, man. I think it happens, you know, if you have a game like this, which is like pseudo open world, you know, it's shit like this is gonna happen, you know. I might be like one of out of a thousand people that got this bug. Okay, bet money I can go down right now. Game unplayable. Uninstall. <laughs> see, now now it's there. You see that button prom? But okay, you know, all these things are not destroyed yet. Look at that. I gotta re-destroy these things. Crazy. Wow, do I have to like open up the treasure again? Oh, it's already open. Okay, cool. Yeah, alright, cool, 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 cool. <laughs> Uninstall, come on, bro. Okay, yeah, we, we took this, this stuff already. I wonder what causes the bug. I mean, being too awesome could be one of it. Alright, man, let's go look for other shit. Cool. I wonder why would they put this thing here? Is there something we can do? There's something green over there. It's tight. 
Okay. Uh, let's go. So, I guess we should keep an eye out for other spirits. What did I say about distractions? But it sounds like they needed help. They are spirits, boy. boy. Dead things. They have no needs, only wants. Damn. It feels wrong to ignore them. You will get over these feelings. <laughs> Mom would have wanted to help them. What was that, boy? Nothing. Damn. I thought as much. I thought as much. Um, is that a place? You got some crates up there, but. The world serpent's even over here. I told you he's big. Damn. Yeah, he is here. Uh oh, this place is kind of blocked off. How do I. How do I access that thing? Oh. He's like blocking a particular path. Maybe we're not ready for a path. And maybe we'll be ready like once like we do a certain amount of things. But I'm just like traveling around, you know, just trying to like, you know, look for uh, any uh, secrets. Whoa, what is that? Okay, here we go. Uh-oh, this looks like a combat spot. If there's treasure, there's gonna be combat. Fuck, look at that thing. That thing looks ferocious. Wow, level three. Oh, I can't block. I can't block. Holy shit. Okay, I, I dodged too prematurely. I, I, I dodged too prematurely. You can't even parry that big guy. That's crazy. Nice. Okay, cool. Nice. Oh shit! I should have dodged. I should have dodged. I should have dodged. Nice. Thank you, Atreus. Atreus totally distracted the guy. Oh shit! Damn, he's trying to level up, man. This fucking guy. I'm not ready. Oh, you can parry that one. But you can't parry that one. You can't parry that one. Okay, he dead. Damn. You know, see, it's it's doable, but you gotta like do it like really perfect. Yo, what's good, Ahmed's? Hey, it's another brazier. I suppose you wish to light it. Can I? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. We gotta we gotta open up that chest first. <laughs> Eyes of Odin. Okay, we got we got two um things to smash over here. Where's the third one? So there's always three, right? Maybe we gotta climb up there. So one, two. And where's the third one? Uh, okay, maybe it's up there. Yeah, let's try to climb up first. I'm not going to read that thing because I think that's going to spawn some enemies. Whoa, you got a chest here. Hex silver? Oh, abandoned ship head. Hey, no, no backseating, Ahmed. I don't, I don't want to know what you know about this game. Don't help. Do not help. If you help, you you will get banned. But since you're new here, I'm gonna give you another chance. Don't do that. Hey, it's a fragment of a language Ooh. cipher. Must Felheim cipher piece. Cool. Oh, the third one is behind it. Yo, Ahmed, if you spoil this shit again, you'll get banned. Don't do that. Just let me play, man. You, you've you already played that game, right? This game, all right? Let me play it right now. If you feel like you have to help, maybe why not just play it yourself? You know what I mean? Oh, shit. Is he going to spin around? What's that? God damn it. 
shit. Dude, this is hard. Come on. Did we do it? Nice. First try. First try. <sighs> Damn. First try, motherfucker. Don't you doubt it, Fox. Ooh, Apple of Eden. It's interesting that it's called an Apple of Eden, but they spell it differently. You know, it's like the, the Apple of Eden from the Bible, but they spell it I-D-U-N-N. -N. Now we gotta find two more. Uh, okay. Let's go upstairs first to see what's good. Because I think they're gonna spawn a whole bunch of bitches. I have no problem fighting like regular guys, but I hate projectile guys. Oh, look at that. They got some loot in the distance, but I don't think I should hit it because like, it's gonna drop there and I can't get it. You totally could have won that previous fight you skipped. No, I couldn't. Uh, because they are they are level six, and I'm I'm barely doing any damage to them, because I, like the guys that you see me fight here that are kind of doable are already level four. And see, like I I still get hit from time to time, right? But at least I can tank the hit. Yeah, how do you- I mean, there's a bucket over there, but like, if I hit it, I can't get the item. So I'd rather not hit it right now, than hit it. Oh wait, can you blow up these rocks? It feels like you can blow up this rock. But maybe not right now. Because it seems like there's a path here. It feels like all these like locations are like places that you gotta come back like two times. Okay, did I get some more EXP? Let me see. Okay, I got 900. I gotta, I gotta level up. Okay, let's fight. Yeah. Boy. Yes, sir. Kavakia. Kavakia. Oh, wait, shit, this guy. Oh, fuck. Shoot this bitch. Okay, bad positioning. Bad, bad positioning. Oh shit! Wow, they keep leveling up. Wow. Oh wow! They didn't even telegraph that move. Holy shit. That was quick. Okay, uh, this is tough because they level up if you don't kill them fast enough. It feels like I gotta kill them really quickly. Damn. Uh oh, do I have to redo this whole thing again? No, I think we good. And you can't fight with your axe because those guys don't like feel anything from your axe. Boy. Boy. Yes, sir. Okay, wait, I'm gonna switch out my talismans because like I have like the hard talisman to heal. But I think luck of ages is better. One, two, three, four. One, two. Focus on one guy, I guess. Oh shit! Oh shit, okay, okay, my bad, my bad, my bad. Oh, you saw that stab? Okay, so I just realized that once they level up, they will they will do that stab. Right? Once they level up, like to level two, they start doing that stab. It's so hard to predict. I think like you have to play defensively. 
I wonder if I'm like fighting too quickly because I, I'm trying to kill like one as quickly as possible, but it feels like they all keep leveling up, leveling up, leveling up. Like what is the play here? Like how do you like just focus on one guy? Okay, let me try again. Read that. Okay, Atreus can't read that. Kavikia. Okay, I gotta play more defensively, I guess. Okay, I gotta rely a lot on parries. I gotta rely a lot on parries. Oh shit. Okay, nice. Just focus on parries, I think. Oh shit! Okay, okay, that was my mistake. That was my mistake. That was that was my mistake. I saw him coming in with the attack, but I hit too fast. I think with these guys, you gotta play super defensive. You can't be always on the offense. I feel like with God of War, it's very different from any hack and slash because blocking is a virtue. Yeah, I need to readjust my thinking. Hold up, I'm trying to pop a zit. Damn it, bro. Occasionally, from time to time, I still get zits because my face is still trying to, like, grow hair. <laughs> very little room for error. Yeah, very little. But it's fine. You know, I you guys will see perfect gameplay every time. Once I, you know, kind of get in the mind. Because I don't even know how to fight these guys. These guys are still new to me. Yeah. Boy. Yes, sir. Okay, I gotta learn how to like dodge and like reposition myself. Nice. No room for error. Oh shit! I. Oh, okay, fuck. I'm really bad, badly positioned. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I knew he was gonna do that, but I wasn't ready to parry it. I knew he was gonna charge with that thing. Every time they run towards you, they're gonna hit you with that thing. Damn, you guys will see. Yeah, you guys will see perfect gameplay, but I don't know that those guys, that's why they're cheating. I don't know all their moves. Boy, over here. So I'm trying to learn. See? They don't even tell you where to spawn. In Dark Souls, you actually know- you can okay. see them. Okay, we gotta play more patient because I played very impatiently. Oh, he's leveling up. See? Yeah, when they run, they want to like hit you so bad. Oh fuck! Okay, okay, saw that. Okay, R one is to push them back. R two is to. You see that? Oh my god, he's leveling up again. Oh, okay, that was so quick. I wanted to parry that. I could see that coming. I could see that coming. But it almost like... You see, like, the telegraph is like a little bullshit, right? He would do this. He will run at you. 
And, you know, most enemies would do this, right? They would do this and then stab, right? But what he does is this. I'm gonna stab you, bitch. Like, I'm gonna cut you prison style. Like, you know, the shit was fucked up. Right? Like, I'm playing dangerously. I could just block that, but I'm not gonna block that because blocking is for bitches. Pairing is for gods. And your boy is the god. Yeah. Boy. Over here. It's like distance uh positioning. Uh, it's, it's distance and like like anticipation and reflexes. Oh, okay, I didn't parry good enough. Almost ready! Oh no 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 no. Oh shit, okay. Jesus, why do they keep leveling up? Oh no no no. Yeah, I'm 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 gonna die soon. Dude, I tried to dodge, I couldn't dodge. So when he hits me like that, I get stunned. I they they're not letting me dodge. I don't know why. I'm mashing the X button to dodge away. Okay, let me try again. I guarantee you guys, this is I, this is this is gonna be it. Yes, sir. I'm just learning their abilities, right? You know what I mean? Okay, I think let's not abuse Atreus right now because I feel like I haven't even used like my bonus abilities because I feel like those are like so dirty and cheating. Okay, just fight defensive. Okay, this is fucked. That she was coming i knew that she was coming okay wait wait why can i not dodge did i get stunned you saw that i saw that you saw that you saw that you saw that i saw that okay i fucked i fucked i i, I panic 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 when i saw both of them were attacking i was like okay which one which one which one i told you guys i'm a god right you saw that right i'm a beast I told you guys, like, I'm really that good. This is on God of War difficulty. Trust me. Trust me. I'm a god, bruh. I'm not even sweating. You know, like, if you, you guys should be worried if I feel, like, you know, depressed and I'd be like, Oh, no. How do I do this? But ain't none of that shit. Because there's no weakness in my body and my mind. Look here. Yes, sir. There's no weakness. Okay, don't when they level up, don't worry. Just focus on fighting. No mistakes. I panic a lot when they level up. Nice. Oh, wait, wait, wait! Oh, I can't- They've really stunned the fuck out of me. Okay, I saw it coming. Okay, reposition. This is really bad. Nice. Reposition, reposition. Reposition. Nice. Okay, I, I parried too soon. I parried too soon. Okay, I wait. You're gonna be okay? 
Okay, I fucked up. I fucked up. I got sloppy. 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 That was on me. That was on me. Uh, okay. My mind is kind of shifting back and forth between quick parries and slow parries. So this is the beauty about it, right? This game is made for parrying. Ahmed, I'm gonna ban you, bro, because I told you no backseating. But, you know, you just want to continue just backseating. I just told you no help. Yeah, sorry, man. This is not for you. This stream is not for you. I hope you find, like, um, you know, a stream that you can do whatever you want. And a happy new year, man. No hard feelings. But this is not for you, bro. It's not for you. I, I don't want to play how you play it. You, you understand it, right? You're going to play it differently. I'm going to play it differently. If you want to, you want me to play like you, maybe like play it yourself. Don't tell me what to do. <laughs> a game that forces one to think it's so precious. Boy, yeah, it is. Over here. I'm really enjoying the shit yes, out of this sir. game. I, I now have to like take my mind from quick parries to slow parries because slow parries are harder to parry than fast ones. Yeah, that was a slow carry. Nice. Oh, I saw that! I saw that, but I couldn't parry fast enough. Okay, this guy's almost dead. Oh, great. Okay, okay. My bad. I... That was my fault. I'm still getting used to it. I'm still getting used to it. I got so greedy because the, the guy on the left side, he was almost dead and I wanted to kill him so fast that I was kind of like ignoring the other guys coming in. I should have stopped. I should have observed. This game is not supposed to be fast. This game is supposed to be a little slow. Damn, I love this game. But you see like how I'm like actually handling these guys? I'm not actually like, um, you know, dying yeah. for free anymore. Yeah. I'm just like pacing myself and I'm getting the parries like one by one. Kavikia. Kavikia. Okay, and I shouldn't just use Atreus uh, because like Atreus like aggros them away from me, which is not that good. Oh shit! Okay, I wanted- I almost parried too late. Oh shit, come on, I dodged that, come on. Come on, baby. You saw that? You saw the guy dashing? I saw the guy dashing. I can do this all day. Oh, oh, I saw that, I saw that. I couldn't parry that fast enough. My brain wanted to do the slow parry. Oh my god, did he level up? Oh no, a new one showed up. Oh, okay. Okay, okay. That was beautiful. That was beautiful. That was beautiful. I was really in the moment. I was positioning myself. Uh, what was my mistakes? Okay, wait. How did I get hit? so much okay my mistakes was my brain was still adjusting between the slow and fast parry right i can see the moves coming but sometimes like my hands can't act fast enough like you guys see i was really pretty consistent right yo yeah the ben ham has been pretty active uh sin it happens very nice rhythm thank you thank you and this is totally my style of playing it's going to be different from everyone yeah i ban i ban people i ban people 
no mercy, no mercy. Just like I show these bad guys no mercy. <clears throat> and also another like, okay, another thing I kind of have to get my head around is I got to be okay with them respawning guys over and over and over again. I can't get comfortable and feel like, oh, you know, one guy is dead and then the fight is over. No, they're going to respawn more and more and more guys. I got to be okay with fighting a hundred guys. I got to really more. be in the moment. Yes, sir. Because like, as soon as another guy showed up, I was I was panicking already. The heavy is like a little bad. Motherfucker. I saw that, I saw that. Okay, oh fuck, I fuck, I fuck. Okay. I panic parry, I panic parry. I panicked parry. Fuck, you, do you see that guy like behind the guy? Okay, so I'm fighting one guy in front, right? And the guy behind was like, all right, this motherfucker's con uh, like, he's like occupied. And he starts running and he starts like stabbing and then he did that, I fucking parry that shit. But then like the guy does a slow one and I was like, oh shit, you know, I panic. It was so fucking sick. You guys see that? Yeah, I'm developing. I'm developing. I'm evolving. Guys, you guys have no idea how good a gamer I am. That's why I beat Cinecki like 20 to 2 in Tekken because like I evolve like that. I, 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 I notice your patterns. Boy. There is no yes, escape sir. from greatness. I'm gonna put you in the ground, boy. I'm gonna put some work on you. You love this process? Thank you, bro. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. But it's also all about mental games. It's like you gotta be calm. Don't abuse Atreus because Atreus draws them away from you, which is not good. See, he draws them away. Wow! My health is not doing so hot. You saw that, Perry? Okay, reposition. Nice. Nice. That was a slow one. Reposition. Perry. Okay, wait. I, I parried too fast. I parried too fast. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. Okay, there's a guy behind me. Okay. Nice, nice, nice. The, the slow parries really like fuck me up, man. Nice. Nice! Oh, fuck off. Fuck off! Okay, back up, back up, back up. Oh, no, no, I'm, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, okay. I'm dead. Father, get up! I, again, like, my brain moved too fast and in my hand moved fast enough and I, before he even touched me with the sword, I already parried and he was like, still like, yo, that ain't it, son. And he chopped me, right? As he was doing this, my brain was already like parried and my hands was like, all right, I'm gonna obey that shit. So I immediately parried, but I was like, fuck, the attack haven't come yet. And he was like, bitch. Get that back end out of here, bang. The coffee hitting hard. How do you get stunned? Uh, I think part of it is like they broke my posture. But the, the crazy part is like, they really broke the fuck out of my posture. Because usually, when someone like breaks my posture like that, at the split second, I can roll away, right? I, I couldn't. I was like so stunned that I couldn't do shit. <laughs> Yo, Sineki. Better put some respect on my name, son. It's not a good look coming as my follower saying shit like that. That's blasphemous. Blasphemous. Yeah. Boy. Yes, sir. And by the way, uh, another thing that I noticed is I shouldn't ever get scared when they level up. 
because I panic. To be honest, like a little part of me panics whenever like they they start like leveling up, and I'm like, fuck, they're gonna be stronger. They're gonna be like whatever, you know. Oh, you're right, fifty two. My bad. You know what? I'm gonna add some extra ones. I'm gonna say it's fifty five because I don't. I might have missed a few. I'm just gonna be generous. I'm gonna just put, gonna put fifty five. Okay. <laughs> This focus. Okay. It's all about positioning. It's not you can't you can't block behind you. So you gotta always make sure they're in front of you. <laughs> That's kind of funny. <laughs> See. <laughs> Nice. Okay, don't panic, don't panic. It's, it's part of the process. I saw that, I saw that. I tried to parry, but... Okay, I'm not locking on. Oh! Nice. Back it up, back it up. Just focus, just focus. Oh, oh shit, I panic, I panic, I panic. Fuck, fuck, fuck. <laughs> okay, okay. Um, this is something new. I, I have never been attacked all at once by three people. So my brain was like, which one? Which one? Parry this guy? This guy? And I was like, fuck! My hands freaked out. I'm gonna get some more water. I'm really loving this. Uh, just give me, uh, just give me a minute. I swear to God, just give me a minute. I'm going to take a piss, take some water. I'm loving this. I'm loving this. Every single fight I die, I'm like really learning something. Like, um, it's like every single time you die, you're dying to a situation that you have never faced, right? And if you don't learn from that situation, like say later, much later in the game, I get attacked by three people again. Like, how do I handle that? Like, if I don't learn it here, if I don't learn how to be like, okay, chill. Right? I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get my shit pushed in again. That's how people that suck at games, they can't play games at the hardest difficulty because they don't learn. So I got you. I got you. Just give me some water. I'm gonna take some water. Give me a minute. All right, we back in the building, baby. Yeah, the same way Madam Butterfly taught me to play Sekiro. Oh my god, that was such an awesome fight. Like, I love that boss fight. That was the greatest. I mean, defeating Madam Butterfly changed me as a gamer. Like, once I defeated her as my first boss, I'm a different. I'm a different animal, bro. I'm a different animal. I'm a different animal. Don't ever come at me like coming at me wrong. Damn. Facts, bro. I'm a different animal. So yeah. that's why I, I really welcome Boy. challenges. Yes, sir. I, I never view a game as hard and it's like, oh my god, I can't see the story. I'm stuck here. That's a that's bit shit. That's why when a game is unfair, I'll say it's unfair. Spartan kick this motherfucker. <laughs> Okay, reposition. Nice. Nice. Okay, reposition. Repo 
Oh shit! Oh. oh my god. Okay, I'm still warming up. I'm still warming up. I'm still warming up. I'm still warming up. Damn. Damn, I'm still warming up. I just got back. I just got back from using the bathroom. Quit hating enemies. I got this shit. Easy. Easy. It's all about positioning. Yes, sir. This rock in the middle is actually really useful to, if you are to be honest. Man, I love this game. Damn. Nice. 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 Oh, I saw it! I saw it! I couldn't parry fast enough. Okay, okay, I'm, I get hit. I get hit. You saw that? You saw that? Reposition, reposition. You saw that? You saw that? You saw that? That was sick. That was sick. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. You ain't on my level. You ain't on my level. Don't fear, don't fear, don't fight with fear. You saw that fucking parry? Get the fuck out of here. It's time to level up. It's time to level up, boys. Okay, it's okay, it's okay. Chill out, chill out, chill out, chill out. You saw that? You saw that? That was sick. That was sick. Okay, okay. I parried too quick. I parried too quick. I parried too quick. That was beautiful. That was beautiful. That was beautiful. Uh, my other mistake was I'm fighting a little bit with fear. Every time, like, I get cornered a little bit, I'm, like, I'm not pairing with confidence. Like, the way I played, like, Bloodborne and Dark Souls, and the reason why I became a parry god was because I, I did it so many times that I could literally walk up to a boss and parry the fuck out of that boss, right? Like, I, I think I was playing Gundir. I could parry every single one of Gundir's, like, like, attacks. Footwork's important, yeah. The animation locked worked against you. Yeah, you right. You right. Um, can I? Can I like? I, I don't like locking onto an enemy, man. Can I like like not lock onto an enemy? How do you do that? Uh, okay. Lock on camera is on. Okay, you can. I I can lock on like individually, right? But how do I like not have the the lock on automatically? I don't think they have that, like, turned on, I think. Boy. The yes, combat sir. is super deep. It's super deep. But it's only deep if you play it a certain difficulty. If you play it baby mode, okay. you don't get to experience the real shit. And I'm really learning about myself more, because these guys are, like, different, like, animals, bro. Oh, no. I thought I parried. Oh, I can't see! I'm so my mistake is I cornered myself. I cornered myself. I cornered myself. That was on me. That was on me. <laughs> I love this game, man. The moment you, like, don't re respect this game, you try to, like, coast by, it's a wrap. But once you're really in the zone, bruh, you're in the zone. Boy. Yes, sir! <laughs> One, two, three. How do you slam the shield into the ground? Nice. Nice. Okay, fuck. Why do they lock on for me? Nice, okay. Oh shit! 
Yeah, I'm panicking, I'm panicking. Okay, he likes. Good parry. Okay, okay, I blocked, I blocked. I blocked, but if two guys attack you at once when you block, my brain couldn't parry fast enough, right? So instead of like parrying, I just hold block. But if you can't block, I don't know, if you can't parry, it's better to roll than to block. Right? It's better to roll because if two if two people attack you at once and you're blocking, it's a wrap. You can probably block one guy, but the other guy is gonna fuck you up. So they're gonna break your posture. Okay, I got it, I got it. So if I can't parry, roll. Parry, roll. Parry, roll. Parry, roll. Okay, good. Good, 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 good. Here. Boy. Yes, sir. Man. What I'm really, really, really scared of is like when they start running at you and they, they attempt to stab you. Where you at? Oh wait, I, I parried! I parried! I can't roll away, I got stunned. Nice. Okay, roll away. Nice. Okay, chill. Why do we keep auto-locking, man? I fucking hate that. I keep- You saw that? The game auto-locks the character for me. I don't want to do that. Iframes, baby. Iframes, baby. Okay, reposition. Oh, wait, why? Okay, I couldn't parry. I couldn't parry. Nice. Nice. Oh, I'm dead. Shit. <sighs> okay. Okay, that was rough. Okay, what did I do that was wrong? Oh, right. Uh, the, the game keeps auto-locking me to enemies, but I don't want that. How do you, like, turn that off? Because, like, I'm in the middle of fighting people, and then they keep auto-locking me. Uh, okay, let's see. Settings. Uh, gameplay. Lock on camera. Use R3 to lock on. Yeah, that's the thing, but I don't want it to auto lock on. Camera. They have something called aim assist. Toggle assist for the aim camera. Recenter. Camera will already orient behind creators if you're hitting enemies to his left or right. Wait, 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 I don't understand. Strafe assist. Camera will automatically track anim groups of enemy when strafing. That's cool, but how do I like turn off like the auto log? Is it the aim assist? Okay, I'm gonna like look 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 it up on uh, online. How to turn off? Is it aim assist? Auto. Auto. Lock on being a god of war. I don't even remember that being a thing. Yeah, in the middle of the battle, like I'm fighting a guy, it, it auto locks him. I don't, I hate that. Oh, you can't turn it off. Yeah, you can't turn it off. It's so annoying. I don't even remember that being a thing. Aim assist is like... I don't know what aim assist is, but you can't turn off like auto lock. 
Look here. You can't change that? Yes, Damn, that's annoying. Okay. It's okay. Let's just focus. Kavikia. Nice, good parry. Oh shit, good parry. Okay, I got hit for no reason because I was like so preoccupied with getting the guy. Wow! What, what the hell happened? Okay, chill. Nice. Nice. Come on, come on. Atreus, shoot him. Well done. Uh, wasn't there like two more? Nice. All it takes is one hit and then I, I you know. That was sick. Okay. That was better. It's probably helpful for the most part. Okay, I think like, yeah, each. Can I do that again? That I don't feel satisfied. Yes. Another I spirit. don't feel satisfied. I want to fight them like 10 times and defeat them 10 times. You know what I mean? I wish the game allows you to like try it again. Okay, shit. Thank you, Fox. Hello. I can't remember the last time I saw something walk these islands that wasn't dead or corrupted. What it really mean? helps me familiarize myself with barehanded because Flex I'm not used left. to the, the Congo. more severe with each passing winter. Do you know its cause? Not for certain, but I suspect the appearance of the World Serpent, along with the great flood that followed. Many were drowned, myself among them. The dead began to walk not long after. Do you need anything from us? Boy, I only wish to speak to someone again. Damn. A wish That's you stranded. have just granted. Thank you. Give me some good beach. Ooh. Corrupted Remnant, legendary. A mystic remnant of a soul lost at sea, used to upgrade the versatile. It's a legendary gear. Wow. Wait, uh, wait, hold up, hold up. They, they said like, this is legendary, but how do I equip that legendary thing? Uh, I don't know what it is. Okay, uh, Atreus doesn't have any runes. Was it an armor? Oh, maybe it's like something that you can socket. No? I got something that they say it was legendary, but I don't know what it is. Um... Was it a talisman? I think it might be a talisman. I don't think it was. Okay, what was that legendary thing? Okay, I have 1400 right now. Maybe we should level up. Um, okay, Atreus have all the skill he needs. Uh, let's see, do I need any more shield skills? While sprinting barehanded, press R1 to perform a running haymaker. I mean, I don't like all the fancy shit. I really like like basic like parry counter moves. After R2, after performing Garden's Justice. While barehanded, hold R2 to perform a shield slam and inflict a modern a moderate amount of stun damage. Oh, this is a move. Okay. Uh, how about the X? Okay, this is for throwing. You can charge this shit up. Aim and hold R2 to charge up the Leviathan X, cause an explosion and impact. This is very risky considering the fact that, like, 
when you are throwing the axe at something, like, there's, like, enemies attacking you. You, you can't really afford to charge up. Um... In Spartan Rage, hold R1 to deliver a forceful haymaker that knocks enemies backwards at great speed. In Spartan Rage, press L1 to do a quick storm that damages and disrupts all nearby enemies. Okay. Okay. I don't really want to, like, pump any skill into, like, Rage Combat yet because I want to focus on, like, the main core movements. While barehanded hold R1 to sweep off their feet. I don't really like this one because this one is like kind of pussy. Like I don't want to sweep them off their feet because I want them to always parry, like attack me so I can parry and like deliver the slam. If I sweep them off their feet, I'm doing like baby attacks against them while they're on the ground. Agile strike while barehanded evading hold L for it and press R1. What was the point of this? Yeah, I kind of like this one. While sprinting barehanded, perform R2. This one seems like it interrupts like a lot of like movements, but this is only done barehanded. That means you must be cognitive enough to keep the, the axe and do that move. I hate this move, man. This, this move is so stupid. Look at that, right? It's like a leaping attack, but like before you attack, you're doing this stupid twirly shit. And it's not even fast. It's like slow as fuck. In the middle of your twirl, you're gonna get hit. Like the fuck? Whirling storm while evading L forward and R1 to perform a quick axe attack. I mean, that's cool, but... What is this? R1 for an axe to hit multiple enemies in a row. Oh, I mean, this is great DPS, I guess. I guess I'll get this. Um, Weak points and hit sharp press... Triangle during the flash to recall the Leviathan X, cause the next throw a melee attack to explode on contact. Okay, this is cool, I'll get this. Okay, what was that thing that I got that was legendary? Uh go to sockets. I got something legendary, but I don't know what it was. I mean, like, was it a shield? I mean, the shield don't really have stats, which is kind of trash. Do you guys remember, right? I got like something that was legendary. Was it a resource? Oh, it was a resource. It was a remnant. Used to upgrade the versatile warrior's handle. Okay, so it was a resource. Okay, I thought it was an item. Okay, let's climb up one more time and just see what's good. Damn. There sure is a lot to see here. Uh, I'm trying to look for like Odin's bird. Hmm. Yeah, I can't really blow this shit right here, right now. Uh, is there any explosives nearby? Okay, only with the axe you can do the stun. Okay, cool. Okay, cool. Yeah, you know, I'm just trying to learn, like, the abilities that I'm not using. Those moves are cool, but they are really, like, not that cool once you- if you rely on them all the time. Man, my kids are being a little bitch, man. Um... Okay, cool. Let's get out of here. Roy, what did I tell you about offering help? Offering help. Don't. Correct. Can't we this just... is not a debate. You must learn focus. Yeah. Our journey need be your only concern. But what if they can <laughs> he help still us? talks like Kratos, man. I like I that. I seem to know a little about the lake. 
And how does that help us with our goal? Where is riding no, Kratos no, blinds nose the series, man? Oh, is that a dead body? Cool. Me a loot, bitch. We got Ager's gold and hack silver. Nice. I wonder if the world serpent even knows part of his body's lying over here. Uh, can we climb up this thing? Okay, this is a new spot. It might be a new combat location, man. Uh oh, this looks like something you have to fight. Oh my god, you serious? Oh shit! Wow! Holy shit! Wow, okay. Okay, okay, okay. You know, I keep getting confused with these guys, right? Like, the moment I see them, I think that they're the guys that you can't use your axe. And then I keep the axe, and then I realize, oh shit, they are the normal guys. And then I take out my axe again, and by then I'm dead. Shit. Shit, that was my bad. I wasn't expecting to fight so soon. Oh, they're worshipping the shit. Okay, okay, okay. You see that? I feel like I feel like when you fight these guys, you gotta kind of play the range game a little bit. The reason the guy is so close to the edge is because you can throw him off if you like return the, the fucking blade at him. Also, you gotta learn how to kick them off the fucking thing. Get the fuck out. Oh, I tried to parry. I tried to parry. Okay. Oh shit, okay, I wanted to hit him, but it was too slow, too slow, too slow. Ah, <sighs> okay. It's cool, it's cool, it's cool. Damn, that was rough. Whew, all the encounters require different strats, yeah, it's crazy. Like, I can't even use the strats I learned from earlier. Get the fuck out. Oh, I can't, I can't, I wanted to kick him off. Okay, okay. I got, I got, I got surrounded. I got surrounded. I wanted to kick that guy off, but he was being blocked by that fucking wall. That wall saved him. You saw that, right? It would have been more fair if he just bounced off the wall and fell down. But I'm trying to get rid of the projectile throwing guys first because I can't focus on the main fight with those guys. It feels like I'm like playing defense most of the time. Nice. Oh shit. Nice. Oh. oh! 
Is this guy like one of the guys you're not supposed to fight him with your axe? Oh, I get it. Okay, 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 okay. I don't think you're supposed to fight this guy with your axe. Oh, fuck. That was it, that was it, that was it. You always gotta hold your block with those guys. I keep forgetting, he's like someone you can't fight with your axe, right? Because like your axe doesn't do shit. It's fine. Oh shit. Oh shit, I'm dead. Oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Nice. Nice. Okay. Damn. That was a solid run, right? Yeah, I fucked up. Like, even if you're left with one guy, you can't, like, let up. You gotta, like, really, really focus. I think like when there was like one guy left, I kind of like mentally like checked out. I was like, ah, you know what? It's it's easy. It's cool. And then he did that stab that I'm always able to parry when I'm only focused. Oh shit. Oh, I'm dead. I, I don't know why I'm, I'm not able to kick, kick that guy out of the um, the arena. Like when I do the frost attack thing, I wanted to kick him out, so I kept the 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 the, the, the weapon. So I switched to barehanded, right? And sometimes you gotta angle it so perfectly that he's facing the edge. Oh look at that! Look at that! I couldn't kick him off. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, I'm dead. Ouch. Oh shit, I'm dead. Yeah, I got greedy. I got greedy. I wanted to kill this guy so bad. Okay, so number one, I, I gotta learn how to not rely on gimmicks and not try to like always kick them off. I think if it happens, it's cool, but let's not try to rely too much on it. I think it's possible to also like push them out if you use the R2 with your axe, but you gotta tap it lightly. Oh shit. Oh, I'm dead. Fuck! They all re just ran towards me. Okay, why am I doing wrong? Am I playing too reckless? I know I should kill the um, I should kill the uh, the little guys first, right? But it, it almost feels like. Nice. Oh fuck. I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. Can I roll away? I can't move, I can't move! Oh, fuck. First run, God of War uh, will definitely be something to add to the resume. Yeah, it will. I'm not giving up. I, I know what I'm messing up, but I got kind of fucked up that time. Like, I kind of got locked into a corner and then the game will not allow me to roll away. It's like an invisible wall behind me. Nice. 
nice. Oh shit, okay, okay, okay. I kind of wanted to roll away to get like a distance away from them, but I felt like it was a bad roll because I rolled away and he just attacked me. So I'm, I'm trying to like fight with projectiles and with attacks, but I'm always looking at the projectiles first. Okay, maybe she should focus on this guy. Oh, he dead. Get the fuck out of here. That was it. Okay, R1 is to push them away. I can push them off the cliff. You can't always push them off the cliff, man. Nice. Nice. That was easy. That was easy. Not a single damage I took. Ah, oh, there we go. Well, I think the way I did that was, um, I think the first move I did was, uh, I think I parried one of the projectile guys, and as soon as I hit him back with it, he blew back, right? And then the second guy was kind of also the same, but I think like what I also did was when the guys parried me, I press R1, which is to push them back. So both both projectile guys flew out of the ring, right? And then I can start focusing on the other ones. It was very intense. But I can't believe I attacked the other guys with also like regular axe. Because it felt like, you know, I thought those guys don't get damaged by regular axe. Kavakia. Well, worth a shot. Kavakia. This one? I guess we don't, we can't read these just yet. Oh, there's another boat. Oh, there's treasure over there. There we go, right, Fox? We did it. I mean, it's... I, I would say, like, a lot of fighting games are, is, are just really feels like puzzles. Okay, how do we get the boat on the other side? See that? There's a boat over there, but I can't, like, get there. Guess we gotta go back down from here. I feel like this game is it commands your respect, but there's a little bit of a problem with this game. It, it's like if you don't play this game like enough, that means like you kind of like play it once a week, you'll probably lose a little bit of your uh, muscle memory. I feel like how you can get good at this game is you got to like play so much that your muscle memory actually like matches your 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 brain. And that's why I really struggle with this game. I feel like my muscle memory is not at the level of like a god, uh, uh, like a Dark Souls yet. Like whenever I'm playing Dark Souls, I feel like my mind is like really one with the game. But with this one, I'm like, shit. Like, how do I press that button again? Or you know, is this a new spot? It's a new boat dock. Okay, let's try. Maybe just another fight. Oh, uh, I got 500 EXP. Does that mean I can level up something? I can level this up. I mean, this one, it does decent amount of DPS. It's kind of whack. You know, I'll save it. Uh-oh. Well, Souls games only require a couple of buttons. Yeah, you're right. But that's why I like simplicity and, you know, depth in, in, in simplicity. Ah, oh, more of those. Okay. Good. Shit, this one looks hard. I can't read these either. Kinda their beauty, to be honest. Yeah. Fuck, this one is gonna be hard, right? Out, oh, I can't parry. No, get up. I tried to parry him. It, he he hit me with a red attack. I can't parry that shit. That's kind of bullshit, bro. <laughs> okay, let's try again. 
Oh, I, okay, I tried to dodge, but I was in the middle of throwing my axe. And my axe didn't really freeze him. My axe just, like, bounced off his body. Like it was nothing. Maybe this is another type of guy I can't fight right now. Oh, come on. Oh, there's, there's three of them? Oh my god, okay, okay, this is this is bullshit. They can dash! And I can't parry. I can't parry. I can't even parry. Okay, yeah, I can't I can't do this. I can't parry them, which is my bread and butter. I gotta dodge. And there's no opening because like the moment I dodge someone and I'm ready to attack. Another guy is dashing towards me, like, about to stab me. Like, I can't attack. The only attack that I can do is, like, if I stun them, if I, like, parry them and everyone gets stunned, I have an opening. But this one is tough. And you can't make mistakes. So I don't think I can fight them right now. I'm really out of my element right here. I need, like, some better armor, some better, like, skills, whatever. Wow, okay. I'll come back here later. I'll come back here later. It's kind of like the other one where there's a two guys with the hammers, like, dude. I can't even parry that. Why can I not parry those guys? That's so unfair. Like, you know the beauty about Sekiro is you can fight like very dangerous enemies that are above your level as long as you can parry their moves, which is beautiful, right? I can parry everything, right? But I don't know, those guys have unblockables that are crazy. Hold up. Uh, is this a thing? Wow, I've never Ooh. seen a waterfall so big. Okay, they, they got a crate over there. Let's get some stuff. New boat dock found. Are there like corpses lying around? I got a lot of hack silver. Oh wait, there's a corpse that there. He must have Ager's gold. Wonder what do you really use Ager's gold for? Five Ager's gold. Nice. 200 hack silver. I feel like every single encounter that I go into right now, I'm gonna at least die once. It's like, <laughs> it's tough, man. You can't make mistakes. Oh, uh, this place looks kind of dangerous. Shit. We can beach the boat here. Hidden area discovered. Boy. Sir. What is this? A scroll? It's some kind of drawing. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna switch out like the talismans because like what I got right now doesn't really protect me as well as luck of ages. Ooh, maybe a treasure map. It is a treasure map. The boat captain's key. Oh, isn't this from the first game? Like the boat captain that we killed and he went to hell and then we killed him again. With the boat captain in the belly of the Hydra, yeah. The key was mine. I traveled to a new land, but my ship wrecked and sunk along with my precious key. It lies just beyond the waves perched on an underwater peak. Underwater. Huh. Okay. Uh, nothing here? Yeah, I think we're gonna have a fight. Oh. Shit. Yeah, I think a fight is going to happen here. I'm going to get rid of the bitch. Oh, we're going to shoot her first. Oh my god. Nice, nice. Oh, can I not parry that? Oh my god, my health. I'm dead. Oh, 
Oh, I can't parry the fucking poison. Oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. Damn, that is so rough. Kind of so rough. Uh, okay, I was playing really, really callously. That was tough. It feels like you got a pumper like full of arrows before like you can even do shit. That's the crazy part. Uh, what am I not doing? Uh, I should like focus on her. Maybe I should save the Rage of Sparta for later. Oh. Oh wow, every time she comes up... Wow, she doesn't, she doesn't telegraph her movements. So a lot of the other monsters, when they attack you, they have like a yellow circle around them to let you know you can parry. But when she attacks, they don't give you that circle. That's crazy. Okay. And whenever she pops up, she, she, she does like damage. Not for your arrow. Fire. Nice. Oh my god. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh my god. Yeah, I, I gotta heal. Gotta heal, gotta heal. Nice. Oh shit! Oh shit, okay. Am I- Is there two of them? Oh, I'm dead. Wow. I panicked, I panicked. But I'm doing better? I'm doing better? I- She's crafty, yeah, she's crafty. I'm doing better. I'm doing better. I'm playing a little more patient. I- I'm playing too aggressively, man. I just want to kill her as ASAP. But it doesn't work that way. Oh shit, I should have parried. Oh shit. Okay, I gotta recover some health. Okay. Oh shit! I'll bring it down, just tell me when. Nice, 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 nice. I fucking hate that bitch, man. Okay, how do you fight this guy? Oh shit, it's so hard to see. Wow, he's tough. Nice. Oh, wow. Holy shit, I think I'm dead. Is there any health around? Okay, here we go. I tried to parry. Oh, shit. Oh, he explodes. I don't know how that guy is. Like, apparently when you attack him too close, he explodes. Okay, that's fine. Like, how? Like, like how do I know when he's going to explode? Am I not supposed to, like, close the distance with him? 
I feel like you also have to like play parry games with him. It's fine, you know. I'm not really sweating. Nice. I knew she was gonna attack. Oh! Okay. Oh shit. Nice. Wow. That was sick. You got this for sure. Damn, I was suddenly in the zone, man. That was a little too quick. I felt like I had to rely on the Rage of Sparta. I kind of feel a little embarrassed by that. Like, I feel fucking dirty, man, inside. I, I used the Rage of Sparta because I had no choice. Like, I needed to get back some health and I, I needed to, like, you know... Because the Rage of Sparta increases your uh, health with each punch, right? But, man, I felt so dirty, man. I would have preferred to do that fight without having to rely on it, but I had to do it. One more for the collection. Abandoned ship. Six out of nine. 282 hack silver. I can't open this. Yeah, it's locked. Uh, okay. Yeah, it feels like everywhere right now is like a little too high level for me. Um, okay, wait, let me think. Ooh, oh, wait a minute. Can I like, can I lower the bridge using this thing? There we go. There's a spirit over there. Uh, I'm guessing he's gonna call like bad guys. Hey, what's up, Yosh? What to do, man? Welcome back. Come Yosh. and face me, God of Thunder. The fuck? Oh, can I lift this up? I'm gonna lift this up. Cool. Okay, let's talk to this guy. Your challenges mean nothing to the gods, spirit. They do not listen. Do not mock my pursuit of vengeance. Though my family devoted their lives to worshipping Thor, I've devoted mine to his downfall. Why? And I will start with that statue looming over my father's grave. What Unlikely, happened? Unlikely, you are dead. Is there something we can do? For a reward, of course. If you bring down the statue, you have my blessing to loot my father's grave. Wow. He rests on an island to the east. God of War, yeah, this is God of War. Uh, Why do you hate track so much? the favor. After my father passed, my mother built the statue to watch over his grave. Imagine our surprise when the God of Thunder himself came to offer condolences. At first, we were thrilled, but he quickly took advantage of our hospitality. Damn. My mother begged him to leave, and Thor, in his drunken rage, killed her. What the fuck? Thor is a little bitch in this game. Eventually, I lost that as well. Damn. And found only rage in its place. Man, I'm gonna shit on I, all of Thor, man. I'm so sorry. Hey, no spoilers, man. Man, no we spoilers. Have a to destroy. Uh, okay. Ooh. Can I destroy this? Huh. I think I'm not ready for this place yet. I guess. Uh, maybe I can pull the the chain. Lies on an island to the east. Okay, let's pull this thing first. Okay, there's a chest over there. Okay, how do we lock this in place? Okay, cool. Seems okay. So now we have an open door to get to that treasure inside. What is this? The fight was crazy, man. Boom. We got... Hack Silver. 
World Serpent Scale Fragment plus 3. Cool. Nice suit. What is this? Damn. Ooh, Apple of Eden? No. Golden Talisman of Protection. Rare Talisman. Active immediately after being hit to recover faster. Also has a passive effect that increased the timing window on parries and greatly increased defense. Wow. The fuck? It's a level 2 talisman. It gives you some defense. Press L1 to active. Activate. Oh, you can activate it immediately after being hit to recover faster. This is pretty cool. I still don't like how the throw is like really, really slow. You know what I mean? It's like, there's no like instant like, like, like that quick. It is he, he still like has to wind up like for a second. Okay, and I gotta remember a quick button to get out your weapons, the triangle. Nice. I cannot rest while my mother's murderer stands above my father's Ooh, can grave. we open this up? Nice. Wow. Parry talisman. Yes, please. Hell yeah. And also, it increases... It, it has like a skill that apparently if you get hit, you, you tap the L1 immediately. And it recovers like something. I don't... Let me read it again. What was it again? Uh, I think it was under armor. So, activate immediately after being hit to recover faster. Oh, okay. So, if you get hit, you can recover your posture faster, I think. Yeah. Sounds pretty cool. Okay, so let's go check out the, those gates. It feels like this game is huge because I'm not even going to the main mission right now. The one whose mom was killed by Thor? What about him? Let his story be a reminder. The lives of men mean nothing to the gods. Exactly. I know, father. You know. But do you listen? Yes. Damn. Good. Good. Okay, let's do it. Shit. Area discovered. Vyther Guard Pass. Vyther Guard Pass. Wow. This place is huge. I can see like fishes like jumping out of the water. That's really cool. Wow, it's like really foggy and shit. Uh oh, I see something. Oh no, is there gonna be another fight here? Oh no, wait. I think this is probably another fight. What is this? Oh, wait. Oh, it's Brock. Okay, wait, let's read this. Boy, over here. Vader guard. Vader Guard. Southern Outposts of the Dwarven King. Southern Dwarven Outposts. King? Dwarven King? Have you King? ever heard of a Dwarven King? No. So we got a new lore. Ruins of Vader Guard. Nothing remains of Vader Guard except the ruins of Mod Sognir. Cruelty. The once fer fertile soil is barren soaked with the blood of both Hunter and the hun Hunted. It was the noble dwarf king himself who demanded the bloodshed. He who conscripted the gentle farmers of these lands into an army of ill-equipped hunters. He whose thirst for savage beasts produced a legion of widows. The castle still stands for those foolish enough to scavenge wherein dwells the deadliest of his quarry. Let caution guide you. Yikes, doesn't sound like a very nice place. Father will probably want to visit anyways to look for useful resources. He's gotten a little predictable but I'm having fun seeing new places with him. Damn. Ooh. Damn. You got a new location. Why is like everything in like a uh, fucking smog, bruh? Oh. See, it's still in smog. Maybe I should say hi. Hey, Brock. You ever hear of a dwarf king? I suppose you're talking about Mozignir? Mozignir? Some bitch ruled over the Some humans bitch. once lived in this area. <laughs> Damn. Built itself a castle Fuck a dragon. just north of here. Fuck a dwarf. A dwarven castle? What's it like? You got yourself a pair of eyes and legs, ain't you? Might want to stock up before you head that way, though. 
Old Moltsignir is known for collecting all manner of killer and creatures. Killer and creatures. Not sure who's looking after Seeing them Brock now. is like seeing a safe room. A little bit. A Let's little bit. Let's sort you out. Ooh, okay, wait. Uh, let's see if we can upgrade our shit. So we can upgrade um, uh, Atreus' quiver. Let's do that. Cool. Upgrade successful. Talon quiver successful. So it recovers his recharge time. Oh, you can upgrade it further. Axe pommel. Weapons pommel. Pommel can be equipped on your weapon. Each pommel increase stats. Pommels can be upgraded to improve their stats. So I have like the ex the right thing to upgrade the versatile warrior's handle. And I need like 1500 hack silver. All right, let's just do it. Careful. Now you can touch yourself just looking at that thing. Damn, nice. Yeah, he feels like really comforting to look at. Like, I mean, he looks ugly as shit, but like, you know how it is. Oh, can I upgrade like the talisman? Talismans have unique effects that can aid you in combat. They can be upgraded to shop to improve their effectiveness and reduce cooldown for certain abilities. Okay, cool. Oh, I need like something called Dust of Realms. I don't have that. Dust of Realms. Pretty expensive upgrade too. Uh, Leviathan X. I need something. I I don't have a frozen flame. Enchantment, symbol of menace. Ooh, hack silver. These are like not that expensive. These are like a, a thousand bucks each. I mean, I could choose vitality, cooldown, runic, or luck. Each costs like a thousand bucks. And I can upgrade my wrists. Oh, wait a minute. I got... Oh, this is like new shit. Oh, okay. Yeah, this is new shit. Uh, I don't know if I want to like buy any of these because these are like... I don't know. They, are, they don't seem to like upgrade your shit that much. Weighted war handle. Yeah, it doesn't give you the stats that are that good. Executioner's cooldown, strength goes up. Um, nah, the versatile warrior's handle seems like better. Talisman of resolute protection, talism talisman of resolute might. Uh, might, yeah. Strength for defense too. Yeah, the golden talisman of protection is better. What you need. Oh shit, we need uh, solid Swaltheim steel. You I only have soft. Quiver. I think we can still upgrade this. Nice. I think that's all I can do for now. I only have 6,000 hack silver. Leviathan Axe needs the frozen flame, which I don't have. Best of luck with all the rampaging. Brock. Fuck else you need. Fuck else you need. I like this guy. Because I ain't in a working relationship with that <laughs> liquor no more. I wasn't about to let him use it without me and he likewise. Yeah, I like this Only guy. Only thing to do was split the brand 50-50 down the middle. <laughs> Guess that was the last thing we saw eye to eye on. What? You want a hug? Brock is the home? Yeah, Hit what do you want to Hit the road. I like this guy. Okay, maybe before we go in here, maybe there's like other like locations and spirits we haven't freed yet. So I think I'm going to head out first. Because I think he kind of warned us like wherever we are going past those gates is going to be way, it's going to be pretty dangerous. I think it's like a side mission thing. Uh, Wait, did I have EXP? Oh, I only have 600. 667. Uh, okay, let me see. Do I have a map? Uh, how, I look, how do I look at the map? Okay, here we go. Uh, what is this? Unfinished business. Explore the island of the lake. Boat dock. Lookout tower. Okay, there's like a couple of places. Yeah. A little canoe trip with the boy. Yeah, this is a little too family friendly. 
I prefer like when Kratos doesn't have a, a son when he's like just laying waste to fucking Greece. You know, no responsibilities, just like absolute like unmitigated power. You know? Like fuck a kid, man. You know, I, I wanna have like power. I don't want a family. Fuck a family. Ooh, 300 hack silver. This place is so huge. I think like one of the spirits wanted me to destroy like, um, you know, like, oh, what the fuck? Uh oh, what is this? Lake of Nine. Damn. I can't believe I've already died 79 times. What's interesting is like the game plops like really difficult enemies for you to fight, even though like, you know, they don't they, they pace you kind of well, but they also like allow you to fight impossible enemies. Hidden area discovered. Uh oh. Damn, this place don't look too friendly, bruh. The fuck is that sound? Oh shit. Ah, come on, bruh. Told you, told you. I'm the chosen one. Uh, there's two paths. There's like one that goes left and one that goes right. Oh fuck, it's so dark. Oh, it, it doesn't really matter because they both like go to the same path. What is this? Treasure? Okay, more hex silver, seventy ninety nine. Nice. Uh, okay. Damn, this is kind of creepy. I don't like caves, man. Yeah, I mean, even in Skyrim, like whenever I see a cave, it's interesting to go in, but I hate it. Fuck. No turning back now. Uh oh. Ooh, treasure. We got Hexilver, Soft Swalterheim Steel World Serpent Scale Fragment. I don't. I haven't found like too many solid Swalterheim Steel yet. I need that to upgrade like boys' uh, shit. What's this? Hmm. This is good to know. Damn. There's a lot of fishes here. What's up with that? Maybe this place was filled with water and then like the world serpent like uh lowered everything. Yeah, look at that. There's like seaweed seaweed hanging from the walls. I think this was filled with water. I think. It's like the world serpent wants this area not to be discovered. That's why he like kind of sat on the lake. Oh, it's Brock again. Good. Now when you're done gawking, I got a favor to ask. Oh shit. What now? What's this? What does it say? Sir. Oh, this doesn't look friendly. Uh, these rooms read uh. death inside. Oh, fuck. Lore added. Death inside. This must be old. There's plenty of death outside, too. <laughs> Go on. Uh, yo, what was good? What is it, dwarf? There's this alchemist on Vari. Been working out in the Velander mines. You haven't heard from him in maybe, I don't know, a hundred winters or so. Probably dead, but uh, maybe you can find him. He's dwarfing like me. Wears a fancy green ring. Owes me a favor. You look? If it is on our path. Oh, I see how it is. Not a something for nothing type, are you? Hey, man. Put me on. Give me some if paper. Find on Vari, I'll make him whip you up something special. This entry stone here ought to get you inside those mines. Oh shit. Okay. Fuck it, let's do it. Seems it seems like a the fucking mines is right through these doors. Shit. Might as well have a look see inside, don't you think? Damn. I need that alchemist for something I'm stewing up for you. If find the dwarf with the green it. ring. It's so dark, god damn it. So 
Brock said his friend was dwarven like him, wearing a green ring. Look if you wish. I will be gathering resources for our journey. You don't yeah. want to help him? No. Why not? Because I do not run errands for dwarves. Damn. Oh. Kratos is a savage, bro. Dwarven, but no ring. One of his crew? Scorch marks. There, along the floor and wall. Weird. This place was burned. I guess burned. we keep looking. We. Oui. I mean, I keep looking. Hey, <laughs> Kratos is such a hard ass, bro. I like that. So even though you're looking for shit, like, you know, it's, it wasn't your idea to begin with. Uh-oh. Whoa, this kind of looks like a fight. Uh-oh. What the hell is that? That's a soul eater. If that kills us, that's it. No Valhalla, no hell, no afterlife. Ever. What the fuck? It does not attack. It does not see us, maybe? Ah. Oh. Mom made them sound more dangerous than that. Then do not drop your guard. Come. Go, oh boy. <laughs> Yo. Ain't nothing here? Oh, wait. They buried treasure here. I like that. I like like sometimes treasure isn't in, in chests, it's like in the ground and Kratos has to like dig it out. I have a feeling like if I drop down, there's gonna be a fight. Oh shit. Nice. Again. I noticed the lack of ring while looting the body. Oh shit. Huh. Oh shit. Nice. Nice. These guys don't have that like thing where like um you know you can see when they're gonna hit. Oh my god. Nice. Do they have health? Oh no no, I'm dead, I'm dead. Oh I'm dead. Oh I'm dead. Shit. Ooh. That was rough. That was rough. I was like really sloppy because like I was waiting to see that circle thing appear when I, I can parry. Oh fuck. Oh she's reviving like the other guys. Oh my god. I can't I can't really see their attacks because they're like glowing so yellow that they, their their hands are kind of like blended in with their body. Nice. Nice. One, two, three. One, two, three. Oh shit! Focus, boy. Oh, can you not parry that? Ouch. Nice. Okay, okay, I really gotta focus. Where's that little thing? Oh, wow. So, I don't know what to do, honestly, because, like, I killed, like, one of the nightmare things, and he, and, like, another one shows up. 
So I don't really know what's the priority, like who I gotta kill first, to be honest. Because I don't really know what the nightmare thing does other than shoot projectiles at you. And it just feels like the boy is like, he's really like weak. Okay, see? You kill him quickly. See, I can't see like how they attack. You see, like, most enemies have the yellow circle around them when they're about to hit you, but not these guys. These guys, they you, you have to just see their attacks. I don't understand, like, how the game, like, has, like, this yellow circle and the red circle and shit like that. Yeah, it's really hard to see this guy's attacks because he's like glowing in like the yellow thing. Oh wait, can you like... Oh wait, he, he's no longer yellow in color. Oh, it's, it's like that nightmare, the nightmare guy goes inside people. Oh! Okay, okay, okay. Okay, 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 okay. Healing stone. Just fighting with like one health. Something hit me so fast that I couldn't see it. Okay, maybe, uh, maybe what I did was, um, so I have a tendency of like trying to create distance between me and my enemies. So I would like try to roll back and that usually like fucks me up because there's like a startup and recovery nightmare and sword, sword slash, right? Was I trying to create distance by rolling back? Cause every time I do that, I get hit sometimes. It's almost like it's better to stay still and block instead of like roll back, you know? Is someone shooting at me? Nice, nice. Ooh. Get the fuck out of here, man. I'm a parry god. 
damn. I mean, I'm really in the flow, right, man? Oh my god, I wanted to I wanted to like I wanted to do like that that finisher move. Nice. Oh my god, I almost didn't parry that. Damn. That was rough. Yeah, I'm flowing like water. That was insane. Like, I was totally in the zone, and it's so rare to have a game like this. Um, okay. So, can I switch out talismans just to heal myself real quick? Yeah, but we gotta wait till the cooldown, like, hits. Damn, that was insane. It feels like... It feels like the nightmares like will go inside like corpses and then the corpses become strong but somehow like if I stun the corpses enough the nightmare will fly out but it's like, such a short time window that you have to like like I think you have to grab the nightmare as soon as it flies out if that makes sense yeah it's kind of rough okay I don't have the right talisman equipped I, I can't I can't switch up the talisman right now yeah, if the talisman's on cooldown, you can't switch it out. Shit. Okay, let me go back up and look for health. Maybe I can find some health. Hey, thank you, man. I appreciate it, Fox. But it's like the magic of like games like these is like learning, man. Appreciate you, bro. Thank you, man. I'm glad you love God of War streams. I didn't know how you would like this game, bro. I got a question for you, Fox. You, uh, Neo or God of War? You only can pick one. Neo or God of War? <laughs> Neo 2. Damn. The mad disrespect. Neo 2 over this masterpiece. God of War is better than Neo 1. But Neo 2 is better than God of War? Come on, bro. You tripping. You tripping. Only Cinekeet is the type of person capable of that amount of disrespect. What the fuck? What? Where? Where? What the fuck? Where? Where? Oh. Oh, bitch be crazy, bro. Wow, she's not like face by it. Oh shit, no. You saw that parry? Where the fuck he went? Nice! You saw that? That was sick. That was sick. Wow. I'm actually really learning like the fucking bitch moves, man. I remember dying to this fucking hole like so many times that like I've really really mastered that shit. Download it, right? But it's it's a different story when you're fighting her and someone else. If you're fighting her and like another like bad guy. Compass area markers when you turn to goal, objective is somewhere in the area. Search the area for clues, okay. Damn, very true, right? It's like fighting one is different from fighting a horde. Not him. Hey, I thought you didn't care. I noticed the lack of ring while looting the body. Damn. Oh. Triss is like a sh natural sh Oh, what the fuck? Oh. 
Oh my god. I fucking hate these guys, man. I fucking hate these guys. They're so Boy. annoying. Yes, sir. Another treasure map? Uh, okay. Oh, dead and bloated. The troll who killed my kin is slain, but the battle has taken its toll. I'm buried where whatever I've left near his corpse. Ingrid and I used to frequent this beach to watch the sun rise over the temple. Rewards one rare enchantment, oblivion stone, five soft Svaltheim steel, and 6,000 hex silver. Damn. Oh, I remember a rock like this. You gotta like blow up a, an explosive. Oh, okay. Now we gotta switch out our um our shit. Golden talisman on protection. Okay, can I blow this up from the side? There we go. Come on. Ah, right, he's perfect. Okay, what's over here though? Oh, can I kick down the chain? Oh, fuck. Oh my god, I know what the fuck this is, bruh. It's not that hard to guess. One out of three seals destroyed. Yeah, there's gonna be a b -b 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 battle. Okay, two out of three seals and one more. Where's the last one? Okay, I think there's a bucket over here. If I knock this Follow down... Me, Atreus. Yeah, I sense there's gonna be a fight coming up down here. Uh... Oh, what the fuck is up with this music? Yo, okay, wait, wait, wait. Where's the ruin? I I don't want I don't want to go there first. Oh wait, I saw the ruin. It's, it was right here. I think I saw it from here. It was right here. Oh, there it is. There it is. You see that? I think it's above the. Um... Oh, there it is. Wait, that's not it. I think that's- it's, it's just showing you the symbol. Oh wait, I forgot about this. I think there's like a path down below. Oh, there we go. Nice too. So where's the final runic, uh, stone? Maybe it's like somewhere up there. I gotta go pee, man. But so far, today's stream has been pretty baller. Three hours so far. Uh, just give me a minute, guys. Just gonna take a quick bathroom break. You know, it's been a while since I used to... Um, damn, it's raining like crazy uh, outside. I'm so glad that I had the foresight to close my kitchen window. Because like when I was streaming yesterday... I didn't hear it rain outside, so like the rain flew in my window and it soaked up my entire kitchen floor. It was fucking crazy. Rain is perfect for video games. Yeah, it is. And you know, this morning my cat had her breakfast, you know, she had a fun, I played with her. Uh, she's sleeping right now. You know, I built her a little fort on my bed with blankets because like sometimes when it rains, it there's like thunder and she, she gets really afraid of that shit. So she's feeling like hella cozy right now inside the bed, you know, she's sleeping. And I think like she's kind of used to my schedule because like I spend time playing with her before I stream. That's why sometimes I'm kind of late. And, uh, you know, but, you know, I just want to like keep her like working so that, you know, she has that exercise and she's really healthy. And, you know, the, the awesome thing is she knows my schedule. So she's like, she waits patiently for me to come outside. 
good cat dad. Yeah. You guys see my cat videos I post on Twitter? Um, yeah, you know, like, initially when Kaya, my cat, first lived with me, she had, like, constipation, right? And then I realized, like, dry cat food was incredibly bad for her. So I only feed her wet cat food. And what I'll do is I'll also put some fiber into her food. So I didn't know that you can actually do this, but did you know you can cook up pumpkin? Make the pumpkin into a puree and mix it with their food. And when they eat it together with the pumpkin, not only they get the vitamins and all that good shit, but they get to use the bathroom really easy. So my cat is super regular. Like she goes to the bathroom on, on the clock, just like that, right? Uh, her fur is beautiful. She's so happy. Um, incredibly like affectionate. Like wherever I would go, she would follow me. Um, uh, when I, when I'm streaming, she knows the days that I stream. She doesn't follow me. She would go inside the bedroom. She would sit on, sit on the bed and she would just like go to sleep. Right. And it's like, you know, that's incredible. It's it, it just that shit feels magical, man. She's absolutely like a dream cat. And I think every cat is a dream cat as long as you like look after it. Yo, I'm a good cat dad, man. You know, I always try to be better. I always feel like I can improve in some way. I never feel that, you know, like I am a complete product. So e including like my streams and whatnot, I always try to look, look at it different. Where's the other rune? There must be one more rune that we can destroy. You know what? I think let's do this fight. There's gonna be a fight here, right? I know I should have saved that for the fight, but I don't give a fuck. Okay, that's weird. There must be one more rune. What do you mean by whoa? What the hell? Oh, I see the rune over there. to the soul eater. Holy shit. Well, we know what happened to Invari now. He did. We can just go tell Brock. No need to fight it, right? No, we will fight it. But Damn. Why? Because you are frightened of it. Damn, I am frightened about it. How did he know? Okay, I got the, the last rune, so we should, oh my God. Oh my God. Holy shit. Oh my god, I'm a beast. Oh fuck. Holy shit, that was quick. That was quick. Wow, that was crazy. It, it feels like the, the nightmare is the, the difficult ones you gotta watch out for. Oh my god. It's so hard to see. It's so hard to see when the when when those guys go inside the bodies. They, when they turn yellow, their their movements are so hard to read. Shit. Come on, I can't even like do my finishing move. Oh my god, okay, I'm dead, I'm dead. Nice. 
Nice. Nice. Shit. Okay, I'm dead. Ah, okay. I'm a little too much in the zone, a bit. Like, I gotta, like, zoom out. I'm too focused on one guy at a time. I gotta accept the fact that the nightmare is going to go inside the guy's body. Okay, one guy's dead. Oh my god, I was busy doing something. Nice. Oh my god, there's more! Shit. Nice. Oh my god, we got projectiles! Fuck, I'm dead. Okay, shit. God damn it! Father, no! Yeah, this kid is hilarious, man. God damn it, man. That was sloppy. That was so sloppy. <sighs> okay, let's do this. Okay, let's not kill, like, let's not kill all of them so fast. We gotta make sure, like, at least the nightmare guy is dead. Why am I not doing any damage to this guy? I'm not doing any damage to the yellow guy. Okay, I gotta heal. Oh no, he's leveling up. Oh, come on. I'm dead. One, two. Oh my god. I have no health, bro. Jesus. I'm like a parry god. I'm like literally like my parries are like 7 out of 10 times. How do you defeat this guy? Yo, shit! Give me that. It's so hard to see! Father, I had to fight in this room because like, it, it, at least I can avoid the uh, projectile dude. Damn it, that was tight. Um, it just feels like... Okay, so... When the nightmare invite invades like one of the guy's bodies, it's so hard to take him out. Nice pairing, thank you bro. 
I might have to go just fisted because like if I use fist, I can like do the finishing move. Like I don't have a lot of like stun. Like my stun is like really bad. Nice pairing, right? Like I yo, I got my parries on lock, but it's more like at that at that point it was like Oh my god, now there's two of them. Oh my god. I, I think I fucked this up. Yeah, I'm dead. Okay, sloppy, sloppy. Sloppy, sloppy, sloppy. Ah, oh, pairing those things is suck because those things can like they move like side to side. Oh my god, he was almost dead. He was almost dead and then like I just gotta kill one nightmare. That's all I need to do. Like I don't think I have the patience to fight two guys that are possessed by nightmares. I at least have to kill one nightmare at the start. Oh god. Come on. You know what? Maybe I should go barehanded. Oh shit. Oh fuck, I'm dead. Dude! Okay, I have no health. Oh my god, this is not good, this is not good. Uh, I need health. Oh, I'm dead. That was tough. I'm enjoying the fight though. I'm really enjoying the fight though. I feel like there's a lot of silly mistakes I'm making. Oh shit. You can't really damage that guy. I gotta kill this guy. I gotta focus on this guy because these guys like... Should I fight him barehanded? Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh my god. Jesus. What am I doing wrong? It's that nightmare within that guy, but even if like... Okay, so even if the nightmare doesn't invade the guy with the axe, he has so much health, like, it's like, crazy. Um, I think I'm like a little too focused on fighting one guy. I just wanted to get the nightmare out of him. And I, I thought I was quick enough to grab the nightmare as soon as it comes out, right? But like, I have never succeeded. The bare hands pull him out faster, yeah, but it's almost like it, it also kind of sucks because like if he comes out, he becomes another enemy. He starts shooting at you. So it's almost like better when he's inside the guy. 
Yeah, but I, I'm unable to grab him in time. So I can stun the guy, but I can't really do shit. Oh, shit. Okay, I gotta heal. I need health. No health? It's like the, the attack pattern doesn't give you any reprieve, man. How do you get this guy out of his body? I'm dead, I'm dead. Once they bring the cavalry, I'm dead. It's, it's like the nightmare heals him. Okay, so I just realized that the nightmare constantly heals the guy, no matter what, and you have to like pull the nightmare out. No wonder the guy couldn't die, he's impossible to kill him, and it's like, if it's possible to kill both nightmares at the start, it's great, but I should at least try to focus on one. Oh shit. Yeah, see, once he invades this guy's body, it's like very difficult. You gotta focus on taking that nightmare out. Oh my god, that hurts. Okay, the nightmare's out. Oh my god. Okay, nightmare's nightmare's dead. Okay, just focus. Oh shit! Oh my god, where did this guy came from? Jesus Christ, man. God of War difficulty is like for real. Oh my god! That was it. 
I, I okay I have a very horrible habit which I, I think I learned it from Dark Souls man and it doesn't fucking work here I always die to this thing and I don't have to always die I fucking always roll back to to, to maintain some distance that's a Dark Souls rule in Dark Souls you, you're not supposed to fight this close to your enemy and the reason being is because yeah you, you because it's like in Dark Souls, there there are enemies if you fight too close to them, and I can give you an example, right? If you go to um I think like uh I think there was like um it was like near Firelink Shrine, I think it was the, the old Londo, the, the the old um city. There's a guy if you fight too close to him, he'll grab you and he will fucking suck out your soul. That's why you always like maintain your distance. Man. It's like I'm playing 4D, but this game wants to play 3D. So the moment I roll away, they, they are like, alright, bet, you know? It's almost like you roll, they like glue their attacks when you come out of it. Yeah, exactly. It's so fucking dumb. It's I'm always almost like rolling as soon as they're starting up their attack animation. And when I come out of the attack animation, they fucking hit me. Oh, fuck. No, no, no. Okay. I gotta kill at least one. Yeah, okay, maybe you're dead. Can I can I retry? Because like both nightmares are inside two two guys. I'd rather like kill one really quickly. Oh shit. Okay, two nightmares are dead. Nice, both nightmares are dead. Now I can kind of focus. Oh my god, okay. Chill, chill, I got greedy, I got greedy. That was sick! That guy dodged my shit! Get the fuck out of here. Oh, I keep fucking dodging to the back. Let's not do that. Let's not do that. Jesus. Okay, don't don't roll away. Stay within the fight. Fuck, why am I always rolling away? Oh, I'm almost dead. Yeah, I don't look so great. Get the fuck out of here. Oh my god. Okay, okay, that was my bad. I disrespected the other guy. I disrespected him by facing my back towards him. <sighs> yeah, 100% my fault. I keep fucking making the stupid mistake of rolling away like Dark Souls. Fuck, don't do that. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. How did he kill me? I was so focused on both the nightmares. Holy oh, shit. God damn it.
Oh no, he invaded the- Oh, both of them invaded the guys. Yeah, both of them invaded, guys. Fuck it. I was so close to killing one nightmare and he went inside the guy. Why? He's like, you gotta get it right at the start. Oh my god, look at that, look at that. Okay, fuck, fuck it. Oh my god, you stupid bitch. Oh my god. This is crazy. Y you know what's crazy? Like, once you like, if you don't kill those two nightmares and you go inside the bodies, you fight so hard to pull them out. And once you even separate them, now you have four enemies on the map. Jesus. And also, I don't know what's their uh, strat. Like, once they come out of the bodies, can they go back in bodies? I think I've seen them go back in bodies before. It's so, so messed up. It's pretty frustrating, but it's it's okay. It's it's like it's meant to be like that because it's got a warm wound. Oh no! Why did I target the guy? Oh, now he went into the other guy. Jesus Christ, bro. They all attack me at once. Ah, hence their name. I did really well uh, one time when I was able to get rid of both nightmares. I don't know. I don't really know what was my method to getting rid of them. Uh, I think like maybe I flashed both of them instantly. Maybe you should try that. Oh my god. Yeah, yeah, this is bad. It's so tough to kill them. Um, maybe as I run, I can get a trace to immediately start shooting. Okay, one is dead. Wow, look at look at the stun meter. The stun meter is impossible. Okay, he's coming up, he's coming up. Oh wow. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. It takes so much work to get one nightmare out of the body. Oh, okay, I was thinking, what if I got rid of everyone first and just like ignore the nightmare? So if the nightmare goes into the guy's body, we just like, we don't give a fuck, right? What if we did that? Right. 
Oh my god. Okay, let's not give a fuck about the like the, the guy. Let's just focus on the other guy who's not like getting like mad. Oh my god. Oh my god, okay, okay, like Fuck, I I parry! fucking strength to beat this fucking bitch man i still made a lot of mistakes so if i die here it's kind of understandable oh there it is 102 it's just that nightmare it's, it's just that nightmare within the fucking guy i was every time i'm it's like the game is a little dirty it's like even if you like the nightmare comes out and he has only one hp he can immediately go into another guy milestone 100 sudoku yeah it's not a willful sudoku man it's like I didn't mean to die. Oh my god, he immediately goes into the guy's body. You see that? And he goes into the strongest guy. Oh, okay, this is bad. It's bad, 103. I was very sloppy, I was very sloppy. I was just trying to get like one of the uh, fucking nightmares. It's better to kill one nightmare than allow both nightmares to go inside the body. Oh, he immediately went inside the guy's body. If the nightmare is weak, he'll go inside the body. I'm dead. Can I die? Can I just try again? It, okay, so... I don't know what's the best method because like immediately when the nightmare is threatened, he immediately goes into someone's body. That means you gotta kinda kill him before he does that. Maybe we can use the frost immediately once we uh, go in. Alright, he's dead. Okay, at least like one nightmare is dead. Oh shit. focus on like this nightmare did guy I need health oh I'm dead Jesus ah <sighs> this game is no joke wow the amount of focus it takes man I think I was really close like I think twice okay I got this I got this don't worry about it I got this um 
You know what? I think there's a skill that I probably should have unlocked. Which is that axe throwing like ability. You can charge up the Leviathan thing. Okay, I don't have enough points. Oh fuck, okay, he went in. No. Oh, he went into two people's bodies. I just won the fucking nightmare out. Oh fuck. I'm dead. Yeah. Oh, this guy's almost stunned. Oh my god. I'm almost dead. I only have one HP, man. Jesus, one HP. Oh my god, okay, he got my back, he got my back. Ah, that was sick. This game is really addictive though. On any other difficulty, it, I would have like destroyed everyone. <sighs> okay, what's the best method to kill the um... I think we could like... Frost them and then... Stun them. Oh my god! Okay, we should focus on getting the nightmare out of this guy. Yeah, get the nightmare out of this guy. Oh my god, he re-invaded this guy. Holy oh shit. This is the fucking bitch, man. Okay, we gotta find the open. Oh my god, what the fuck? <sighs> How did I die? It, it, he caught me in like a loop? I think he caught me in like in the middle of like, I parried like too fast. <sighs> I'm almost there, yeah, I'm almost there. I can sense it too. Oh my god, okay. Oh 
Oh my god. Yeah, I'm, I'm fucked. A little bit. Almost ready. Oh, I'm dead. Father, get out. <sighs> okay. I got this, I got this, I got this. <sighs> I have kind of like an inkling how to do this. Like, I can beat both nightmares at once, but I gotta be very fast. Oh my god, he went in before I could do anything. Okay, just get the just get one of the nightmares out. Oh dude, I parry! Why? Dude, I fucking parry. Why couldn't I parry? I'm dead. Damn it, I parry. I don't know, sometimes, like, this game, bro, solid start, right? Oh. Oh my god, he went in the body before I could do shit. Oh shit, no, no! Come on, come on! Oh my god, don't go in there, don't body! Uh, no, he went back in the body! Oh my god, he went back in the guy's body! Yeah. He's like so slippery. Yeah, I'm dead. Yeah. God damn it. I feel like, honestly speaking, I'm a little too low level for this place. I don't think I'm even supposed to be here. Wait! How did he go inside that guy's body before, like, I killed him? Okay, it feels like... It feels like as soon as they go... Like, okay, so... The nightmares can go into like um what's the word for it? They can go into like ghoul ghost mode. That means you like you're once they decide to go in inside an enemy, you can't touch them. They're invincible. You gotta kill them so fucking quick before they go inside anyone. Nice. God damn, you saw that dodge? Okay, we good, we good. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. I was so focused on that nightmare. I was so focused on that nightmare. Like, I totally ignored the other guys. There must be like a really foolproof way to kill them. Like... <sighs> oh, oh. Did that work? Oh fuck. Oh, my brain is like so overloaded. Oh my god. Okay, I cannot I cannot see his movements anymore. Oh my god, shoot that nightmare! Okay, both nightmares are dead, but I have no health. 
I need health. Oh my god. <sighs> I needed health. I wasted so much health focusing on that nightmare. <sighs> okay, okay, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. Got it. Oh god damn. I'm trying to get the nightmare out. Oh my god. Okay, shit, go! Oh no! Wait! Oh my god, he went back in the guy's body. Oh no. Okay, so what I was doing, which was wrong, was as soon as he was in the corner, I wanted to do the frost slam, but I was tapping the button. I didn't know he was still recharging. I didn't know he was still recharging. Okay, the best way to get the, the fucking, um, the best way to get the fucking, uh, nightmares is to use Atreus first until they drop and then you slash with Kratos. It's so tough. Oh no, he went inside the guy's body. No, 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 no. Oh, he's going in the body. Fuck. I, I don't know what's the best way to do this. <sighs> yep, that's fine. Okay, fuck. That really fucking hurts. Fuck it. I got this. I got this. How did I manage to kill both like um, nightmares at once? Okay, he's in the body. Oh my god! Oh, I was so focused on that nightmare! <sighs> Why is Atreus so weak? I need him to kill those nightmares! <sighs> god damn it. I gotta make sure I have enough arrows for when the nightmare comes out. Cause like when the nightmare comes out, if Atreus doesn't have enough arrows, I can't shoot it down. Oh shit, no no shit! No no! Yes! Okay, yes. Both nightmares are dead. Okay, let's uh let's play safe. No, no, no. 
Oh my god, no, no, no. Oh shit! I was focused on the other guy. Okay, so the strategy was to actually, like, once I kill both nightmares, is to go inside that room, and as soon as they attack me, I gotta, like, keep them out, right? So as soon as I parry them, I'm gonna use R1 to push them back so that they can come at me, like, one at a time. That's how, I'm, I, that's how I'm supposed to deal with them. Now it's time to get this nightmare out again. Oh my god, he went back in the guy's body. Jesus. Yeah. gate God damn it. That was the strategy, right? The strategy would have worked without that nightmare. Jesus. Close. Yeah, I'm fighting them 300 style, right? Like, I'm funneling them through the hot gates. And I'm just like a true Spartan, right? I, uh, Kratos is a Spartan. It's more like my brain, like, was like kind of like juggling a million things at once. <laughs> Are you serious? Oh, I'm dead. Fuck, oh, this guy fucking killed me. Okay, my brain was so tired from fighting that nightmare that like, I kinda like needed a break. So like, I couldn't parry anymore. Like, I just ran into that room and I was like, fuck, I need a reprieve. Yeah, that was so pure, but I, I know how to do that again. Okay, let's like not like ignore our health. Oh, I forgot. Hand, hand to hand. Oh my god. Oh, come on. Oh my god. Oh 
I have no health. Jesus. So many mistakes. I'm playing very sloppy. Okay, let's play serious. How many was that? I'm already at 119 deaths. No, 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 don't lock on. No, no, shit! No, fuck! He hit me twice, I'm dead! Yeah, I was saving arrows for the nightmare, how did you know that? Dude, okay, so... It, it feels like the nightmare has like, this bullshit move. As soon as he comes out of the body, he targets you. He immediately wants to go through your body. Right, and I have to parry that guy on top of parry the other two guys. It's almost like as soon as I... As soon as I get rid of the, I get the, the nightmare out, I have to like run away just to like space myself. Oh my fuck, nope. Oh no. Okay, this is really bad. Oh no. Okay, restart, restart. Once once he starts like going into the body, it's over. I need to at least kill one um nightmare. Okay, uh let's not throw the axe. Maybe let's like just shoot him down. Oh fuck. so tired my brain is so tired doing this okay I got this I got this okay just relax I gotta play more relaxed man I'm playing too uptight okay you got this oh fuck okay Okay, I'm saving my arrows for later. Oh fuck. No, no, no. Oh shit! Yes. I'm not used to fighting this guy. Oh, I'm really hurt. Oh, no, no. Oh, I can't see! Oh, I fuck. I couldn't see. Ah. <sighs> okay, okay. So we know the pattern how to beat this, but it's more like the last part is like my brain is so exhausted. But I got this. I got this. This is one of the hardest fights ever. I need, I need Atreus to have his arrows ready. Oh 
Oh no! Oh no, he fucking went inside that guy's body! Oh no. Okay, okay. Oh my god, this is so tough. The guy with the double axe is like a problem. Uh oh. Oh, shit. I'm dead. Oh, I'm dead. Yeah. <sighs> Jesus. Wow. It, it, it feels like if you don't know how to parry in this game, it's a wrap, bro. You can't block. You can't even block. Oh, no. Okay, I need to restart. Once one goes into the other body, I gotta, I gotta redo this. I think heavy attacks doesn't work as well as against the nightmare. You gotta do it really quick. Okay. Oh my god! I hate the guy with the double axe, man. He's so difficult. Because, like, it's not every time he they will highlight when he's gonna attack. You know what I mean? And it's like, obviously, at the first fight, the first area, I, I can't, like, lose any health, man. Oh no. Oh fuck. Yeah, this is no bueno. I I need I need to retry. <sighs> Damn it. It feels like after I kill like one nightmare, the other nightmare like panics and he goes into the guy's body. Oh my god. Jesus. <sighs> I try to think. Wow. Okay, I'm still having trouble with the second nightmare. Like, once he comes out of the body, I think I gotta go into defense mode, but also I gotta have Atreus' arrows to come start raining down. 
And then I got to like focus on light attacks. You can't use like heavy attacks on the nightmare. Nice. Okay. Oh, what was it? What's with that lock on? Oh shit, motherfucker, man. Okay, that was my bad. I don't know what happened. Oh shit. Okay, maybe I should save like my um my runic shit only for the second uh nightmare. Okay, wait, let, let's try it again. Let's try it again. Let's try it again. We we have to hit him as he rises out of the ground and shoot arrows at him. We just kill him with basic attacks and we save the other runic for like the second nightmare. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. Okay, save the arrows, save the arrows. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, my God. Oh, fuck. I wanted to get that nightmare. How do you target a particular nightmare? One, two, six. I haven't figured this part out. If I can do that beautifully, that would be tight. I should use my fist. Oh no, he go he went back inside the guy's body. Just fight. Oh my god. It's not such a bad place to fight over there because like you're being blocked by the wall from the guys throwing the shit. It's not such a bad place. Nice. 
Okay, I'm trying to get the nightmare out of this guy's body first. Oh my god, my health. Oh, now I'm dead. Oh, fuck him. That really hurts. Jesus. Well done. I can't yet. Holy shit. Wow. Oh my god, I did it. That was insane. My mouth is so dry right now. Easy clap. <sighs> My fingers are so cramped. Uh, the real puzzle earlier was the fucking nightmare, bro. Like when I managed to get rid of both of them and I just have to like funnel them through the hot gates over here. <sighs> that was rough. Jesus. Okay, I'm gonna change talisman so I can like start healing. <sighs> what do you think of that fight, uh, Fox? Like, was I, was I getting brain farts all the time? I feel like to a certain extent I got brain fart. Like, like I remember parrying like five times in a row. Like parry, 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 parry. That was insane. I never knew I had to parry so many times. Oh, that was rough. No, not really. That is a tough fight. Yeah, what? How? How did you fare in this fight? Did you do the same stuff? <sighs> you know, I wonder if I was making it more difficult for me because I could have just ran away. I could have just ran up the wall and like hide from them. You know what I mean? That was rough. Wow. <sighs> this is crazy. How are we supposed to kill something made of rock? Be strong, Atreus. Stay focused and look for a weak point. Yes, sir. Damn. 
Oh my god, we really doing this? Yeah, he don't give a shit. Okay, let me recharge my health a little bit first before I go fight him. Damn. I wish there was like a passive that like heals your health outside of battle, because I feel like this part over here is kind of like annoying. Like I gotta wait. See my health is like 50%. I can't go in and fight him. If I if I fight him, he'll just like one hit me. Um can I change uh talismans? Okay, I'm still on cooldown. Okay, I'm just gonna change talismans and I'm gonna fight. 50% health or not, I'm I'm just gonna go in. Oh wait, I got some EXP, right? Uh okay, let me think. Uh what do I wanna get? I think I wanna get like a shield bash thing. They need my vitality to be up to get to use this. Okay, wait, that's not what I want. Uh, what is this? Guardian's Judgment? Shoulder Barrage. Okay, this one seems pretty cool, but it costs 2,000. Alright, fuck it. Fuck it, let's just fight this fool. Stay quiet. Make no sudden movement. Whoa, he dropped something. We can use it against them. Oh, we can? Oh, shit. They got some health behind. Oh wait, they got droggers. Oh my god, that was too close. Wait, I didn't take the health? Shit, R3? R R3? Oh. Holy fuck, what the fuck is that? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> that was it. He was kind of in R3 mode. Th th okay, this guy isn't that hard, to be honest. Um, And also, I was equipping the wrong talisman. Ah, that was rough. Okay, we got this. Stay quiet. Make no sudden movement. Be ready. Oh shit. Shit. 
Oh shit! Ouch, that fucking hurts. Oh come on, can I can I even try this? Damn, that was rough. Why is my head like playing why am I playing so shitty the second time? I usually play like really good the first time. Stay quiet. Make no sudden movement. We can use it against him. What? He, all he takes is like one hit. I'm fine, it will pass. Holy shit. Stay focused. Holy shit. Oh, I'm dead. Okay, that was my fault. I was trying to observe him. I was just trying to see, like, where is he facing. <sighs> this is so rough. I love this game, though. Uh, okay. Cool. Stay quiet. Make no sudden movement. <laughs> We can use it against him. Oh, what the hell was that? Wow, they're sick. Come on. Wait, 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 what did I, what did I, what did I press? What the fuck did I press? Yeah, it's a really cool fight. Does he have any health? Oh, wow. Oh, wait! Oh, he's almost dead. At the red. One more. Oh, what the fuck was that? We did it. Wow, that was sick. Our enemies are. Dude, this is a really cool fight. We did it! I can't believe it. 
Really Fire like, sigil of protection. Increase burn no. damage by fifty percent. Stacks up to eighty five percent max. Thank you, man. It took me a while. I, I I almost did it the first time, but then I ring, ring. I don't remember what Tourist I did. Description. The alchemist. But where's the rest of him? Ashes, most likely. The soul leader got him. I guess we should bring this back to Brock. Yeah, we should. Wow. He he's much easier than like the, the entire mob fight. The mob fight was intense. What is this? Fury of the Ice Troll, light runic attack, a quick radial shockwave attack that slows enemies and sends them flying back. Wow. Fury of the Ice Troll. Wow, this is a uh, AoE. But you need to charge it though, which is kind of trash. Wow, you can upgrade this with the, your EXP. Yeah, I kind of like the 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 hell's touch. It's it's way quicker. Damn. Thank you, Fox. Doesn't this place remind you of a place in uh, Dark Souls? Uh, what was it called again? I think the on your way to the library. You know, like, and then you walk on this surface that like, was like invisible and shit. <sighs> wow. This was crazy, bro. Dude, I'm already like 4 hours and 30 minutes and we're only in this small area. This is crazy, man. I gotta admit, like, I do feel a little bit under leveled in this location. Like, I wish there's a way you can level up. What the fuck is wrong with Atreus? Can he kick that shit down? Wow. Uh, okay, what's this? What does it say? Yes, sir! I feel like another fight is coming up. These runes were written fast. New lore found. It says Gim Steiny. Is this a message from Andvari? What does that he mean? Is it something about the ring we found in his hand? Let's ask Brock. Ejim Steiny. Hmm. I don't know that one. We will ask the blue one. So now you're interested? We found his alchemist. A reward was promised. Ah oh, shit! Here we go. Oh my god. What what the fuck did I press? Wow, what the hell is this guy? What? This guy can dash at you? I think I seen this guy from a warp um warp like portal thing. I don't know how to defend against this guy. Can you parry his dash? What does it say? Yes, sir. Can I skip this part? I think I should save before I I, I hit, hit there. These runes were written fast. It spells out. Ejim Staney. Okay, let's make a quick save so that we potentially don't have to watch this thing again. Ah, <sighs> just when you thought that you destroyed like, you know, the fucking. Okay, wait. What was that skill, that runic skill again? Fury of the Ice Troll. Okay, you can increase its range. But I prefer it hmm. to be quicker. I don't know that one. We will ask the blue one. So now you're interested? We found his alchemist. A reward was promised. Ah! Oh. <laughs> Nice. Yeah, it's much manageable with this guy. Yeah. 
Wow, he can't dodge your shit. Wow. Nice. I think you good? You that was insane. Whew. What did I do to like kill the um I think like the way I killed the nightmare was the first one I just relied on arrows and then I just hit him like crazy. I think I did use the flash because like he was about to get away and then the second guy I did the frost but I still did the arrows again and then you know if I didn't upgrade Atreus I think that fight would have been impossible. Take that and that and that. Boy you are not ready. Um Never really got to use that. Okay, are there no items in here? Wow. This particular area really tests the fuck out of you, man. Oh, we got bad guys. Oh shit. D didn't I parry? I'm set. Almost there. Damn. Oh shit. That wasn't so bad. It feels like my weapons are like not upgraded enough to fight them. These guys are way tougher. Like they're you they, they're supposed to be like regular droggers, but they're fighting like they have like health bars that are insane. Okay. We got hack silver? 800 hack silver. Damn. Uh wow, where is Oh, this was the other side. Are we going to fight again? Maybe. No? Okay, thank god. I was kind of anticipating like they're gonna spawn some bad guys here. Uh, I'm gonna go take a look just to see if we miss any uh, crates or anything like cool like that. Because I feel like the game probably has some secrets that I'm... if I'm... you know... <laughs> Mm, okay, we opened a chest. There was a chest we opened up. I think we've seen this whole place. Okay, cool. Yeah, I think we are good. I oh, I kind of wonder if there are places you can always go back to to farm because like, I you know at least in Dark Souls, if you if you struggle with the game, the game allows you to like. You know, run it back with the enemies and like try to like get better. You know what I mean? It's like you can kind of like grind a little bit, you know, level up your stats and then handle the enemies better. But in this one, not really. Most of your your stats are in your gear. Hmm. Man, everything feels like so smooth. I think we did it. Do I get an overall EXP for this? What'd you find? Your alchemist. I'm sorry, bro. The hand is all we could find. Still wearing the ring. I'm gonna go get some there water. There's a later inside. And well, it must have burned away the rest of him. Man. Suppose you'll still be wanting some compensation. Huh? Yo, what the That's fuck? I better have some. I better have some compensation. What is this? Grip of Volunder. Very low perk activation chance to grant protective barrier, preventing 
damage from enemy attacks or any successful acts hit. Dwarves can do that? Sure, dwarves and magic jewels is like flies and pig lips. Supple ones. Damn. Ooh. I'm not as interested as I thought. Okay, let me see. Grip of Volunder. Um. Okay, wait. Where was that thing again? I think it was the grip. So it has six in strength, six in defense, but yeah, it seems pretty cool. It, I mean, it takes away like stuff away from luck and runic, but I guess stre strength is like dope. And it has a very low perk activation to grant protective barrier, preventing damage from enemy attacks on any successful axe hit. Okay, but I don't understand. That means like, if you attack an enemy, um, it'll, it might give you... You love that one, Jenny Suri? Yo, welcome to the stream. Yo, just to set the record straight, right? If you, if anyone's new in chat, uh, you know, the rules is I don't really like hints and tips, but, uh, I like to make my own mistakes. And what difficulty do you play this on, Jenny Suri? I, I need to go get some water. Do you guys just mind giving me a minute? I'm really out. Just give me a, one minute. Hey, thanks for waiting, guys. Jenny Suri says I've beaten it on the second hardest. It's like a whole different game on Gimme God of War. Yeah, it's fucking tough, man. And I guess like a lot of people have played it on Give Me a Challenge. Gimme God of War was a bit too challenging for me to actually enjoy the game. I feel you. I feel you. Um, I'm just gonna admit it. Like I really, okay, so I played a little bit of God of War when it first released, uh, back in the day. And, um, obviously I picked Gimme God of War difficulty, right? So what ended up happening was I never got past the first, uh, you know, the, in, remember at the start, there was like a, a, a whole bunch of droggers. Um, and then, you know, you just left your house. It's, it's literally the first fight you ever had, right? And like enemies are showing, coming out of the ground. That, that's the first fight. I never got past that. And I quit the game. And, um, you know, I felt that, um, you know, God of War, I kind of like wanted to, to play something else. So I never got to play God of War. But right now, since I have a PS5, I decided to try again. But I'm like a whole different other player because ever since then, like when I kind of gave up on God of War, I went on this incredible gaming journey, right? Like one of my viewers gifted me Sekiro and I was like, you know what? If I'm going to be playing Sekiro, I got to like start from the beginning, right? So I busted out the PS3. I started playing Demon Souls. That was like my first Souls game. Uh, I worked my way up the ladder, like according to release order. So Demon Souls 1, Dark Souls 1, 2, and then I played Bloodborne, and then I played uh, Dark Souls 3, and then I played Sekiro, right? And even before the Souls franchise, I, I played The Witcher. The Witcher actually trained me to be like a parry god. So when I went into Dark Souls, I knew how to parry a little bit, right? I still was getting my ass kicked. And by the time my Souls, like, training was complete, I am a parry god. Like, I have clips of parrying, like, bosses with my eyes closed. Like, that's how good I am, right? And now I'm back in God of War and I can, I can play this game. Like, it's, it's crazy. Yeah, I played, I played the entire Soulsborne franchise and I absolutely love it. And I'm really looking forward to the Elden Ring. I'm pretty sure you're also looking forward to that. But, um, yeah, it's really nice to have you in chat, Jenny Suri. You know, I don't know uh, how long you were lurking in chat. Like how long you got to see me like battle in this game. Wow, we got 5,000 EXP. Just like that. I barely had a thousand earlier. Like how the hell did I get so much? You're exactly the right place for the Gimme God of War playthrough. And there's plenty of heavy RPG elements to tailor your playstyle. Yeah, the first thing I did was like, I maxed out the parry skill tree. You see this parry skill tree? Um, let me see. I don't know if I want to get this one. This one is pretty expensive. This is 2000 EXP. Uh, what it does, it's, it has this powerful shoulder ram, but it only does it if you're barehanded. 
Um, the projectile parry is so fun. Glad you prioritized it. Yeah, I did. It, I I would say that it it saves me in a in a in a fight. Yeah, because like there was like two projectile guys, and I was like, you know what? If I'm gonna like target them, the other guys are gonna like beat me up, right? So I might as well use their projectiles against everyone. Man, it was rough. Um, I'm trying to think like what's a good skill to upgrade next. I guess like charging up the Leviathan Axe to like do more damage when you like before you throw it is pretty good. Um, oh wait, can we upgrade Atreus? Okay, Atreus is maxed out. Yeah, Atreus really came in clutch, man. Like if we didn't have Atreus, if I didn't upgrade Atreus to this point, we would have fucking lost it. Like I would have fucking like, I don't know, man. Okay, let me think. Um. It seems like the entire like barehanded tree is like open up right now. I haven't really spent it much into rage combat because it, it takes so long to build up rage that you like if you spend anything right here, you're not gonna use it that often. Uh Jen oh yeah, Jenny Siri, thank you so much for uh asking me before you share. And since you asked, um do you mind telling me what would you suggest for XP? I kind of not don't mind it if you guys have suggestions like hey man maybe like you know save your exp shit like that like go for it your runic attacks save your exp for runic attacks but the other thing is i don't really know like uh what's the best runic stuff yet like so far the ones that i'm using is pretty cool but um ooh. Look at this, you can like upgrade this to level 3 and it does like... Okay, this is kind of weird. Oh wait, 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 okay, so... My runic attack does plus 2 right now, right? Plus 2 stun. If I go to level 3, I'll have an additional damage and ad an additional stun. All of those are just personal preference. Yeah, that's the weird part, like... I don't know if there's going to be better runic attacks later. So like if I spend my EXP right now on it, it's going to be really, 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 really scary. But you know, you got a point, man. I think if like the runic attacks are going to be very important later. I mean, they are already important right now. Uh, I don't have a rune for Atreus. Um... Okay, let me think, let me think. I think skills are going to be important. Currently, that's what level 2 will do. It currently does no stun. Wow. I thought the whole time it did stun. Oh my god, I thought we were at level 2. I wasn't reading the left side. You were right. It just interrupts enemies. But it is expensive though. It's a thousand bucks for like plus 2 stun. I mean, honestly, okay, let, like, let me give you my honest opinion about this, right? I really feel like this attack, this, this, this kind of move right here. Um, and I remember I used it a lot as a get out of jail free card. Like when I feel like I'm swarmed by enemies, I feel like, okay, I, that's the panic button, right? That's where I like, you know, kind of like give myself some breathing room. But I feel like if I upgrade this like right now, to, like a little too early, I might like use it so much that I might like come come to re rely on it. And I'm not about that pussy life, right? Like I'm I'm really about that like I'm gonna stand and face my enemy and parry that shit. Yeah, it's expensive. I think uh, it's probably a wise idea to really really think about the skills and like if I don't really want to get it right now, I got to like at least like um I got to think about like you know, not spending anything right now. See, some of these, some of these attacks are so dumb. Look at that. Why would I want to sweep the enemies off their fe feet? I don't want to do that. I want them to be standing so that they can attack me some more because my playstyle is I want them to be constantly attacking me so I can parry and I can do the most damage, right? A lot of these attacks are uh, are almost like, you know, like trying to push the enemy away, like keep away, keep away. But I don't like keeping the enemy away. I like fighting up close and personal. 
Okay, I might get this one. I don't have this one. It seems kind of lame though, you know. How many times he hits enemy? One, one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. It does like quick DPS, but I, I don't know if it's worth it. It's 500. Uh, Genesis is relying on your abilities bad. Those are powerful tools that cost nothing to use. Uh, it is bad for certain people and is good for certain people, right? So I'm not saying that it's wrong to have those abilities, but like judging from my playstyle, I might abuse it. And in the process of it abusing it, I might not learn some crucial skills I, I gotta learn. So a lot of times whenever I play games, I, I purposely put myself in a handicapped position because I want to be able to do things that other people can't do, right? Like I want to be able to see attacks. I want to be able to parry every single move, right? And when people start like, you know, like they start training a lot of abilities, they start using like, you know, all the runes, they kind of like, you know, stop focusing on what they're really good at, if that makes sense. I think this is probably good. The runic frost thing. I think it does more damage. So if I'm attacking an enemy from really far away, I guess that's good. Oh. Uh, yeah, let's get this one. Okay. I got 4,000. Um, shield combat. Yeah, the sweeping motion thing is stupid. You, you like like take a look at this right the shield combat is so dumb and let me explain why i think it's dumb okay so why are you using your shield and your fists the reason why is because it creates more stun compared to using an axe right and if you want to create more stun how do you do that you got to be up and close and personal with your enemies you got to be constantly punching them you gotta constantly doing doing stuff. Why would I get abilities that would push them away? It feels like a lot of like the, the skill tree on this side over here is like kind of like keeping enemies away or like kind of like, you know, like unbalancing them. And I'm like, why? I guess maybe like one of the good things is like if I unbalance the enemy with like my fists, I could grab the axe and like do like a finisher. I guess that's pretty cool. Yeah, this one is dope, man. Why, why I really like the shoulder barrage is because I feel that it somehow is gonna be like a, uh, interrupt move. Cause like, you know, I, I noticed that enemies are like always like charging up about to do shit. And if I have this move, it's gonna be super dope. Yeah, stun for ex executioner's cleave. You right. But the shoulder barrage is pretty tight. What do you guys think of the shoulder barrage? Like, I, I, I need you guys' opinion. Do you guys use this move a lot? It's really expensive. It's 2,000. That, that's like half of all my EXP. Spartan Surge. Um... Man, it's so difficult to pull off Executioner's Cleave too because... Oh, it does moderate stun damage. This one does massive amounts of stun. Oh. So if you want to get massive amount of stun damage... Okay, press R2 after performing Guardian's Justice. So Guardian's Justice is this one. Um, okay, so having an amount of stun damage is pretty cool. I might use it in combination with axe throws, throw axe, shoulder, charge, recall. Hmm. Okay, wait, wait. Well, let me try to read what you're saying. Use it in combination with axe throw, throw axe, shoulder, charge, recall. 
Oh, you're right. Oh, I never thought about that. I really never considered it. Re remember there's like a meter underneath the enemy's health and you know, you gotta build that meter in, in order to do like a really cool finisher. Is that the stun meter or is stun completely something different? Yeah, you're unarmed when the axe is thrown. But the, my, my thing was I didn't like pushing them away. That is indeed the stun meter. Wow, that means this is like fucking good. Because like if you read this, it says this builds up moderate amounts of stun. And then at the bottom here, this one does massive amount of stun damage. See, if, if, if I get this, you, you look at the Guardian's Justice, the Guardian Justice and eventually like you get like Guardian's Judgment, it does massive amount of stun. Why would I want to get the first one? Guardian's Sweep is so shitty. It only inflicts a moderate amount of stun. Why would I ever get that? It's like, why would you get an iPhone 7 when you can get an iPhone 13? Right? Okay, this is pretty cool. This one closes the distance. Okay, quick attack. Oh, damn. So many choices. Ah, this is tough. Okay, can I save first? Ooh, Dwarven Favor complete second hand soul. EXP plus 3800. Okay, let me see. Can I upgrade Let's anything? Get to it. Okay, Axe Pommel. We can upgrade the Axe, the Grip of Volunder. So I'm equipped the Versatile Warrior's Handle first, right, right now. Oh, I don't even have enough Corrupted Remains. Wow, this is insane. Like, this increases your strength and defense by a lot. I didn't know I had, like, so many World Serpent Scale Fragments, man. Anvari? Anvari? Anvari is the, 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 the guy that we found his ring, right? Is that Anvari? Perhaps previous skill require entry, maybe. Yo, you might be right. Oh, that's Anvari, okay. Man, I might, I might upgrade my, my grip to Volunder, man. This shit looks pretty, pretty dope. Okay, wait, let me take a look at Atreus. So Atreus's next upgrade is he needs like 4,500. I only have 2,100. Or sorry, 21,000, not 100. All right, does that, yeah, it's only 21,000. I only have 21,000, we need 45,000. That means if I upgrade like something and spend hack silver, I can't upgrade Atreus for a while. Atreus's bow is wrapped in $100 bills. <laughs> Yo, you're right. That's funny. Kid. That's facts. Anything else for you? Uh, okay, let me think. Dude, that's why I never got one of these stupid outfits, man. I never got one of these stupid outfits because they they do like so shitty like they they don't even do that much and it's so expensive. It's like 5,000 a pop. Like why? It's an upgrade that I needed. <laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna deny it. He's really fucking useful. He's like one of the first NPCs that you play with that is so like you need him. You fucking need the boy. Uh oh, I can sell shit too. Ooh, I can get enchanted dust and hack silver. But why can I use enchanted dust for? Oh, you can buy some of these lost items. Oh, I haven't yet sold him my shit. Remember we had like masks to, sh to sell him? You, you, how you don't have to worry about him? You kind of have to because 
if you don't press the square button to shoot with him, he kind of doesn't shoot as much as you would like. Which kind of fucking sucks. I kind of wish that he does it on his own, you know what I mean? But, yeah, man. Well, next time. Okay, wait, hold up. What the fuck? Got a fucking bot in our fucking chat. He doesn't get damage or anything? Yeah, true. True, 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 true. True, 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 true. Okay, let me think about them skills right now. Um, hmm. You're right. It does cause some fucking nice stun. But the, the other thing is, like... I don't even know if I had the opportunity to use this because I'm parrying so often. This one is super cool, man. I, I feel like this is such a interrupting uh, move. Okay, you know what? I'm just going to play it safe right now. Um, I'm not going to spend any EXP on anything. I'm just going to see what the enemies are like in the next area. And as soon as I kind of like have an idea of what they can do, I will adjust accordingly. I will start putting some points into like stuff that I think I need. Okay, let me think. Say, uh, you didn't happen to run yourself a foul of a scruffy fella. About yay high, doesn't feel pain, sounds drunk, but probably just slow. <laughs> hey, how'd you think I feel about it? If I'd wanted Aesir business, I'd have Aesir. set up shop outside a brothel. <laughs> or a fighting pit. Nor a fighting brothel. Damn. Uh, did he say Aesir? Aesir. No. Easier. Sure, I'm open. Okay, let's see. Uh, I'm just trying to check what I need. What can I get you, you little fart? Damn. Oh, I need solid Svalteheim steel. Yeah, I'm not gonna spend any money. It's like for now. What's it gonna be? Uh. Oh, wait a minute. I can I upgrade my talisman? Like All I, right, I have like break. a, I have like a talisman that I really like. Okay, I need something called Dust of Realm, so I can't upgrade that shit right now. All right, it's fine. Come back soon with more crap you found. Okay, let's take a look again at what we got. Oh right, I, I kind of wanted the grip of Volunder, cause I like the fact that it, it does like way more strength. So we might upgrade the grip of Olander for now. So what'd you find out there? I saw you that you like spicy food. Uh, do you watch the hot ones? Yeah, I used to watch a lot of their videos, but it kind of got played out. It's like almost like um, you know, what was what was the guy Sean Evans? He always like repeats the same shit like every episode, and I'm like, bruh, have you ever thought of like just being yourself? Like he he kind of have a script in his whole mind, and I'm like, wow, like. I, I kind of always imagined that like, if I was on the show and I, I was a guest, I would call him out. I'll be like, hey, do you like mind being like a real person right now instead of like being this like fucking Matrix robot reading off a script out of your mind? And he always says the same shit after every episode. Uh, now all we have left to do is roll out the red carpet. Uh, you know, look at this camera, this camera, this camera, tell the world what you're all about. And I'm like... Wow, does he say that same shit to every single fucking person? I mean, I mean, I I, I appreciate his well-researched questions, but he's like fake as shit. You know what I mean? He has that, that whole like persona of like late night television where, you know, like he's like pretending to be nice as fuck. You know, he doesn't ask the real shit. Like the people that I like, um, the interviewers that I love are Howard Stern. Uh, Charmelaine, Char Charlemagne the God, The Breakfast Club. I like being real. I like people that don't like ask the same shit all the time. So like his entire like episodes and videos right now, they just feel like it's just like a brand. You know what I mean? Like, oh, yo, Hot Ones is a brand, you know? Like, come on the show, right? It just feels like a fucking McDonald's. 
I don't like that. I like having some soul in my, my uh, show. Yeah, the hot sauces are cool though. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. I tried like some of the hot sauces they, they have on the show. Uh, delicious. You know, like I have a problem with hot sauces is the fact that like next time I guess I I can't eat them, but my t my my tongue can can swallow lava and magma. I can eat hot food. My butthole can't handle that shit, bro. Bro, like I would go out on the night. I, I will I will go on a night out with my friends. You know, and we would just chow down some like mad spicy wings, and I would love that shit, right? By the time I reach home, I go to sleep, I would wake up 4 a.m. and my stomach would hurt. My stomach and my asshole are like bitches, man. I fucking hate them. Because they can't handle the fucking spice, but my mouth can. Like when I eat that shit and all my friends are sweating and I'm looking at them, yo, you guys are like punks, man. You know, but they don't know. Like when I go home, you know, like I'm literally creating Godzilla in my toilet. Like my shit be so radioactive that, you know, Godzilla is like down there Foxy's repetition uh, repetition and fakery are the keys to success in the YouTube space <sighs> maybe you're right maybe that's why I, I haven't even made it man yeah he feels like a McDonald's like he always like says it with that same cadence like like I think what Janissary was saying like he, he kind of like he's kind of like yo I'm in interview mode right now right and he doesn't even ask the, the real questions we want to, like, ask. You know? Like, it's always, like, he's always trying to, like, butter up the celebrity. He's always, like, he doesn't treat the celebrity like a real person. He's always, like, trying to, like, you know, talk about their accomplishments and, like, trying to be, like, uh, yo, bro, like, you know, I, I'm a big fan of you. I, I, I want to show how a big fan of you I am by showing you that I know your research, right? And he gets a kick out of, like, them, like, praising him. Right? Like, whenever the celebrity w w will be like, yo, that's amazing, man. You can say all of that, all of those things in, like, one take. Like, he loves that shit. You know what I mean? I hate interviewers like that. Because the interviewer is not supposed to seek validation from their guests. The interviewer has to be above the guests. And you're asking the real questions. You're putting them on the spot. Right? You're creating memorable experiences. Like, I love Larry King way more than fucking Sean Evans. Like, the whole thing about Sean, Sean Evans, like, Hot Ones is, like, you just fucking see celebrities, like, fucking sweating. Like, bruh, like, wh why do I need to see that shit? Like, it, it was cool the first time, like, first few episodes, and then everyone and their grandma wants to be on the show, right? Fucking Shaq, Kevin Durant, fucking, you know... I don't know, man. George Clooney, who who gives a fuck, right? Right, it's the same shit. Like there are no stakes, right? I need some stakes. I need like Birdman coming into the, your office and like with with and he's rolling in with people and you never you don't know if your whole studio is gonna get shot up. And I'm talking about the Breakfast cl Club incident where he came in and he was like telling Charlemagne like, "Yo, put some respect on my name, man." And Charlemagne was like, "Yo, I'm just a radio guy, man." I, that became iconic. Sean Evans don't have that shit. Foxy's depends on the celeb for me. I just skip all the SoundCloud, SoundCloud, Cloud rapper episodes. Yeah, man, they don't even talk like real people. You know, you, you realize like SoundCloud people, uh, not SoundCloud, like, like mumble rapper, rappers in general, they are like playing, they are playing a character. They, they always like talk like, do you know what I mean? Like, I'm just, I'm, I'm just put that thing there and it's like bruh and then sometimes they slip up sometimes they talk normally and then they gotta go back and they're gonna be like you know that's how I do you know put put, put, that, put that thing on I can't even do that fucking shit they do right because I talk too well I fucking hate those guys yeah mumble rappers fucking suck right my favorite rapper is like Eminem Snoop Dogg Yo, Dicky, Lil Dicky, he's really good. Kendrick Lamar, dope. Drake, dope. Kanye, dope. Um, fuck, who was that guy who retired, man? There was a guy who fucking retired. And he did like a collab with um, Eminem. I can't remember his name right now because my brain is so tired. 
Logic. Logic is so fucking good. Logic. Have you guys ever listened to Logic? Chicka, 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 chicka. You know that song? Damn. Guess I, I, I'm the only one in, ch- in like, uh, chat or the stream right now that likes hip hop. Ah, uh, alright. Let's get back to upgrading Let's that do pommel. So, wait, wait, wait. Uh, upgrade the Leviathan, uh, X pommel. So, Grip of Volunder, it increases the strength and defense to 8, which is pretty cool. It's expensive though, 4200, I'll do it. Fuck it. Hey, fun splitting heads. Hey, fun splitting heads. Appreciate that. Can you upgrade it like two times? Oh, you need like... Oh, wow. Cool. So, uh... You sticking around for grains of wisdom? God damn, this guy likes to talk shit, bruh. He kind of reminds me of the, like, the, the, like, Hercules, Disney Hercules, like, trainer. What was this guy, like, Phil? Or what was his name again? He was like, hey, kid, you're gonna be some real special. You know that guy? He, he speaks with that, like, I don't know, like, that New York accent. Coffee. Is his name Phil? Hey, I'm walking over here. And I also like Hades, man. Hades was like so funny. Hades had like this sleazy, like lawyer, like personality that I love. And he's always adjusting his hair. I think that's my favorite character. One of my favorite characters or villains. And he's like, he's always like, hey, come on, come on, come on, come on. You know, let's do oh. business, you know, right? Damn. And remember that scene where the two little demons, they like wore like, like Hercules shoes and they call it Air Herc. It's kind of like, like kind of an homage to Air Jordans. And then he was like squeaking around with the shoes and then like Hades was like, what is that? Oh, I don't know. It's, uh, I kind of like it. <laughs> you know, and I was like, damn. They don't make cartoons like that no more, man. Now it's all like woke shit. Damn, that was, this was a, oh, whoa, I almost missed that. Wow, first try. Give me some of that gold. 298. Damn. I will find my way. I can go the distance. Bucket. Damn. This is a, like only one section we found, bro. I'm not, I'm not even doing the main mission yet. Like, ever since we, I came here, I was like, yo, fuck the main mission, bro. I'm out exploring with my boy. Creating lasting bonds with my, my boy. Wow, look at that world serpent, man. I think I'm gonna hug the corners around and just see if I can find another, like, spot. Ooh, we got some barrels. I think there's gonna be some money. Give me that. Ooh, wait a minute. What what is this? Oh 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 What the fuck is this place? Whoa. This place is so fucking creepy, bruh. Okay, I'm just doing a circle around just to like pick up any corpses or like crates. Where? I don't see no loot. Oh yeah, I think I see some. Uh oh. Oh, we got some enemies. It was good. Ooh, isn't this like, isn't this like giant in the treasure map? There was a treasure map I picked up. Wow. Is it right here? Damn, they carved them up real good. Ooh. Oblivion Stone. Legendary. A stone that hungers for energy and absorbs it on contact. Co coveted and hoarded by dwarves. Used to upgrade pommels with life draining damage effects found in treasure map caches. Yeah! Good catch, right, Janissary? Dead and bloated. Inlaid Chest of Courage. 
Wow. Yo, Genesis, did you play this game on like uh, PS4 or PS5? Well, well, what? The Brazier? If you must. Shit. Wait, wait, hold up, hold up, hold up. Before we commit to, to anything, let's like look around. Ooh. Because something here. PS4. I'm playing on PS5. Does it look better? I don't have like much memory of it on PS4, so you know I never played it this far on PS4, so I I don't really know. Ooh, what is this? You help a buddy platinum on PS5, though. Wow. Is uh platinuming this game hard? I I don't I don't platinum games anymore. I used to do that shit when I was a kid, but now I I couldn't give a fuck. You know what I mean? Like for me, it's like. Like, what is a platinum for me is like beating the game on the hardest difficulty. Shit, they're gonna make us fight over here, I bet. I you can't really tell, to be honest. It's always look incredible. You right? Boy, over here. I heard like the textures are, are incredible and it's 60 Convinced. frames on um, PS5, so it feels really smooth. Enemies ahead! What the fuck? Oh, what the hell is this guy? Oh, you can't parry that. Yeah. Oh shit. Oh. Yeah, I need to I need to I, I don't know how to fight these, these guys. Damn, I barely healed from their shit. Nice. Oh cool. Oh wow, I'm dead. I'm not used to fighting these guys. I think like the best way to fight the little creepy crawly guys is to kind of like sit tight and wait till they show up and parry them. Gen C is quite time consuming, prize combat, collectible, grinding, combat trophies so fun. Yeah, the FPS is incredible in, in combat. I don't know what the fuck that guy is. He's like... He seems to be fire elemental. So maybe we should like, um... Okay, maybe we should like... Oh, I remember having something that it gives me like defense against fire elements, right? Yeah, I have fire sigil of protection. Symbol of menace, inlaid courage, strength. Um, Vitality to defense. Uh, I would prefer to have like uh, some damage. Wait, what's this? Duelist Protective Barrier High Perk Grants Protective... Oh, oh wait it! It grants Protective Barrier Preventing damage from enemy attacks on any successful parry What the fuck? This is so good Really? Is that for real? The guy with the poison mace? Oh, I thought that was fire My bad Okay, uh, let me see. Okay, I'm just I'm just making sure, like, I got the best shit. Yeah, defense uh, plus two is probably better. I like defense. All the parries. Yo, I'm a parry god, bro. It's more like it just boils Boy, down to the enemy. Over here. Okay, come on. Come on. Yeah, come on. Yeah, I see the guy up there. What the fuck is he doing? That was sick! That was sick! Wow, he explodes? You can't parry that shit. 
Yeah, I parry that shit. I got parry for days. Wow, he explodes. I fucking hate that. Why does he explode like that? This fucking guy. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, he explodes. I know that. Got that parry. Come on. Come on. Ooh, where you at, boy? Come on, get out of here. Oh, shit. Yeah, we good, we good. We good. Come on. Where he at? How do you fucking fight this guy? Did we, did we fucking- Oh shit, he's still alive? Okay, fuck it. Nice. Get the fuck out of here, little bitch. Give me back my health. How do you fucking fight this guy? Sorry, not ready. You can't even parry this bitch. Oh, he re he runs away. Oh, he's healing. Oh. That was one hit? I had full health. What the hell? You love that leaping punch to Tetzel Worm in Rage. Yeah, that was sick, right? Yo, one hit? Okay, it's whatever, man. I mean, I don't even know how to fight that guy. I mean, he's that's my first time. Kvakia. here. Alright, be cool. Yeah, yeah. Come here. Come here, boy. It's a Tetzel Worm. Why does he have such a stupid name? Damn. Damn. Beautiful. I'm a parry god. Dude, come on. Get that shit out of here. Oh, he actually does no like normal attacks. Come on, get that shit out of here. Come on! I play Dark Souls, bitch. But yet. Come on, get out of here. Get out of here. Ooh! Oh, he hits you. He kills me with one hit the last time. Yeah, I can't fuck around with this guy. You so bitch. Oh, wait. Oh, I forgot to call back my axe. Oh. Oh my god. Did he just level up? Yeah, little bitch. What the fuck you doing, man? What are you doing, my friend? Oh, wait! My health! Oh. Wow, what the fuck is he doing? Wow, how is his health recovering so fast? Ready? 
Oh my god! Oh. Father! Father! He, he, he somehow like stunned me. I couldn't move, I couldn't dodge, I couldn't block. I was just like standing in place. He told me to get the hell back on the boat. <laughs> Damn. Give me God of War, I ain't playing around, bro. Yo, yeah, go we'll read that shit. Yeah. What? I, I don't know what causes him to regenerate so fast. And like, Atreus' arrows don't, don't really do shit against him. Nice! Oh shit, I fucking hate it when they explode like that. Oh, run, 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 run. Get the fuck out of here, man. I'm, I'm kind of a natural in go God of War, uh, uh give me God of War mode, right? Oh shit, no! Where yet? Isn't the Tetzel Worm still here? Is the Tetzel Worm dead? Oh, he's still here. One more to go. Okay, one more to go. Does he ever do like normal attacks? Oh shit, he doesn't do normal attacks! Yeah, he doesn't do normal attacks. I, I wanted to parry that. Oh, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. He doesn't do fucking normal attacks, bro. Oh, the axe isn't working! Wait. Wait, the axe isn't working? Oh, shit. Oh, ooh, he almost killed me that time. I'm really tearing the needle. Oh my god, what the fuck is this? Why is he recovering all his health? Why does he recover all his fucking health, man? His stun doesn't even build up that fast. Is the axe not working or is it working? I don't know. It, 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 it does work from time to time. Damn. 
Oh, God damn it. Oh, I'm dead. Ah, you vote Jerry? He seems like a Jerry. I, I keep hearing, like, I, I hear from time to time Atreus says, like, the axe doesn't work against him. Jerry's an angry man. The annoying part about him is, like, he does a lot of attacks that you can't really parry. And he seems to be, like, Okay, he seems to, like, also, like, level up really quickly and heal, in, heal himself. I don't know what's the strat to beat him, but, like, let me figure it out. I'm gonna try it, like, two, three more times, and then you guys can give me advice. But I, I'm, I think I might be able to figure him out. Because he's not, like, a reflex, like, a uh, boss, because I, I have the reflex. <laughs> Boy. Sir. Oh shit. No, 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 no. Oh my god, my health. Come on. Come on. Oh shit! Yo, I had to do it, I had to do it. I'm playing really sloppy right now, but uh, you know. God damn it. Oh, you can parry that. Nice, Sue. Nice. Ooh, I can parry that. Oh, you got rage. Oh, okay. Oh, I could parry that. Almost ready. This is a dirty cheating ba bastard. Yo, little bitch, cheating ass. Oh, so you gotta aim for his head at his head. Oh, that was easy. Okay, so it was my mistake because I feel like you gotta like hit his head when he's recharging. Oh, you're right, you're right. I, I was aiming wrong. I feel like whenever he's about to like recharge or like level up, you gotta hit him with the axe. Because Atreus's arrows are like so fucking trash right now. GG, thank you, Fox. What do you want? To thank you. These dead reavers drowned me many winters ago. And I've been itching to see him And get fighting theirs. with your bare hands against him was like not that good. Indeed. I came to the Lake of Nine to pillage Tears Temple. Thank you, Jen. But I underestimated the severity of the desolation. Yeah, I figured it out. Have yeah, yeah. It wasn't that hard, to be honest. Living? I just kind of wondered, like, what, what the fuck? I, I might, I must be Only able to stop him. One standing in front of me. Thank you both for avenging my death. Yeah. Really good voice acting. Ooh, we got some. Useless. Well, corrupted remnant. Can't expect the legendary. Ball to something useful. Oh, we can't upgrade the versatile war's handle. Okay, we, we gotta free like one more spirit, so we free three out of four. Wow. What the hell was this for? Oh wait, I gotta give Atreus a boost. 
I like the fact that I'm getting stronger through knowledge and not through stats. Even though, like, I kind of miss having that stat building ability, kind of like Dark Souls. I really do miss it. I guess in a sense, you still can build up your stat, but it's mainly through equipment. Ooh, 3,500 hex silver. Nice. What was that? He kind of stabbed the mask. What is that? Hack silver? Another cipher piece. Cipher. Let's see what I can fit together. Okay, cipher. More money. Abandoned ship. Seven out of nine ship hits found. Damn. Which one is your guys' favorite? Oh, maybe we should like do a poll once we got all of them. Like, the EXP doesn't straight just makes you up do more damage to give you more skill and capabilities. Yeah, I don't know. I, I kind of, like, love simplicity. Like, I don't like a game that has way too many things. Like, Dishonored, like, felt like... It just felt like a fucking Indian restaurant menu. You know what I mean? They have everything from Indian food to Mexican and... Oh, what the fuck? You guys see that item over there? Wow, they got mad items over there. Shit. But how are we gonna get there? Yo. Okay. Um, what was I saying? I don't even remember. Hey, if you guys enjoy this channel, you enjoy my stream, and you are a new uh, viewer here, make sure you hit that follow button, man. You know, I'm a really small channel. I appreciate you guys showing me that love. How the fuck we get up there? I think it's like a separate like exit or entry. It's not connected at all. Then look at this giant. Why is this giant skin also blue in color? It's kind of weird. Maybe the next you guys believe in giants? Keep your expectations low, boy. Spirits are rarely useful. How yeah. do they even exist? When you sever a man from his life. It is not always a clean cut. So you've met other spirits? Yes. Bro, oh, don't Many. punch the bloated giant like? corpse. Why not? Annoying. I do what I want. Ever consider follower notifications? Uh, I did. But then, like, pe like there were trolls that used follower notification to say, like, really racist shit. Right? So sometimes they would, like, have a really racist name. And then, like, the racist name would show on channel. I, I can't do that. It was really messed up. Right? And it's it's also a good thing as a streamer mentally not to kind of know how many people are following because you know like like oh hold up. Hold up guys. Uh I got I probably got some mail. Gen says I run Commander Root once a week or so and it blocks bot accounts automatically. Haven't seen any of those bots since. How do I run one of those? I don't know I don't even know what the hell is a commander root. Like is it like an invasive thing you put into your stream? I don't know what that is. Like, can you... Are you a programmer or something? Oh, oh, we got like one more spirit location we haven't solved yet, right? Uh, I think it's probably here. Commander Root. Damn. Okay, more hack silver. Oh, look at this. If you search Commander Root, it's a website that keeps a list of known bots. You have to give them access to your Twitch account to block them. Yeah, probably not. Here? I don't know uh too much about it to trust it, if that makes sense. You know what I mean? Yeah, you know what? It's not that bad to like occasionally block them by hand once in a while, so yeah, I'm not really sweating. What the fuck? Oh fucking hell, bruh. What? How the fuck do you like... Oh, I'm almost dead. Wow. Oh, 
Okay, I'm good. I'm good. Wow, I hate nightmares. I don't really know what's a good way to fight them. It requires the trust, but I love it. You're a useful tool. You should chat and give additional layers of protection. Cool. Nah, I don't give a shit. To be honest. <laughs> Sorry. I'd rather, like, you know, have a slight inconvenience than, like, a permanent regret, if that makes sense. I think, like, my problem with, like, the enemies is sometimes I, like, don't fight, like, slow enough. I should be returning their projectiles. Okay, wait, we got one over here, we got one up here, and... Oh, wait, I think there's a bird flying somewhere, I can kind of hear it. Isn't that like a uh, fucking what's his name? Like Odin's bird? Where the fell? Where the fuck is he? Oh, he's up there. Oh fuck! I was kind of hoping as a viewer that you have more channel point redemptions. The chatbot could help with that. No, uh, I I need to know like. I was asking earlier like, what do you guys think I should have something to redeem for points? I don't really know. Can Atreus, like, shoot this motherfucker? Do you have any suggestions? Yeah. Wow. Pretty tough. Ooh. How do you get this thing, man? Okay, hold up. Damn, it's too fucking fast. Oh, it was close. Okay. Oh, come on, man. Uh, okay, a bit lower, a bit lower. Okay, a little too quick and a little bit lower. Yeah, Jen, do you have any suggestions? Adding a quote from you would be fun. Uh, challenges for your current game. Do the next fight without the extra or bare hand. Play little sound effects, others. I have redemption with a viewer can write an achievement for me that shows on screen with the Xbox animation. Cool. So you're on Xbox, huh? How is like Xbox console right now? Like, do you guys have, like, some dope games? Like, other than Halo 3? Uh, Halo... F what, 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 uh, Halo Infinite? I love Halo from back in the day, man. But I don't really have a reason to get an Xbox. Dude! You do a little bit of everything. It's pretty great. You're primarily PC. Gotcha. Oh, come on! How did that not hit? You can play on Halo on PC. Oh shit, you're right. Dude, am I am I too low? Dude, what the fuck? Do you see it, it actually hit something? The axe drops over long distance. Yeah, but like... I definitely hit it. Shit. Oh my god. What would be the best way to take it out? Maybe if I climb up here? Oh, maybe if I did climb up here. Oh, oh, look at that. It's, it's, in, it's in my path. All right, it's in my path. This was a better angle, man. I was I was playing it on hard mode. Here we go, go bitch. Oh, what the fuck? Here we go. Boom. Told you. I told you. First try. First try. Let me see. Yeah, from downtown. Exactly. Steph Curry. 
Shot it from the parking lot. What the fuck? Oh shit. Where's the third one? Oh wait, here? Oh no! Ah, oh, god damn it. Okay, I got it, I got it. No mistakes. No mistakes. Oh, come on! First try, motherfucker. First try, motherfucker. Give me that. Bird just ignores it. Yo, that bird ain't a bird, man. It's like an AI. It's like the Matrix. You know what I mean? They copy that shit. Doesn't it look like a bird from the Matrix? He has like that green color, like shimmer. We got, ooh, Eden's apple. Number two. Very nice. Man, isn't this the second spot for the spirits? Birds aren't real silly creators. Yeah, it does look like the Matrix, right? How do we- how do we blow this fucking shit up? Wait a minute, okay, maybe we gotta get up there. Uh, okay. Oh, I see like a rope over there. And then you can like descend uh, from up there. Okay, it's not- it's not that bad. We- we first gotta get on that bridge over here and then we can go here. Is that a pot? Ooh, three hack silver. Baby. I'ma buy myself a soda. Do they have even sodas in Norse? Ooh, look at they got a corpse over there. Okay, let's go. I don't think this is like another like um I don't know spirit like thingy. Let's just keep it moving. I'ma I'ma hit that corpse. You know, this game is mad disrespectful, bro. We are like hitting corpses, opening up coffins. Who built you, you think? I do not know. Whoa. Is it- is that- Oh, this one is like, uh, Thor, right? Yeah, I think this one was Thor. Yeah, initially, like, the water was like really high. We only can see, like, its chest. Oh, I think this goes back to the witch's house. But that's for later. Why am I the only one rowing, man? Like, like boy is like being very lazy. We are not teaching the boy any life skills. I guess like we are driving the car. I guess that's what it is. Damn. Uh, let me take a look at the map. Ooh. Unfinished business. Explore the islands on the lake. Do you have a lake? Okay, light the braziers and speak speak to the spirits of the uh the lake of nine. Oh, we got one more. Cool. Okay, let's keep it moving. Are we there yet? <laughs> I no one don't have no kids. What do you guys think? Do you guys like kids? I fucking hate kids. Man, get that shit away from me. You know what I mean? I don't like kids at all. Cause like, I, I have this feeling like kids are gonna grow up to be adults anyway and adults are shitty. So it's it's like, I don't know. Like people are so shitty that I, I never ever viewed a kid like as something that was like, oh, he's so pure, he's so cute. I, I'm like, I don't like that. I like animals more. I like cats, I like dogs, I like, you know. You hate them? Yo, high five. High five? <laughs> wah wah wee wah. We do not like kids on this channel. <laughs> what the fuck? Why is that shit glowing? Oh wait, we did that one already. Okay, so there should be another one here, right? Yeah, I think there's another one here. We gotta go deeper. Deeper and deeper. Oh, we got some barrels. Gonna look for some fucking gold, man. Ooh. Okay, that looks like something. I think we are close. Oh, there it is. Oh no, we're gonna fight. 
Man. This game is rough. Uh oh. I think this is the last one. Might as well. Shit. Right? Okay, right. wait, wait, wait. How's my health? Okay, my health is full, so let's not use this for now. Can I blow this fucking rock? Wait a minute. This is this rock looks like it's blow blowable. Blow upable. Okay, fuck it. Let's do it. Yeah. Boy. Boy. Yes, Kavakia. Kavakia, motherfucker. Pull up. I'm gonna fight like. Oh. Oh shit. God damn. Oh my god, my health. Oh shit. Oh no, 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 no. Oh my health, my health. Okay, I need health. God damn it. Oh, am I dead? What did he do? What did he do? What is that white light? Can someone like explain that to me? What was that white light? Is that heaven? Dad of boy. <laughs> Yo, God, uh, dad of war. Yeah. Dude, what the fuck, bruh? Look here. Okay, hold up. Thank you. I'm ready. Bitch! Cool, cool, cool. Oh wait, I could I couldn't see. Oh what the fuck? I couldn't see, motherfucker. What the f oh you can't parry him. Okay. These guys got fucking shields, bro. Oh my god. Oh my god, they're leveling up. Uh oh. Oh, he's healing. That's how they heal. God damn it, man. Oh my god. Wow, they don't they don't stop like healing. Why, why am I locked on? I think I'm locked on somehow. No wonder I could I was moving so weird. Oh my god. Oh fuck. Oh, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. Shit. Damn it. Holy shit, that was a little too close. Sorry, not ready. Oh shit. I think he's like level three right now. God damn it. Oh 
Come on, that guy's almost dead. Oh shit. Oh shit, my fucking god. Oh, oh, oh. My brain. My brain cannot take any more of this. I don't know how I'm alive, bro. Yeah, he dead. I'm not gonna risk it. I'm too tired. I've been playing this game for five hours. I'm a parry god, but fuck this. What the fuck? Oh, I thought he. Whew. Well, that's over. You, I must speak with you. Guys, that was Remember all. That was all planned. I wasn't in trouble. I, I was just pretending. It. This is Twitch acting. I gotta pretend that I'm like like you guys sometimes. That I'm not that good, just to make it seem exciting. You know What's what I mean? Wrong? I came to this lake with a group of tradesmen seeking refuge from the desolation. But how could we know it was even worse? If Does this game keep track of your deaths? We cannot undo your mistakes, Spirit. Does this game I keep? That, but Yo. I fear for my captain and crew. I believe they are still under the water. Who cares? Will you find them for me? Is there anything you can offer us in return? I. I have little to offer. Oh. Well, I'm not sure. Wait! I died wearing a valuable family heirloom. It's yours, if you promise to find my crew. Damn. Deal. Thank you. Who? Cool. What is this? Corrupted oh, Remnant. Him. Mystic Remnant, legendary, used to upgrade versatile war's handle. I won't speak for your mother, but it was never my concern. Nor never should it be yours. Nor Doesn't should it be yours. Doesn't it concern us if everything around us is dying? What the fuck is this? Our only concern is reaching the peak. Really? Then why are we exploring all these islands? The resources we find improve our equipment. If Damn, we Kratos from giving the path, excuses, man. It is only to prepare ourselves for the journey ahead. I can Damn. live with that if it means we keep exploring. And helping others. <laughs> Atreus is like almost like uh, Kratos' conscience, you know what I mean? Kratos is like a hard motherfucker, man. He can't show any weakness. No weaknesses. Like, oh, he had all his weaknesses beat out of him like uh, a thousand years ago by his daddy Zeus. Man, we did it. Uh, wait. Did we have like a quest? Shit, I need to heal, man. Ooh, what the hell is this? See this? This is like poison. Uh, wait, what was the quest to find like this guy's like ship, uh, rack people or some shit? What was the quest again? How do I look for a quest? Oh, it's under Codex maybe. Oh no, this is lore, this is Bishuri. Weapons, armor, skill, map, goals, goals. Um... Yeah, yeah, goals. I, I don't know why they didn't put it as quest. Like, I'm so used to seeing the word quest as I was looking for the word quest. Uh, okay, complete the mausoleum language cipher. Okay, realm of fire. Wait, wait, wait. How do we, how do we trigger it? Dock at the bridge. Path to the mountain. Okay, so... Return to the house. Okay, so we did like... Oh, yeah, this is the main quest, right? Hammerfall is... Destroy the statue of Thor. Uh, what's the other one? Find all Jortner shrines. Eye of Odin hidden chamber. Wow, there's a lot of these. Treasure map. Artifacts. Okay, so I think we should try to focus on this one. Do they show it on the map? Oh, it's on the other side. Okay, so... Destroy the statue of Thor. I thought I'd been to Vader Guard. Like, why is there like another location at Vader Guard? Um... 
I'm not sure if you'll be able to do that one currently. Okay, I don't know, man. I'm, I'm gonna just hit there just to, just to take a look. You know, if anything, we can still like shop at Brock's store just to see if we have like something we can upgrade. Uh, what is this? Isle of Death. Yeah, this is like a, a realm tear encounter. I can't, I can't do these ones. These ones are so hard. Vader Guard is beautiful. Yeah, it is. Damn. Wasn't it? Didn't I go there and like I did the whole like dwarven ring thingy? Remember? I remember. Pepperidge Farm remembers. Oh wait, I can hear a bird. Wait, wait, wait. Where the bird at? I heard a bird. Wait, wasn't there a bird around here? Oh, there it is. Okay, I need to like kill it. So I'm gonna like dock over here. I think I've been here before. Yeah, I did. I did. My health is so low. Look at like my screen flashing red. red like Ultraman. Uh, okay, I'm gonna switch talismans just to heal real quick. I have a talisman that allows me to heal. Cool. Was that Envari's ring was at the Volunder Mines? Okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna figure it out. Don't worry, Jen. I appreciate you trying to help though. Wow, it's like really far away. God damn. <laughs> Damn, I don't think I can get this one. Yeah, it's flying real close to the to the thing. Yeah, I, I don't think I can reach it. Hmm. Yeah, I always I guess I can always get that later. It's no sweat. I like that you can hear the ravens when they're nearby. It's a nice touch. Yeah, I got I got surround headphones. It's really good. This is very immersive, by the way. I can almost hear like any direction the sound is coming from. You know, uh, and this is a wireless Steel Series uh, Pro, I think. Ooh. Okay, let me take a look at the map. So. Vadergard pass, go here and over here. Hammerfall. So I've been given this quest by this fucking corpse ghost thing, and he said like, you know, Thor like kill his mom or some shit like that, and then like he wants me to destroy Thor's statue just as revenge, and I'm like, man, that shit is petty, bruh. You know? It always feels like the gods in this game in all the God of War games are a little bitches. Oh, I forgot. You can actually you can actually go there from the bridge. Maybe you should go to the bridge. Nah, not yet, not yet, not yet. Later. Oh, barrel. I almost didn't didn't see it. I need that hack silver, bro. Everything is so expensive in this game. I wonder if you can farm hack silver like this. Like if I reload the game, you know, I just like save and quit. I come back and just keep farming. Okay, wait, this is not the way. This is towards shop, Valunder Mines. Have I been there? I don't remember. It does it it is a shop? I don't remember the shop. See, I've been to the one at Vader Guard, but I I don't think I've been to this one. Was there even a shop? Yeah, this is the one with the giant corpse, right? They say there's a shop around here. Like, what the hell? Okay, yeah, I don't see no fucking shop. I think that's... We're, we're, we're stopped over here. Oh, okay. I think it's like a separate entrance. Maybe. Yeah, it's not this way. The stereo sound design is so well done. Much of the combat is double blindfolded. I don't know what that means. 
Could I give you one bit of advice that makes navigating faster? I, I'm supposed to follow my compass, right? Yeah, I know about that, yeah. Ooh! This is new. Volunder Chasm. Not quite. Nah, no tips for now. No tips, but thanks for asking though. Appreciate you, um, you know, doing that. Oh, I've never been here. This is new. Oh, what the hell is that sound? Oh, my talisman fully recharged. That means I can heal myself again. Yeah, this is new. Or was it? Wait, have I been here before? This just seems really familiar. Yeah, I've been here before. Oh, it's a totally separate place. Yeah, I've been here. Okay, yeah, we've been we've been here. The the place that I keep confusing that I went to the other side, but it, it's like yeah, I know where to go. Combat is doable blindfolded, like you can do it on sound only. Really, that's super dope. I know, like some of the uh combat designers for this game came from the original trilogy for God of War. Like my favorite from the game was God of War Two, which is like pretty funny because the director for that game is making he made this one. Corey, Corey Barlog. Yeah, that's his name. Yeah, he, he made like God of War 2 like so, so fun to play. I kind of regret playing this like right now because I should have done like a full trilogy run of the original. Maybe I can still do that, but maybe like later. Wait, have I been through here? Yeah, I thought. Yeah, this is the Vader Garp Pass. Yeah, I think I've been through here. Wait, maybe not. I don't know. It looks this. Yeah, I've been here, right? Yeah, I've been through here. Uh, let's see what he got. Oh, I never got past this this area. Be extra careful out there, you two. The roads are teeming with more than usual complement of dead assholes lately. Damn. We've noticed. Any idea yeah, I still, I still don't have enough gold. Maybe they ran out of rooms in hell. <laughs> or could be Odin stirring up trouble again. Stirring up or trouble. maybe they all got lost. Why don't you ask one while he's chewing your face off? Uh, we'll just be careful. Brock better than Odin. <laughs> yeah, he got tons of personality. Uh, I got- I can upgrade the versatile warrior's handle, but I feel like I don't know if it's that worth it. Because the grip of Volander gives me like so much strength and defense. Um, yeah. Yeah, I don't know man, if it's worth it. Nah, I'm cool. I see. Just wanted to stare into my eyes. <laughs> Yo, talking mad <gasps> shit. Wow, you can count every blade of grass in here. We are really progressing this game, man. Oh my god, I've been streaming for six hours. Uh oh. Yo, what's good? My health is so low. Atreus advanced combat. Atreus has gained confidence in combat and will now support creators by physically attacking enemies when he sees an opening. These abilities can be upgraded in the skills tab. Oh, can we like have more? Oh wait, I mean like he doesn't have the skill tree yet. Damn. Oh my god. Wow. Oh wow, it's so hard to see him like... It's so hard to see him like telegraph his move. Fuck, I, I, no, I, I was cool. I was cool. I wasn't even warmed up. Damn. Okay, let's try our shit again. 
Um, you know, whenever I start using like the runic attacks, it's usually like a panic button. I shouldn't even be using that. I should be focusing on like basic parrying and blocking and whatnot. You'll get him. Focus up, boy. Oh fuck. Wow. Go with some health. Wow. That was barely a parry. I can't tell like how are they gonna attack. That wasn't a parry. I can't tell exactly when they're gonna hit. Okay, was that a parry? Nice. Okay. I really, I really don't have enough practice against the wolves. What I don't like about this game is like... You don't have much opportunity to really master like enemies. Right? Because the only times you can meet enemies is like if you go to a new area. You know, I used to complain a lot about this about in Dark Souls, right? Like in Dark Souls, I used to complain the fact that... Oh, I fucking hate that enemies respawn, you know? What the fuck is up with that? You know, when I kill an enemy, I want him to be dead, right? But now I know better than that, bro. It's like, I would want an area where I can practice. Like, oh, okay, I'm kind of weak against wolves. You know, I kind of need that, that work, you know? Thank you, Fox. But I feel like it's, every time I get in, reintroduced to them, I gotta like kind of remember how they attack. And I, that kind of sucks. Oh, by the way, uh, let's switch the talisman. Ooh, what the hell is this? Wait, treasure. Man, I have, I'm having such a good stream today, man. Uh, today's stream has been pretty dope because I guess the game has also been pretty baller. Um, you know? You know, when I come back streaming again next week, I'm gonna start again with Hitman 3. What happened to these people? Follow the clues. Okay. Wait a minute, wait a minute, well, wait a minute. Why are we going here market. when there's a door? They're all grouped together. So maybe they were hiding from some kind of fire breather. They died anyway. Ooh, I almost didn't know there was a treasure here. Thank you, Fox. I really try. I really try. It's tough. It's tough playing this game. But I love it. You know, this game really, like, captures my imagination. You know? Like, I get really bored when games are too easy. Do you guys feel that way? Like, we play, play games some, sometimes and it's like mad easy and you feel like, bro, why is this game so pussy? You know what I mean? It's like, like everyone doesn't like a challenge anymore. Gamers of a hardcore nature are a rare breed. You know, built different. Uh oh. Wow. Very cinematic. <laughs> you know, games always like to crawl through shit to make it like cinematic. You totally watching you, your experience in Master Level Peace game for the first time. Yeah, you totally enjoy. Thank you, bruh. Oh my god, not again. What the fuck? Oh my god. How the fuck? How? I can't tell. I can't tell when they're gonna attack. Oh my god. They don't telegraph their movements. I can't fucking tell. Damn, nice. That was sick. I fucking hate the wolves, man. There's like no like sense of like how they're gonna attack. 
Like, I don't see them telegraphing their movements. Uh, okay, what's this? Boy, over here. Yes, sir. Curse the Dwarf King. Bane of mankind. Sounds like he wasn't a very good king. I wonder why they hated him so much. They are dead now. They hate us because Doesn't they ain't us. No. An unbreakable chain. Odor has escaped his binds yet again. Instead of flying off this time, he seeks revenge on his captors and is determined to turn Vadergar to ash. We seek shelter in the outlying caves where we found sanctuary in the past. Our king assures us his next chain will be unbreakable. If anyone can break an unbreakable chain, it's Mosonir, architect of the great stronghold of Konosgard, leader of a glorious new age in Vadergard. All hail the dwarven king, protector of man. Thus, these people seem a little friendlier for all the good it did them. So maybe this is how the king got into power? Just restart the checkpoint before you defeated the last wolf to practice, just a thought. Nah, you know, you're right, I would usually do that, but if I have to do that, that means the game is like not, you know, th the game is not like doing its what it has to do. You know what I mean? Oh, you know what? I should level up something. Uh, I think Atreus doesn't have anything new I can level him up with. I got 7,000 EXP. I could level up my um, runes, but I gotta go to Brock to do that, right? This one is pretty cool, man. Damn. Sweeping enemies is also pretty dope, I guess. Okay, what's this? Oh. Okay. Yeah, what this is is a stun attack. This one's Guardian's Revenge. Switch stances by pausing momentarily after any barehanded attack. I don't understand what's the point of this one. I mean, it looks fancy and shit, but I don't know. It kind of looks... Then the final one is... I mean, it looks dope, but I don't know. Yeah, I'm not really impressed with like some of these uh, movesets. Okay, while evading, hold L forward and press R to perform a quick axe attack. Yeah, I don't know. I guess this one is cheap enough to buy, but... This one does like a lot of DPS damage, but you know... I feel like this game, you know, like once you start playing on Gimme God of War difficulty, is your light attacks are fucking useless, man. You gotta use your heavy attacks, your like executioner's cleave and shit like that. That would kind of make this move kind of like... I don't want to knock it till I try it, but because EXP points are so valuable that I don't want to fucking spend that shit. But I think eventually you might have enough EXP points to get everything, so, you know. Damn, I don't know, man. Yeah, the ram move is pretty dope. I think I'm gonna get this. I'm just curious. Curiosity is dangerous, boy. Okay, how do Stay you do focused. that? Okay, that was dope. Nice. Okay, I'm gonna do that. Uh, which way again? I think that's where we came from, right? Oh, wait. Oh, you got another thing here. Read it. Yes, sir. I like that. Call me sir. Vader Dalvin. Yes, sir. It means hunting death. Yeah. Right. Hunting death. Hunting death. Does this mean someone died during a hunt or they were literally hunting death? Sounds rough either way. <laughs> Can I answer that question you have about unlocking all the skills? Yeah, can you can you answer? I think you will, right? It makes more sense that they would give you like all the abilities instead of like, you know. Yeah, you know, yeah, I guessed it. Uh, 
Uh oh. Wow. Whoa, what the fuck? Ah, oh, damn. Why is this guy's corpse like so fresh? He they got flies over that shit. Oh, that's because we are no longer going to a cold area, right? Like once we go to warmer regions. Oh, wait. Whoa, this guy got scorched. You see like how his corpse is like burned? Just in case you're worried about not getting to use certain stuff. Yeah, you're right. If that's the case, I might as well get like some more skills. Um Damn. While evading hold L forward to R1 to perform a quick axe attack. Hmm. I don't know. I'll just hold on to my EXP for now. Damn, I love that feeling. I guess I might call the stream right here, Fox. I've been streaming for six and a half hours. I guess in total, I guess it would be almost like seven hours. I am really tired right now, to be honest, but I, I wish I could play some more, but you know, uh, I, do, I don't think I'm going to be delivering a very quality stream. Like I'm going to be making a lot of mistakes and I'm going to like not be as entertaining. I just want to say a special thank you to everyone again for like, um, you know, really like, um, you know, showing up, get some rest yet. I appreciate that. And also a big shout out to Jenny Suri, man. Jenny Suri was a really nice, um, you know, new viewer we have in chat. Very, um, what's the word for it? Very friendly. Yeah. Yeah. I had, I had so much fun today. So. All right, let me pull up my schedule real quick just to let you guys know when I'll be back. So as usual, I won't be streaming during the weekend because, you know, weekends, I take the weekends off. I'll be back, you know, on the first stream of the week at these days and times based on your time zone. So, you know, take a look at which where, where you live and I'll be I'll be live around that time. Um, I think the first stream of the week is going to be some Hitman Hitman game. Um. I really had so much fun at Sapienza the last time. That was really dope. There was I, I I have this tendency of like putting myself in like fucking hairy situations. You gotta admit, right, Fox? Like the fact that I flush Zelda Master Mode shows how fucking bad it was. Cause I don't like easy shit. I love difficult shit. You know what I mean? Damn. Uh, Fox as well, she did manage to dodge the band hammer in the first few minutes, so she's beating the, beating the odds. You're right. Janissary did, I don't know if it's a he, him or a her. Could be a her. Oh shit. I think she's a streamer. Yo, Janissary, you in chat, bro? Oh, Janissary is, uh, a girl. I really thought Janissary was a dude. Cause she, she was calling me bro and shit. And I was like, alright, man. Yo, Janice, are you in chat? Damn, Janice, how long you been streaming, man? Yo, I, I was assuming too, man, because girls don't exist on the internet. <laughs> Just saw Jen and presume. Yeah, I, I, you know, I kind of like hold my judgment for that because like I, I have had incidents where I misjudged a girl for a guy and a guy for a girl. So. You know how I do. Always making mistakes. Swinging for the fences. Making judgment calls. Yeah, man. I hope you guys enjoyed today's stream. Um, if you miss today's stream, it's going to be available on uh, YouTube in 24 hours. So, um, unlike the last time, this time whenever I up upload my VODs to YouTube, I'm going to like upload them 24 hours after the stream is done and that's because there is a rule that all twitch affiliates cannot post their content uh 24 hours immediately after their stream because it's like um exclusivity um thing right so 
if you guys are wondering if why you can't see like today's stream on my YouTube, that's because you gotta wait for twenty four hours. It's gonna be it's gonna be there. I, I set a time for it and everything. And um, yeah, man. I'm gonna be back with Hitman Three, and you know, obviously we're still playing Hitman One. We're doing the full trilogy on Master Mode, and um, the next mission that we're doing on Hitman Three is at Marrakesh, Morocco, and uh, it's gonna be like really lit because we gotta have to assassinate two targets. Grim Mug, what it do, man? Thank you for explaining that. Yeah, well, no problem, bro. I hope you enjoy today's stream, man. I mean, do you guys have any questions? I can still hang out and chat, chop it up with you guys, man. But because, um, I just want, want to take it easy. I don't want to play any more God of War. I've been playing like seven hours of this shit. So my brain is like yelling at me like, Hey, bruh. You know what I mean? Do you guys, do you guys know if you can tell like how many times you died? Does the game actually record like your stats? I don't think the game record records your stats, right? Grim Mug says I just logged on, so I'll let you know in 24 hours. I got you, I got you. Um, oh, it's gonna be having nightmares today about nightmares. Yeah, I fucking hate those things. I think the number one issue I have with those things is like, I would just say it's more like beginner like uh, struggles. Because I'm not doing that much damage, and so they seem like really like tough. But eventually, once my Leviathan axe or I can do like more damage, like I level up, I think I can probably kill them in like one hit or something, and they probably won't be like no problems. Yeah, but I might be having nightmares with them. I, I think I'll upload that that entire fight we did properly as a highlight clip. So remember that 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 fight we have with the two nightmares. Before we fight the big golem. Yeah, I'm going to upload that as a highlight. No stats, unfortunately. Man, this game is posy. They don't want to hurt people's feelings. That's why they took out the stats. Um, Yeah, man. I'm I'm going to be trying to work this weekend. Trying to like animate some emotes. It's going to take a while. But uh, I, really, I really appreciate you guys like watching my stream. I see that counter is probably within 10 or so accurate. Okay, wait, do you think it's under or it's over? Like, do you think I should have add, added more? Give or take? Should I add 10 more or I think it's, I think it's pretty accurate. I actually added like a, a, an additional five more deaths just in case. Just leave it. All right, you good. You, you're right. You're right. Yeah, because every time I die, I have to manually like plus one, plus one. Definitely close enough. Yeah. You know what's funny? The first time I played um, Demon Souls, I or I think the first time I played Demon Souls or Dark Souls, right? It was around that number 130, 120, 130, 140. That means I've died more in God of War than in Dark Souls, man. But I took Dark Souls incredibly seriously, man. Because it was my first time into the series, so I didn't want to like fuck around. But I gotta admit, in God of War, I was, I was like messing around a little bit. You know, I, w I didn't really focus sometimes. So, yeah, man. Let me save. Let me do a quick save. So, I hope you guys enjoyed today's stream. Um, I'm gonna be available on Discord or Twitter. So, if you guys haven't joined the Discord community and you guys wanna like, uh, let me know what you think, because I, I'm still looking for feedback for my sub badges community channel points things like that you guys gotta give me some time to so slowly add more content to my streams and uh i really would like some suggestions so if you guys have any dope suggestions of what you would, would like to see on the stream uh do let me know you know and uh let me see what should we ask the crystal ball today Uh, what's a good question? Overlay? I was thinking of an overlay, Fox, but I don't know what to put on the overlay. Because I feel like whenever I watch someone's stream, they have like too much shit going on, right? They have like new followers, new subscribers, and I, I understand that it's 
very important to recognize your people but from a from a purely entertainment aspect if you're watching like a game like you're watching a game like would you really want to see like it being cluttered up it creates more of the brand effect yeah you're right I don't know if I like what what kind of overlay I would like to add you much prefer a clean look so do I so do I. I was actually thinking like, you know, maybe I should create some overlays for like special events. Like if there's Halloween, I can have some pumpkins on the fucking or like Christmas, we can have a mistletoe. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's a lot of effort to do that shit, man. But, uh, you know, all in good time. Did I save? Let me see. Will I be able to beat this game in under 10, 200 deaths. No. Oh shit. Yo, he's he's really uh fucking <laughs> What the fuck? Man? Come on, bro. That's mad disrespectful. Considering your art background, you can at least do it yourself. Yeah, I could. You know? I, I'm just gonna be real, man. It, it it's it's not easy, like, being a one-man show. You know what I mean? Like, a lot of people would consider streaming, like, really easy because they feel like all you're really doing is you're playing a game, right? But there's a lot that goes behind the scenes of, like, trying to make it as a content creator. You know, I gotta create, like, highlight clips. I gotta do my thumbnails. Um, I gotta create, like, content for off-stream. And on top of that, I got to like make all the sub badges and emotes and like being a one man show is really, really like, you know, if I, if I really become rich or I become like, you know, famous enough while I'm doing Twitch, I would like to hire people like video editors or like uh, sound people. And that way I can just focus on streaming. I can just like stream eight hours, seven days a week because I don't have to do that extra shit off stream. You know what I mean? People pay big money for a good overlays. Yeah, I guess so. Fox, do you do you do you think if I did some overlays, it would make the stream more professional? Like I have some, like I have a border around the stream, shit like that. I guess at least like if I'm gonna have like borders and stuff, I should try to make it minimalistic. Like you look at the death counter at the bottom left corner of the screen, it looks like so minimalistic, right? You can tell the information, and it's like clean you know I might take chat off the screen that might actually work I've been actually thinking of like if this was actually a good idea see if I took chat away from the stream like is it better the reason why I kept chat on this on the screen was because you know in the future when I upload my VODs to YouTube I would like the people of YouTube to still be able to see like what the people in chat were saying, right? It's more clean, right? But think about this, Fox. The chat box actually contains the memories of like what you said and what like Cinekeith said. Yeah, it, it's kind of like you guys were here. You guys said shit that made me laugh. You guys, you know, talk some mad shit, right? And it's forever going to be immortalized here because this video is recorded. So once it's on YouTube, it's going to be there forever, right? If I took away the chat, like that's why I made it so small, you know? Um, yeah, if I took away the chat, it, it would have been, it would be a little bit sad, you know? I think the day will come where I might remove chat if the chat is fucking crazy. That, you know, I don't really have, like, a intimate connection with my viewers anymore. You know what I mean? <sighs> Bro, I've, I, to be honest with you guys, I've given up on the idea of, like, you know, like, if I'll ever make it as a streamer. Like, whatever I'm doing right now, I'm just trying to do it for the love of the game. I'm just, like, really, like, trying to, like, just keep me interested. You know what I mean? Just try to like be the best streamer I can be and not expect 
anything out of this. Yeah, sure, go ahead. You've been always asking me tough questions. You should never feel bad of as, as asking questions. I've been like super open about everything, bro. Like I'm like literally like, I literally told you guys like I almost like fucking hooked up with the fucking tranny. Thank God that shit didn't happen. You know what I mean? That would be a fucking bad look. <laughs> Come on, man. Like you can ask me anything, man. Fox says, uh, do you think uploading five hours streams to YouTube is the way? I don't think it's a very desirable content that people on YouTube would like to watch. It's not that desirable compared to like five minute clips, two minute clips, highlight videos and all that. It's not that desirable, but it's still content. You know what I mean? It's like the beauty of like having that vod on youtube is like i can always go back on it and like watch like you know or you guys can always go back and watch like what i did in red dead redemption 2 or you guys can see the original like um dark souls 1 playthrough you know like it's like it's like a good memory of like what we did because i i've actually like been told by like very close friends like streamer friends that i look up to they, they told me like hey you know like what you're doing on youtube is not that like it's kind of like whatever you know because like they personally feel that when you upload something to youtube you should upload fresh content right and i believe in that but i don't have the time or energy to do that right like i i stream like six seven eight hours on stream and then once i'm done i have to on top of that create new content so I'll, I'll give you an example of like something that really worked that i kind of was surprised and i kind of went back to like my old friends who were kind of doubting the whole youtube thing so for example right um my close friend and mentor on twitch his name is nato potato he is a twitch streamer and before I even became a streamer, I used to watch him as a viewer. He's incredibly entertaining. He's very kind and he's successful. He is a partner. He would average about a hundred viewers uh, per stream. And he is what I considered a guy who made it. Um, and he would give me a lot of advice. And one of the advice he gave me was he said that I shouldn't make my webcam vid uh, my webcam face this big. He said I should make it smaller. And I didn't agree with him. I, I, I told him like when people are going to click into your streams, the first thing that they're going to see is they're going to see my face. And because like my face is so prominent on the stream, that's the first thing they're going to click. And he disagreed. And months later, I actually caught him doing the same thing that I was doing. Right. And so one of the other things that he also like advised me on is that you know, I shouldn't just upload my VODs on YouTube. You know, I should put in more effort into my content. And I agree. But I think he was kind of like... He kind of meant that... Do not upload your VODs at all on YouTube. Which I really disagree. Because... One of the biggest, like... Playthroughs that I've ever uploaded on YouTube. That it's like the most successful on my channel. Was the Yakuza series. I recorded the entire Yakuza 0 playthrough and I, you know, I didn't have the foresight. I just did beautiful thumbnails. I did part one all the way to the end, right? And how I promoted that playthrough was to cut up little highlight clips of me doing funny shit in Yakuza. I didn't know that like a year later, PewDiePie would actually like make Yakuza become a meme. And all of a sudden that highlight video that I made I think it was the Bakamitai video. It had like 60,000 views. And all of a sudden, like my Yakuza playthrough has a minimum of 4,000 views per video. I was getting people like coming to my stream and be like, yo, I came from your Yakuza streams, uh, your Yakuza playthrough. And that was like the time I literally could prove my friend wrong. Like, hey, you didn't knew what you were talking about, right? It's always good to have content than not to have content. Like, I, I would say, like, it's probably better to have supplementary content on top of old shit. And I think that's what you're saying, Fox, because I think I want to have more supplementary content. But it's it's a fucking marathon, man. 
Uh, Foxies, I love watching them myself, but I presume most who visit YouTube want a quick fix. It also plays more into the al algorithm. Yeah, you're right. They want to see shorts. They want to see... Like, one of my most successful videos I ever did on YouTube was just like a month ago. I, I made like a 30 second short, which was... Uh, it was like a video of me juking all the zombies in Resident Evil Code Veronica. Within 24 hours, I got 2,000 views. I was shocked, right? I would only get like 10 views per video, well, usually in these streams. So I tried doing other shorts, but not every short is successful. So it's kind of like playing the lottery a little bit. Yeah, it was a great moment. I can honestly and openly say that your highlight videos are incredible. Your editing is top tier, but I also understand how much work it is. Yeah, it is. So, like, check this out, right? Like, so right now, it's today's a Friday. It's 5 p.m. And it's getting late, right? So I have Saturday and Sunday to do something before I start streaming again. Right now, I have two choices. Do I want to work on my stream emotes and channel points? Or do I want to create a highlight video? Right? I can't do both. <laughs> and it's, it fucking sucks because I know both those things are great. But I, I can't. It, 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 it fucking. And I just wish I had, I can afford to hire like a, a video editor and people that can help me with this, but it's expensive, man. You know? And I don't want to be one of those people that don't pay their editors or, you know, artists. Yeah. So I have a choice this um, weekend. I could create another highlight video, which is fucking dope, but you guys wouldn't have animated emotes. You know, would you guys prefer animated emotes or like better, like short content? You know, honestly, like, what do you guys think? Like, do you guys prefer, like, more content or you guys want more value on the stream? That means, like, I got to focus on more, like, adding sound effects. Like, what you guys mentioned, like, I got to, like, try to use my channel points to create alerts in horror games. So once I start playing Resident Evil 8, you, get, you guys have, like, the opportunity to, like, like, jump scare me or, like, fuck me up. You know what I mean? I think that's way more fun. Yeah, I should work on that, man. I should work on that. It's like, it's exciting to be a content creator, but it's also incredibly lonely and like fucking tons of work. But, uh, you know, you guys make it really worth it, man. And I, I really appreciate you guys. So, hey, man, if you guys uh, have any suggestions, hit, hit up my Discord. But I think I'll call it right here, Fox. Thank you so much for hanging out. Just remember not to overwhelm yourself. There's no rush. Yeah. I'll try to make good use of my time though. Like I, I try to spend at least like four to five hours during the weekend, like trying to do something good for my stream. Whether that's like creating YouTube thumbnails, um, you know, yeah, I'm super proud of my YouTube thumbnail for my uh, God of War. It took me like a lot of work to do this. Right? You guys may not notice this, but I, I actually increased the size of Kratos in this, um, in this thumbnail. He's not to proportion. He's actually bigger because I wanted the thumbnail to look like really good. Right? Thank you. Thank you, Fox. I try. So clean, right? I want to show you guys like some other like thumbnails I, I worked on. Let me see what are the thumbnails I worked on. I think I showed you guys the Hitman one. I, I have a I have a Demon Souls thumbnail. Cause I do anticipate that I'll be streaming Demon Souls obviously, so like this is the Demon Souls thumbnail, right? I haven't added more details, like you know, usually I make the my like the avatar at the left corner, like he kind of looks like he's in the game. He's kind of scuffed up. Like I would kind of like at least put like a minimal effort to make him you know, like I have a Hitman thumbnail and I have like the character, like, like my avatar is wearing a suit. And it's kind of stupid, man. Like I'm not actually even creating like short content. I'm just like trying to make the thumbnail attractive enough for people to like click it. That's how like sad it is. I spend like an entire weekend just trying to create thumbnails 
just so that people would click the playthrough. And then clicking the playthrough, they might be like, you know, they might come here to the Twitch. But there's like one key pe uh, missing, missing ingredient, which is the uh, highlight clips. So I got to get back to doing that. But on top of that, I got to learn how to emote, uh, animate my emotes, do a new sub badge, which is, which is for two year subscriptions for you guys, add channel point rewards. Yeah, I'll, I'll do it slowly, man. And anyway, thank you for listening to my fucking ramblings, man. It's not, honestly, you know, let me take that back. You know, streaming is not that fucking hard. You know, I, I'm not like laying bricks in, you know, fucking Afghanistan or Bangladesh. Like, I'm not fucking putting an iPhone together or an iPad in China, you know, jumping off the window, bouncing on the net and only to be like ricocheting back into the fucking factory. I'm not doing that. This is way better than that. And that's why I'm really grateful and I'm not going to like fuck this up. So thank you guys. I hope you guys stay safe out there. Treat yourself. And uh, yeah, see you guys next week, man. Thank you so much for watching. You know, if you haven't already, click that follow button. If you're watching this on YouTube in the far future, like, comment, subscribe. Catch me whenever I go live at twitch.tv slash TV. Oh, wait, let me see. Foxes, do you think more would click on them if they knew they were going to see a highlight clip of your whole playthrough in like a 10 minute vid? That's possible. See, the, the problem with like creating a highlight clip of a, of an entire playthrough is you gotta scrub through 30 hours of gameplay. Like say like, okay, so say I complete like God of War, right? I, I did this in 50 hours, right? I gotta scrub through 50 hours of content to find, you know, 10 minutes. That means like I have to rewatch my streams. Usually when you edit your videos, like I, I don't remember sometimes like what happens or what was interesting or maybe something funny I said. Funny and exciting bits. I see the streamers time stemming points as they play. Oh, you do? Is that what they do? I didn't know they did that. Maybe I should do that. I'm going to timestamp my shit. You're right. Okay, you, you got a point. Timestamp your streams. Actually, that makes sense. I have a, I have a timer on my program that actually lets me know exactly at what point I am in the, in the video. So I can do that. That's how I used to do it, Fox. Didn't you know? Like when I used to like create highlight videos, I would like open up, um, you know, like, like, like one of my streams and I would like kind of like scrub through the video and I would try to remember what I did there or what I sit there. And it would be a fucking nightmare, man. I, I, I must have been working backwards. Real talk. Like I used to like fucking work dumb, not smart. Boss clips, epic funny deaths and moments. Yeah. Yeah. I gotta remember that. Yo, that this is going to be a new practice on my streams. I'm going to have this notepad. And whenever I, I think of something like, oh, I did something crazy. Uh, you guys let me know, you know, I, I'll, I'll let myself know and I'll, I'll, I'll write it down. And every day I can create, oh, oh, you know what I did back in the day, which was so cool. This was actually super useful to building up my streams. I used to create one minute videos. And I actually did that with, um, I did that with Hitman. I, I, I'm, I don't know if you guys have watched this clip. It's on my YouTube. But I'm gonna like post it right here. Um, I mean, this is not like one of my best work because I was kind of rushing it. So this is not the quality of like what you would expect like from... Um... Shit, where is that fucking clip? Oh no, did I delete it? I might have deleted it. Yeah, I might have deleted it. It's on my YouTube though. I recently released like a one minute uh, highlight clip uh, of my Hitman 3 playthrough. It was pretty funny because I was like, I was like talking mad shit. I was like beating up on Santa. Yeah, I think it was the highlight clip of me like fucking up Santa. Fox is like, there has to be a reason so many click on your RE short that game is 20 years old. Yeah. 
I think there's a huge community behind RE. Definitely. I gotta do better, man. <sighs> Alright guys, I gotta call it right here, man. Thank you, Fox, for all your feedback. I really appreciate it. I mean, you guys can be as honest as you want with me. Don't ever feel bad for for calling me out. Like, even shit, like, if you guys feel like I swear too much, or you guys feel like I talk shit too much, let me know. Because I, I gotta kind of, like, see it from your point of view. You know what I mean? I'm not gonna entirely change my whole personality for it, but I, I at least kind of know, like, what's happening. So, yeah, man. I really want you to have more success. Oh, uh, thank you. Yo, you too, man, Fox. Yeah, I, I really do feel that way. I, 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 I'm at that stage or point in my life, whenever I see someone more successful than me, I don't even feel fucking jealous. I swear to God. I really do feel like that person worked his his or her ass off to be there. Right? That's why like when people hate on like Pokimane or like Dr. Disrespect, you know, I don't even have that much stream hours compared to them. I haven't even been in the game long enough. You have charisma, that's the key, I could never do it. Oh man, thank you. Thank you. Yeah, I pumped the full 10 points into my charisma build back when I was a baby. You know? Thank you, bro. Anyway, guys, uh, I'm gonna call it right here. Stay safe and uh, I'll be back soon, man. And hit me on my Discord. Any suggestion on Twitter, Discord, just fucking spam me. Just tell me like, yo, do this, do that, and I'll just like, do it. Thank you, guys. See you, Fox. Shout out to everyone again, man. Take care, guys. Peace.